Hey, look, uh, hey, we're playing Danganronpa, so it's a black screen, right? Memories. Danganronpa and black screen. Name a more iconic duo. Do 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 do. Yeah, so Danganronpa V3 does not like being alt tabbed out. So, give me a second. It does not like it at all. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. <clears throat> oh, man, I'm so behind on my messages. I'm sorry if you're waiting for me to get back to you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Um, Live with Danganronpa V3. The V stands for virgin. Alright, there we go. Do 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 Alright, so I watched I watched the anime. I watched I watched Ding and Rumpa 3 the anime. I haven't finished it yet though, I'm gonna finish it probably tonight and tomorrow. Um, let me just get my window set up properly and then I can start the game and we can actually have some, 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 uh, visuals on the screen. Uh, like I said, and if you just got here, uh, Danganronpa V3 does not like being alt-tabbed. So I'm trying to get my window set up first so I don't have to alt-tab it. But, um, actually, you know what? You guys shouldn't, shouldn't be able to tell. So it should be fine. Let's, let's just do it. Because it, it captures the window, so you guys shouldn't care. It'll care for me, though. It'll care for me. I'll care, though. It's a, little, it's a little bittersweet, I'm not going to lie. This is the last one. There are no more after this. This is the end. The end. All right, so how does it sound compared to me? Volume is the same as it always is, but who knows. There's some weird static in the sky there. Reminds me of uh, opening of uh, Neuromancer. Do, 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 do. Lower it a little bit. Hold on. Let, let, let me get into the into the thing. Uh, we didn't play the demo version. We're not going to. Sorry to disappoint anybody. We're gonna play with English because we're normies. And extra. What's extra? What's option? Can I can I put it into windowed mode? Do, 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 do. Map display. Execute. Alright, let's turn the volume. Alright, is that better? I thought you were going to do the anime. Um, we said uh, a, a couple streams ago that we're not going to do it because it wasn't free. Um, I, I, I have no problem paying for anime, and I did pay for anime. I, I paid for a subscription on Funimation to, to, to watch it. Um, people could have gotten away with a free trial and, and, and watched the whole thing. But um, that was too too big of a barrier of entry, in my opinion, f f to ask so many people to, to do that first stream. And I figured that most people wouldn't, so we, we didn't bother. It was already trouble to set up anyway. I have no problem paying for it. I have no problem paying for anything if, if it's if it's you know time and, and effort went into it. Alright, so sorry I'm all over the place. Um, uh, I released the video today and I was doing some uh, caretaking with that right before, right up to stream. Starting thing around for V3 Killing Harmony, translate the tweet, says Twitter. Yeah, I'm not surprised about that. I'm not surprised about that. Uh, thank you, Zarek Havanex, for the, for the 11,037 bits. 
Uh, V3 is my second most hated work of fiction ever, but the memes must go on. Really? What? Is it that bad? Holy shit, thank you so much for all the bits, though. Holy fuck, is it really that bad? Thank you, Zarek Havanax. Uh, I'm gonna go through my list and I'll say thank you again. But thank you for keeping the meme alive. Is it really that bad? This this is the most divisive one, right? Some people hate this one, some people like it the most. I have a feeling I'm gonna like it the most, because I, I, I have a sneaking suspicion that it's going to completely obliterate everything that came before it. The V in front of the three makes me think that it's gonna it's it's basically gonna do a giant <laughs> to all the story that came before it and i don't give a shit about the story that came before it so you know like i, I like the mystery so I, I feel like i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna i'm gonna like it but we'll see anyway um so yeah we have the music on um can you guys see the stream just fine Why is it... Why... Why is the resolution off? Is that because it's not full screen? Oh, there you go. Okay, so you guys can tell when it's not full screen. That's terrifying. Oh, man. Okay, so every time I'll tab out, it's going to fuck up a little bit. I'm not happy about that. And the music's still a little loud, isn't it? Let's see. All right, turn down a little bit. Should, should be a little bit better. Okay, so let me tell you about the anime. Let me let me let me tell you about the anime. And uh, you know what? Let's let's actually get let's watch the intro, and we'll have some we'll have have our, our pretty waifu is you um, face while while we're talking um, instead of that. All right. So logic difficulty mean action difficulty mean. We played it we played it mean last time. Uh, so that's what we'll stick to. All right. So here we go. Let's watch the intro. Do, 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 This bear! This bear! Dangan Rampa! Spoilers! Damn, there's a lot, a lot of characters in this game. There's the anime. There's the an I've watched that. I've watched 12 episodes of that. And I regret them all. The story is not over. A new killing game will begin again. I didn't watch I didn't watch all the episodes. I only watched the first half. I ran out of time. I just I, I decided to, you know, spend Halloween with, with, with the boys. They were they were very, very cute and they had a good time. We had a lot of trick or treaters. Nothing. No light, no sound, no form, no voice, no knowledge of who I am. Who am I? Who am I? I extend a hand, a hand that belongs to no one, because I cut it off Junko's corpse and attached it to take hold of my existence. Ah! This is me. We're the waifu. We're the waifu. Waifu is you. Waifu is you. It's waifu Joe. We're the waifu. What a twist. What a twist. We're the waifu. Oh man. Okay, so let's let we have a lot to talk about before we start. So it's probably gonna take us about 10-20 minutes. So if you don't give a shit about my my bullshit, my bullshit is talking about the previous games, talking about the anime, talking about what I know about this game already, uh, that, that sort of thing. If you don't care about my bullshit, you can go away and come back, and then and then we'll start. But we're probably gonna be talking for a little while because you know how it is when, when when we get to the beginning of games. So first th first things first, because this is the most important thing. I am pleased to report that I do not know anything about this game. Nothing has been spoiled for me. 
okay? Nothing has been spoiled for me, except for one thing. No, nothing has been spoiled for me, all right? So we're good, all right? There, there, there we are. Um, if I'm gonna relax on reading bits um, when they first come in. So if there ever is a spoiler in, in bits, just please, you know, shout out yo don't don't read that or tell lily and lily come downstairs and tell me or the mods or whatever so so so, so we'll see <clears throat> so we should we should be fine so i don't i don't know anything second of all so i watched the anime how is the sound right now is it too loud he doesn't know about will smith oh god damn okay i'm sorry i i, I guess i do know some stuff now i do so i do know some some stuff right now okay so uh i watched the anime and I have to tell you guys that it's 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 a cautionary tale. Here's a cautionary tale about about Joe watching anime because I was low on time, right? I was low on time because I was finishing the video. I I I, I spent Halloween with with, with the kids, um, and so so night falls and I'm and I'm all that's all that's done. The video's uploaded. I can watch some anime in preparation for 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 today. And uh, L L Lily goes to bed, you know. Lily goes to bed and she's like, "Hey, you, you coming to bed, Joe? Joe, you coming to bed?" Lily says, "Joe, you coming to bed?" And I say, "No, Lily, I have to watch anime." Cautionary tale, okay? Because that was just the beginning, okay? That was just the beginning. Hey, Joe, come to bed. Come to bed, Joe. No, I have to watch anime, okay? Then I'm up late watching anime, okay? I'm up late watching anime. So now I get up late. Now I'm behind schedule. Now I can't have my morning shower. So I've turned down sex to watch anime. I haven't had a shower. And to top it all off, my nose has been bleeding all morning. All morning my nose has been bleeding. Both nostrils. I don't even know that was possible. Both nostrils has been bleeding. Cautionary tale. Don't watch anime. Don't don't watch anime ever. All right, so I watched. There are 24 episodes, I think, in the anime. I've watched 12, and the the only good things about them are that um, is is the intro music on the future arc, and that that's actually pretty good pretty good music, and that Aoi is in it, and and she's like stunning as always. Um, so. I'm not going to talk about the anime too much because I haven't finished it yet, and there's a lot of problems that I'm hoping are going to be addressed by the end, which of course they won't be. But um, I'm not going to, I'm not going to talk about it too much because because of those reasons I don't want to like rail on it when when there when there could be explanations. But um, it's really fucking dumb. It's it's really 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 fucking dumb. Not only is it dumb in a way that it, it is like internally dumb, it's really dumb because it ruins the games that came before because the anime goes completely balls to the wall fucking bullshit with well we can just scale the sides of buildings and blow up rooms and 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 uh, and nadai can take a shit that that basically creates a crater in the earth and and all this other bullshit and it's like it's there's a girl that can take some medicine and become a fucking werewolf you know it's it's like it's complete bullshit whereas the games for, for as anime bullshit as they are especially when it comes to junko um, the cases themselves are very grounded. They're they're very like okay, well, uh, like when when how how did they scale that window that wall to get to the window? It's it's very much well they couldn't jump because there's human limitations. Um, it may, they may not make sense ultimately, but they're still there. You know what I mean? Whereas in the anime, it would be not only did they not have to get anything and jump out the window, they also blew up the whole house and then rebuilt it with a replica with materials that they scavenged in the forest nearby because they're the the ultimate fucking replica builder secretly. You know, it's it's just it's fucking stupid. It's so fucking stupid. But yeah. Um, however, I will say this: that it was cool seeing them animated. It was really really cool seeing that, and I and I enjoyed that part of it. Uh, I think some of them had the same voice actors too, and I thought that was interesting. Um, not enough Danny, for sure. Da Danny is has been, you know, demoted to just like a couple scenes here and there, and I'm and I'm upset, I'm upset about that. Um, but it was really cool seeing them animated and, and the, the characters that I, that I surprisingly like more than I realized. Um, that that's been kind of cool. Um, and I also um, really like the concept 
of the two narrative lions. So if you don't know the anime, lucky you, uh, there are two there are two lines. One's called Future Arc, and the other one is called Despair Arc. And you're supposed there are twelve episodes in each line, so it's like a different it's like two different seasons of a show. Except you're supposed to alternate between watching one and the other. So you watch Future, then Despair, episode one of each. Then you watch episode two, Future, episode two, Despair. Then then Future, Despair, Future, Despair, Future, Despair, all the way through. And I really like that. There's 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 different there's different versions of of what's going on, and they link and they intersect sometimes, but um, they're on different timelines. Uh, at least for now they are. Um, and I really, really like that concept. I think it's interesting and I think it's very creative. However, the Despair arc is a waste of fucking time. In some ways, it's the more enjoyable of the two because it's the more entertaining. But there, very, very often I would watch the Despair arc and, I, and at the end of it, as the credits are rolling, I'd be like, I could have just skipped this. This is, this is, this is dumb. Like, nothing happened, you know? Or it's just recapping the, the, um... The, the events of the game, even though it was more entertaining. Um, the, the future arc is complete fucking bonkers stupid. It is so dumb. They, they, again, I don't want to get into it because, 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 because of, because I don't know the ending yet, but it has such cool ideas, but they don't re really go anywhere well with them, you know? Uh, they're in a killing game again. Um, Monokuma has come back and taken over the the um, the Future Foundation and has locked all the the leaders of the Future Foundation in in the building with Makoto, uh, Kyoko, um, Aoi, and a, a cast of new characters, and they're all killing each other. And this the way they win the game. They win the game by so every, every two hours everyone falls asleep. The, the sleeping gas comes out and, and and makes them all fall asleep, or it's injected in their bracelets or something. They all have bracelets on. Um, so I'm not explaining it well. So Monokuma takes over the facility by attacking it and then releasing sleeping gas, which makes everyone go to sleep. And when they wake up, um, one of them is dead and they have bracelets on. And the bracelets may inject some sleeping sleeping serum into them every two hours. And the way they win the game is that every two hours when everyone's asleep, one person gets to wake up. The, the Monokuma wakes them up and says, you can kill someone if you want and get away with it. But if you don't kill someone, the game ends and you all get to leave. And that's how they win, at least how I understand it. On top of that, the bracelet says a forbidden action that uh, each character can't do something or else they die. So Makoto's is that he's not, a run he's not allowed to run in the hallway. Whereas someone else's was... And I, I swear to God, and this is the first one to die, and this sort of shows you how fucking stupid these bracelet forbidden actions are. Not allowed to witness violence. So right away, someone else, some, two people get into a fight because they're annoyed that they've been locked into this place. They start hitting each other, and the guy just fucking dies. Not allowed to witness violence. It's, it's not even like, oh, you're not allowed. It's, it's something that you can't do. It's, it's that... <sighs> Oh, fucking hell fucking hell there okay the, the so yeah it's a cool i like the idea of the forbidden actions that's really cool but it's it's so fucking stupid it's so dumb but yeah i i really really like the the idea of the forbidden actions and yeah but anyway so we'll see what happens we'll see how it ends and i don't know yet who's killing them or what's going on um there's a lot of bullshit to it um yeah there was a fake out death where a character a character gets gets stabbed right between um right between her owies i don't want to tell you who it is i'm being vague on purpose so yeah she gets stabbed right between her her beautiful gorgeous owies um and and this episode ends with oh my god the owner of the owies is dead and and she, she she's been stabbed maybe it's maybe it was owie maybe it wasn't um anyway and, and that's how the episode ends and you're like oh no and then and then so then you go watch the the the, the different arcs so you have a whole episode to think about it and then you go back to the future arc and then uh, and then makoto goes goes over to the owie shaped corpse who may or may not be owie and 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 is like smells and then realizes that it's tomato sauce i think it was tomato sauce maybe it was like strawberry jam but i think it was tomato sauce it's tomato sauce and the knife is a fake knife and it's one of those things that just goes in and it's just being planted between her owies so 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 the the, the fake knife goes into the hilt right and so it's it's a fake someone else is dead nearby instead right but here's the thing it's 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 never fucking addressed it's like it's it's never been like hey what was that about i don't know like it's ne it's never brought back up 
It's it's never like, hey, who did that to you, Owie? Oh, I don't, I don't. Uh, sorry, uh, Owie shaped person. I don't, I don't know. I don't know who did it. Like it's it's the. It's it's just it, we're, we're six episodes. Pe pe people in chat are saying it, it's addressed later. Yeah, but the character should be asking. The character should be fucking asking. Like it's it's not it's not just addressed that it hasn't been explained. It also hasn't been addressed that Makoto hasn't gone. Hey, Owie shaped person. What the fuck was that about? You know, like it's it's like. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so <laughs> all right. So very quickly, let me go. Let me go through all the messages, and then and then and then we'll start. Um, uh, I'm just gonna say thank you to to the subs and stuff that came in today. Um, so because because my list is usually bugged. So if you subbed when the stream is down, sorry about that. Uh, the anime it has been has been uh, interesting though. I've never watched an anime before, and and um, it, it does have some some appeal. I, I I think I kind of almost get why people like it, because it can do things that that you know um, a live action can't. But it's it's okay. It, it, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. It's okay. Anyway, uh, thank you, Ferga Gergler Gasper Gaderg. All right, I'm not gonna say that name again for the new sub. Welcome to the Dragon Stand. Thanks so much. Thank you, the Revolution One, f for the sub. Thank you, Sandy Pants One. Thank you, Nick Zinzelmeyer. Thank you. It only takes Zvi. Thank you to the four of you for for the new subs. Welcome to the Dragon Stand. Welcome to the Rubber Dub Sub Club. Thank you very much. Thank you, Barty Barty Ox for the three month sub. Yay! Finally, I love V3, even the ending. Uh oh. So I hope you won't dislike it too much. By the way, what's your opinion on survey program? Will you stream it? I haven't played it. I haven't had time. Um, I might stream it. I don't know. I wasn't even sure if I was allowed to stream it, but yeah, I was too busy yesterday with with other things. Yeah. Thank you for the resub, Barty Ox. Thank you, Insane in the Train. A cool name. Thank you very much. Welcome to Dragon's Den. Dufres Dufresni. Fresni has Rooster Scar for four months. I remember I didn't say your name right last time, and I think I just said it again. Sorry about that. Let's start the stream on the right track with a Leon meme. Who's Leon? That being said, Joe, you might like this. In my country, we have a saying to, den to deny weeb affiliation. Ataku... Ataku Murto Abano Pa Mihurto. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What did I just say? Thank you, Dufresne. Uh Thank you, Dimming97, for the four minutes reset. Time for Dengan Rampa Re3. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Dimming. Uh, Mops96 is sub, sub Prime. Thank you very much. Welcome to Prime Time. Mops96. Thank you, V Ready. No, that's a, that's a V. V Red V for the new sub as well. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, V Red V. Dimming 97 use 100 bits to stay excited for V3, but are you watching the anime in the correct order? You have the alternate between two arcs, or else one of them completely spoils the other. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I, 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 I've been watching the right order. I'm halfway through. Yeah, I'll probably finish it tomorrow night. I'll watch some more tonight after the stream, and then I'll watch some more tomorrow night. Yeah. Cakewalking has use some bits to say. Zara Kavanax have bad opinions. V3 is just average. Uh oh, we're spamming. We're crip. We're crip. As, as soon as we go over a thousand viewers, that's it. We we, we, we we go full crip. Shashwami has resubscribed for two months with a heart uh, message. Thank you, much, Shashwami. Thank you. Uh, Harpo Kodal has resubscribed for three months. Hey Joe. Hey hey. V three is my favorite Dengan, and I hope you enjoy it too. Snake. I hope I enjoy it too. I've been really excited to play this. I've been looking forward to it for for like all all through October. Yep. Yeah, I'm really excited. So yeah, I'm 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 really looking forward to it. Uh, Peppy ninety one has subscriber prime. Welcome to prime time, Peppy ninety one. Thank you, thank you. Sorry that that uh, it took me a while to say thank you, everybody. By the way, we we, we we get talking and then I go through the list. So thank you, Peppy91. Hopefully you're still here. Digital Zeus says we subscribe for two months. Finally, we sub. Time to start from the beginning. Let's bury this fucking franchise. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. I get the impression that there might be a Dengen 4 at some point, but we'll see. It, it, it won't be for a while. I know they're working on a completely different game, but um, like maybe I just hope I hope there's a Dengen 4. Maybe I won't after this. Spiky Shrike has used 500 bits to say, okay, yesterday was Halloween, right? I saw a cute girl in a pink wig and dark... Is is this is this the Todd Howard has done it again? I saw a cute girl in a, in a pink wig and dark greenish jacket and skirt. After thinking on it a couple mi a couple minutes, I walked up to her and said, Hey, are you Chiaki? She said yes, and instead of saying, Oh, you look very nice or great costume, I said, I'm sorry, I know that, and left. <laughs> 
No! Can I work part time at the church cafe? No way! There's no way this happened. I want to believe. I want to believe this happened. That's amazing. That's fucking amazing. <laughs> I'm sorry, I know that. <laughs> Thank you, Spiky Shirt. <laughs> we like 1000 use 50 minutes to say. I wake up, Toriel drives me to school, I get into class late, and I'm told to pick a partner. I get paired up with the bully, Susie. We both get sent to get chalk from the supply closet. The door to the closet closed behind us. Everything goes black. The title fades in. Skyrim. Todd Howard has done it again. Toby Fox released a spiritual successor to Undertale called Delta and you should play it. It's about three hours long and free. Yep, I know all about it. I, I, I haven't had time to play it yet. Yep. Yep. Todd Howard has done it again. That's not spoilers, it's fine. Joe Joe Ruo has resubscribed for three months. Thank you very much, Joe Ruo. Thank you, thank you. Thank you also to Anton1699 for the two-month resub. Woo, just ten months until our first anniversary pod champ. And seven months until the stream, baby. Super, super, super. Mr. Driffitz. Driffid says use 100 bits to say, I'm so excited for this, I might even say a swear word. <gasps> Jesus shit, you son of a bitch. Thank you, Mr. Mr. Drif Drivitz. Uh, Roxanne Mixtape, cool name, uh, has subscribed with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Roxanne Mixtape. I still like that name. Hey, I am Infinity, has resubscribed for 13 months. Unlucky for some. Hey, hey, 13 months. Let's go. We're going to go. I, I'm almost done with the list. I, I can see the top. Thank you, hey, I am Infinity. Thank you so much. Zarek Havanax has used 100 bits. Um, why can't I see the other other bit message that you gave Zarek Havanax? Why is that gone? What? Oh, that's really not good. Oh no. Uh, Smear gave 3,333 bits, and that's not on my list either. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What else isn't on the list? Oh shit. Okay, uh, so thank you Zarek Kamenex for, for the um, 11,037 bits and the other 100 bits after that. Uh, with the message, does Canada land do daylight savings and how will it affect streams? Uh, it does, but I don't know when it goes into effect. Um, I haven't heard anything about it. Um, sorry that uh, my list is broken, guys. Um, thank you, Smear, as well, for, for, for the very generous bit donation. Um, I don't have your message. Can you say it in chat again with an at me for Smear? Yeah, Timmy, Timmy, you're not on list either. I see you've donated 500 bits. Thank, thank you for that. Sorry that you're not on list, guys. I don't know why it happened. I don't know why it happened. Yeah, sorry. I can see the end of the list now, though, but yeah, sorry about that. I'm upset that it, that it's not there. Hmm. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go through the list real quick and just say thank you to just, just the names and not read out the messages so we can get started. But um, if if you're not there, can you let me know? And sorry to do this, but uh, I I want to get the game going. Uh, thank you, Thelruga. Uh, Anton sixteen ninety nine seventy seven hockey Weeble Weebs Weeble Weebs and Hunter uh, for eleven month resub. Only channel for the eleven month resub as well. Uh, Timmy, Timmy, oh, your list is here. Timmy, your, your, your donation's here, Timmy, Timmy. Walter, you turned down sex to watch anime. You didn't take a shower and you had a nosebleed from both your nostrils. You were still a level one weed. There are 999, pun intended, more levels to go. Uh, thank you, Big Daddy Apache. Um, John Parr. Witch Dance or Vich Dance. Sly Gamer 64. Goman Dazen. Dallas Viper 109. Action Caterer, Sick Tricks Bro, DJ Morrissey, Penguin Saver, um, Taco Waveable, The Copy Pasta, Frickin' Moron, Duns, Aerosol, Mr. Mobius, Dr. Top Hat, 039520, Slide Gamer 64, and Shevard. 
for for the donations and subs. Is there any one else that I that I should have said out loud? And my list is um that was uh, that is gone from the list. I'm I'm annoyed that my list is broken. This message was sent by the Kochi gang. What what's this gang thing? I see this gang this gang thing later. Hmm. hmm. I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed. I'm annoyed. Anyway, okay, so we're gonna start the game. Sorry if there was an important message or one of those uh, at, at me again later or or message me on Discord and I'll read it out loud. But sorry, we, we, we need we need to get the, the game moving and I think um I think you that most people would agree with that. Let's 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 get the game on. Let's get the game on. Okay. My name is Kaede Akamatsu. My name is Kaede Akamatsu. Kaede? Kaede? Kaidi? Katie? Katie. 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 Katie Akamatsu. Katie. Okay. I just remembered who I am. You're Katie. Nice to meet me. I'm the protagonist of this crazy story. Ultimate Revival? I stumbled out of the locker in a daze, but as soon as I did, I fell on the floor. Uh. Huh? Oh, we're level one. I couldn't even brace for impact as blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. Gah, ow. But thanks to that pain, I went from days to annoyed real quick. I'm annoyed. Huh? Huh? Wait, where am I? What is this place? I've rubbed my throbbing forehead. Yep, this is definitely going to leave a bump. I looked around. A classroom? Yeah, this is a classroom, all right, but I don't recognize it. Where am I? What am I doing here? Oh, is this a dream? I just had to pinch myself, right? So we're Sonya this time? So I pinched my cheek. But all that did was make my head hurt in two places instead of one. Um. Um, okay, hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end, I just couldn't. Bam. <laughs> Whoa. Suddenly, the locker next to mine starts swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noise. As I fearfully turned around, the locker door slowly opened, and... <gasps> A boy came stumbling out. <laughs> A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. In fact, he might be a high school student, too. He looked bewildered, and when he slowly lifted his head... It was Leon. <laughs> He screamed as if he'd just seen a monster, fell on his butt, and scooted back. Scoot, scoot. Uh. Your eyes look familiar. Who, who are you? Are you with those other guys? Huh? What other guys? The people who kidnapped me. Um. Kidnapped? Wait. Where are? Where am I? What are you gonna do to me? Hey. Hey, hey, hold on. I firmly gripped his shoulders. You know? What's your name? Huh? Huh? Uh, um... That hat doesn't look right. Uh, I'm... Sushi Saihara. Yeah. I'm Katie Akamatsu. Now listen to me, Sushi. Got it? Shut up. You're not the only one who's confused right now. Huh? Ah, sorry. After making him shut up, I <laughs> trace my steps again. <laughs> That's right. I was kidnapped too. I was walking my usual route to school when all of a sudden someone shoved me into a car. I shouted for help, but no one came to rescue me. Everyone pretended like nothing happened. It made me think how rotten the world is. And then I lost consciousness. That's right. And when I woke up, I was inside that locker. Huh? 
Same with me. Were we kidnapped by the same people? Uh. The, the hat is really bothering me, chat. It's really bugging me. It seems like it. Jeez. But why me? My family's not rich. And I'm no one special. I'm just a normal high school girl. There's no reason to kidnap me. Uh, okay. Me either. I'm just a regular guy. And this is a school, right? Why did they take us to a school? Um. I wonder why. Well, this is a different opening than I thought. Hey there. I'm sure you're confused right now. You're thinking, where am I? Well, I can't explain that. But I can give a basic explanation about the controls. M move your mouse to control the reticle on the screen. When, when, when you have a target in your sights, left click to investigate it. Hold, hold down right click and move the mouse to adjust your view. You can also press the space bar to smack objects around. Who, who knows, you might find something amazing, like a coin. You can always press the Q, Q key to return to objects to the original position, so relax. H however, not every object can be moved, Morty. Thank you for understanding. If you pr I can't do that for the whole thing. If you press the enter key, a mysterious investigative power will activate. Sorry, I know this is a lot of information. Investigate this place thoroughly. That's how you progress the story, you know? You should fully investigate this area first. Okay. Um... You should, yeah, I want to bring up the options. Can I bring up the options? No. Okay. The mouse is a little off. Okay, control doesn't do anything this time. The outside of the window is covered in greenery and barbed wire. Why are the school windows covered in barbed wire? Damn, we're getting so many coins. So many coins. All right, so this this is this is uh this looks pretty good. The mouse is a little off. Talk to, to sushi. Um. Anyway, let's just stay calm and think. I'm sorry I shouted at you earlier. I know, uh, no, it's okay. I shouldn't have yelled at you. Hey. Anyway, this place is weird. You don't think we got caught up in something bad, do you? No, we just got kidnapped for fun. Uh. Something bad. What's going on? What have we gotten ourselves into? Damn. Welcome inside of these lockers. Why were we in these lockers in the first place? So the mouse, the mouse kind of becomes sticky when you get close to something. It's hard to explain. It's it's like the the sensitivity goes way down when when you go over something. It's like it's, but it doesn't happen every time. It's it's really weird. That's a blackboard, right? Every classroom has one, but this blackboard is also an LCD screen. That's something you don't see every day. Is this a monitor? Nothing's being displayed right now. Seriously though, what is it? It really seems out of place here. Uh, thank you Floy Floydoshi for the 100 bits. Finally, King Anime Sun has returned to Weed Mountain. At last, the chatter chattering peasants can pick a new 2D waifu. I think we're the waifu so far. Thank you Floydoshi. Thank you Fjordor for the 13-month for the resub. 
with uh, with the, the scary face as the message. Thank you very much. Thank you, Nikura, for the new sub of Prime. Welcome to Prime Time. And thank you, K Roniverse, for the two month resub. I'm gonna I'm ready to get sucked into Dangan Hell one last time. Yep, one last time. This is the last one. Kinda bittersweet. Kinda bittersweet, I'm not gonna lie. Where am I? Why was I kidnapped? Who kidnapped me? I don't understand this at all. But that doesn't matter, at least for now. Hey, let's just get out of here as fast as we can and find some help. Uh, okay. Yeah, good idea. We ran as fast as we could to the classroom door and opened it with all of our strength. But then... Hell yeah! Found you! Okay. What? A monster? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> this is bad. We need to get out of here. Uh, okay. How do how do I make how do I make the thing appear disappear? Window on off is it Q? Yeah. Look at the, look at the thighs on us, man. Look at the thighs. We're thick. Wait 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 wait. Whoa. What? Damn, this one actually had a budget. Katie, over here. Whoa. That thing actually looks pretty cool. Metal Gear. W plus escape is run? Escape? It's also shift. Ooh, that that is an interesting choice. Don't go that way over here. Okay, what if I what if I don't? What happens if they get me? Ah fuck it. Let's just keep going. Ah, uh, jeez. What are those things? Yeah, fuck it. Let's try it. I want to know what happens if we get caught. Damn. Apparently, I'm not high enough level. Hold on. If I run around, I can get to level two. You just wait. I'm gonna be level two. I'm gonna kick your ass. You're not gonna know what's gonna hit you. Level two. Now you're scared. Ah oh, damn, level two's not high enough. Alright, what about level three? But a bit of bum ba dum ba dum bum bum ba da bum ba dum ba dum bum bum ba da bum ba dum ba dum bum bum ba da bum ba dum ba dum ba I'm kidding, I won't do that to you guys. Oh shit, the guy. As we frantically dove toward the door, we saw something we never expected to see. Oh, uh, so this is the cast? Okay. Let's see. Uh, what's with what's with the the smoking kid in the background? Okay. Um, that looks like Sayaka, but with glasses. Um, ni nice catchy. It's ki kind of weird, kind of Nagito there on the far left. What's with the smoking kid in the background? The the young purple haired kid looks looks familiar in some way. What did, I, I feel like the cast in each game gets progressively gets younger. What there's there's like one the 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 the, the gray haired girl on the left there that's just about to go off the screen. Then then the the red haired girl behind her. Then the purple haired kid with the purple eyes. And then the smoking kid in the background. And then even the one on the right. There's there's like five kids in this cast. Hmm. Hmm. This guy on the left looks ridiculous. Is he the ultimate train conductor? Like what the fuck is that? 
Oh, more people have arrived. Huh? Huh? Did you all get chased by that monster too? Uh, oh, yeah. What are they? What do they want with us? Do you want me to check on what's happening? You can't! It's too dangerous out there! It's likely that monster still lurks nearby. Wait! I shouted at the top of my lungs. Who are you guys? And why am I here? That was on top of your lungs. And that makes 16. <gasps> but what about the, the 16th student? What? We're the 16th student. We're Makuro Ikasaba. I'm talking about us. There are 16 of us. All high schoolers. What do you think that means? 16 high schoolers? Oh. Oh, right. Didn't I answer your question? My name is Rantaro Amami. I can give you my name. It's Rantaro Ama Amami. I'm, sorry. I'm a mommy. Let's leave it at that for now. I don't what? like you. I don't like you at all. I really, really don't like you, huh? Um, okay. You know... Anyway, you're alright. Anyway, why does it matter if there are 16 of us? There might be more coming. No. Nah, I think this is all of us. If this is what I think it is anyway. What? If this is what you think it is? You're alright. Hey! What? What? Hmm. Kind of Sonya and Owie smushed together? Which would be better than this. But yeah, this... this okay, she's alright. What? What? You... You some kind of fucking know-it-all? If you know something, spit it out. It was at that moment an unknown voice suddenly echoed throughout the game. Okie dokie. Okay, quiet everyone. Shimmy down, shimmy down. Hmm. No, 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 it's Simmer down. What? Huh? Who's that? Where are they? That's just Sayaka. That's l it's literally Sayaka with glasses. Serious? Damn it, there are more monsters. We're surrounded. Ah. These are monsters. They're exocells. Exocells. That's a weird name. Sexiels. Lexisas. Sal. No, I'm not seeing anything. Okay. And that's that. They're highly mobile bipedal weapon platforms. Huh? Weapons. Damn. Hell yeah! I don't like sushi. Should we take these for a spin by killing one of them? Whoa! Yeah, wait a minute. Kill one of the lollies. Kill one of the lollies. I wouldn't be any fun picking on play it wouldn't be any fun picking on playing good for nothing commoners. <laughs> You're right. We should at least think of an interesting way to kill you. Maybe I'll pick you up and squeeze you till your guts come gushing out like toothpaste. That's what? 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 Hmm. Wait. Please, not like toothpaste. Ugh, I just imagined that I can't handle the gore. Okay, I feel like I'm not supposed to know what that is yet. Well, then what if we start peeling off their limbs one by one like string cheese? Ah! Please, not like string cheese either. Ah! Wait, we can't kill them with the exocells. According to the schedule, the exocells aren't supposed to show up till later. What are you saying? But we're in the exocells right now. Ah, ah so we are. <sighs> we screwed up. We're not supposed to be in the exocells for our first appearance. <laughs> I told you we should have read the script. What are you saying? Nah, you didn't. Hmm. Well, why don't we just... What the fuck is going on? Why don't we just get out of these mechs? It shouldn't be too late for that. Okay. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. So. Okay, ready.
I hope. Please, 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 please tell me that at one point they 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 for they combine to make Monokuma together like Captain Planet. Please, 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 game, game, please give me that. Please give me that. Huh? See, we're out of the exosiles. Now we're not scary anymore, right? Right? His desperation is strangely terrifying. You guys are ready? You punk asses better brace yourselves. <laughs> is she wearing a bra? <laughs> Uh, thank you Crazy Taxi 2 for the new Silver Prime. Welcome to Prime Time. Thank you Darkling Second for the 50 bits. That stickiness is probably the aim assist for controllers that they didn't patch out of the port. Oh, great. It's not too bad, but it's a little annoying. Thank you, uh, Jenison for the new sub with Prime. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, Jenison. Uh, thank you, Timmy Timmy, for the 100 bits. Hey, Joe, just letting you know that the VAs of Leon and TV are in this game. It's up to you to find them, Kappa. Chat, please let Joe find them on his own. Don't spoil. Ooh. Ooh. Why are you saying two? Why are you saying two? Why are you guys saying one and two? Uh, and he's just outright terrifying. Um, sorry again for the for, for the, the people who subbed earlier and, and gave bits like, that I had to skip over and just say your name. Sorry about that, but we needed to get the thing going, and my list was bugged, so I was a little um a, a little uh skeptical of, of, of the list at that point. Sorry about that. Uh, Smear used 300, 333 bits to say the gist of my message from earlier was have fun. This was my favorite game. Uh, hope you love it as much as I did. Oh, thank you, thank you, Smear. Thank you. You didn't have to, to, to give that any bits to, to say it again. I, I would have read it out if it, if, it, if it had just been one. Thanks so much, Smear. I hope I enjoy it. So far, I'm having a good time. Is it the lyrics that you guys are talking about? Yep, yeah, there it is, one. Okay, pretty good. I'm a messenger from hell from the depths of, of here. Here, to, sorry, to the depths of hell, here to drag you down to hell. I'm a messenger from hell, from the depths of hell, here to drag you down to hell. Okay, so this is Gundam. No, no, Monokid, you're saying hell too much, it's ruining the hellish impact. Eh? What? What's hellish mean? Hey, hey, what's up with these stuffed animals? How are they moving? I have no idea. Moving stuffed animals. Okay, so, very, very quickly, in, in just, like... Two minutes, two minutes or less. This is the third one in the game, and in the previous two games, Monokuma is a bear that looks just like this guy here, only he's black and white instead of instead of white and red. He's black and white. Um, he was being controlled by someone who I won't say because I don't want to spoil too much about it in case you're going to go back and play them. But he basically locked a bunch of kids up in, in, in a place. In the first game, it was in a school, and the second one, it's on a, it's on an island, um, and forces force them to kill each other. Um, so this is not Monokuma. This is a mono bear. Uh, so we don't know where, like, why what this means. Um, but yeah, so that that was that's why everyone's like, holy shit, who the fuck are these guys? So 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 that's it. Yeah. Yeah. On top of that, it seems like they're calling themselves monocubs. Oh, this this guy looks ridiculous. Is it chalk? Moving stuffed animals, monocubs. Wait, you guys call yourselves the monocubs? Oh, don't bother asking Monodam. He only talks to close friends. The years of abuse have really done a number on his heart. Isn't that right, Monodam? <laughs> but Monodam, you won't even open your heart to me? I see. Looks like I was right. This is exactly what I thought it was. Are you the Nagito of this game, Amami? But who's behind all this? Why the ridiculous theatrics? Shut up! Gosh, shut up, you. All of you are reacting way too normally to this. It's boring. Mm. Actually, don't their clothes seem kind of boring, too? Hey. Wait a minute. You think maybe they haven't been given their first memory yet? Yeah. Huh? That should have happened before they woke up. Jeez. Hey, answer my question. If you guys are the Monocubs, then... Hey. hey, who the hell are you punks? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? What? Right now. We're just wondering. Do you use guy? Do you use guy? Oh, this is the Canadian one. Do you guys have ultimate talents or anything like that? 
Ultimate talents, eh? Ultimate Ooh. talents. I don't have one. I have a skill that I devote myself to, but I wouldn't call that an ultimate talent. Uh, um, Me either. I, I don't have anything like that. Okay. Yeah, same here. So. I knew it. They haven't gotten their first memory yet. Hey. Mono Fanny? Mono Fanny? Mono Fanny? 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 Fanny sounds wrong. Fanny. Weren't you in charge of that? Oh. Hmm? It's Chiaki. She's sleeping. Did she seem really tired to you guys? Are you stupid. She's obviously faking it. Zzz. Hmm. Even if she's faking, she looks so peaceful. Let's whisper so we don't wake her up. <gasps> um, if you say so. Um. Anyway, if you guys really are the Monocubs, then don't worry about us. The real issue is use is use bastards. Well, issue is putting it mildly. This is actually a huge problem. Use all have forgotten your talents and become generic high school students. Huh? huh? Forgotten? So. See, according to the backstory, there's this ultimate hunt going on. You've all lost your memories and become different people because of the ultimate hunt. Um, um what are you talking about? Oh, well. well, in your current state, it's pretty much pointless to talk to you guys about this. Mm. The first thing we need to, you guys to do is remember your true selves. Right. Yeah, you need to reclaim your seal talents by regaining your memories. What, what the? Are you awake already? Why? I don't get it. What are these seal talents you're talking about? Aww. How are we supposed to talk when you keep asking so many freaking questions? Aww. Yeah, we're not the same. We're not some swift footed singer who's landed another future ex boyfriend. What? Yeah, we're not some swift footed singer who's landed another future ex boyfriend. Oh, okay. Really? Last time was Avril Lavigne? And this time we're, we're, we're going after, after Swift? Really? Oh, well. Avril Lavigne? Let's do this already. No one wants to watch a bunch of generic high school whiners. That's right. First, we'll update your wardrobe so you guys look all cute and spiffy. Uh-oh. Ooh. I need an adult. Musical notes. What? Huh? Okay. Are we some? Are we some singer? Haha. <laughs> what? What? What am I wearing? Mhm. Mm Looking good. Now you look more like Ultimates. Huh? Ultimates. Really? You still have the hat! God damn it. Oh, god damn it. Fucking hat. Uh, thank you, Lucid Streamer, for the time of the resub. Thanks so much. Thank you, Lucid. Leon! Uh, actually, <laughs> Lucid hates the Leon meme. Action Cater used to miss to say, you may not, you may have not noticed, but Mona. The sixth Mono Cub hiding somewhere in the school. Watch out for. I couldn't pronounce it, sorry. Ultimates, really? So... Next up, the memory you've all been waiting for. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, get ready. Once the seal is broken, we'll be in the domain of the killing game. Right now. Killing game. All right. Now then, after the flashback light helps you remember your amazing talents. This, really? The flashback light? This amazing story will begin for real. For real this time. So long, Here we go. Useless. That was sudden. I know it's sudden, but would you like to save? Ultimate Revival. Huh? Huh? I stumbled out of the locker in a daze, but as soon as I did, I fell on the floor. Ah. I couldn't even brace for impact as a blinding pain suddenly rushed through my head. Oh damn, that's gonna leave another bump. 
But thanks to that pain, I went from dazed to annoyed real quick. Huh? huh? Wait, where am I? What is this place? I've rubbed my throbbing forehead. Yep, this is definitely going to leave a bump. I looked around. Shouldn't there be two bumps then? A classroom? <sighs> yep, this is a classroom, all right, but I don't recognize it. Where am I? Where am I? What am I doing here? Oh, is this a dream? I just had to pinch myself, right? So I pinched my cheek. All I did was make my head hurt in two places instead of one. Um, um okay, hold on a sec. Let's just stay calm and think this through. Confused as I was, I tried to remember how I ended up here. But no matter how hard I tried, in the end, I just couldn't. Oh, damn, it's sushi time. <coughs> sushi time, sushi time, sushi time. Suddenly, the locker next to mine started swaying and shaking, making all kinds of noise. As I fearfully turned around, the locker door slowly opened and... It's Hack Guy! A boy came stumbling out. Hmm. A normal boy dressed in a school uniform. In fact, he might be a high school student too. He looked bewildered and when he slowly lifted his head. Ah, ah. How rude. Don't freak out at me like I'm some sort of monster. Ah, sorry. I'm sorry too, okay? I just have no idea what's going on. But all the more reason why we need to stay calm. Oh. Gymnopedi number one by Eric Sati. Sadie. Try to imagine that sorrowful melody filling your head and soothing your heart. Rise and shine or shine. Okay, that was different. Rise and shine or sign. Rise and shine or sign. Ah! Uh, huh? A teddy bear. Oh, no, it's a monster. You can freak out about this. Yeah. Did you chest hair? I don't think she was talking to you. That's so mean. You humans are the real monsters for calling us monsters. Although, if we are monsters, at least we're pretty monsters. Okay. I agree. I'm glad I was born with these looks. I definitely won the genetic lottery. Huh? Huh? What are they? Why are they talking? Aren't they just stuffed animals? Hey. We're not mono cubs. We're the stuffed animals. Yeah, he has Chester. He has Chester. Hey. Missed it before. Psst, mono kid. You're saying your lines backwards. Hey. No stuffed animals. Us, the monocubs, them. Oh, oh geez, it's even worse now. Huh? Monocubs? Metal Gear. Oh, you've heard of us? Oh, no, no, of course not. I've never seen walking, talking stuffed animals. As soon as I said that these monocub things started looking at each other and... Yay, it worked! You had me worried there for a second. Um. Hey, 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 worried about what? I don't understand what's going okay. on. None of us do. Don't worry. Don't worry. All right, now let's tackle each issue one at a time. Thank you, Joe. First time I went to eat out in a month. I think I'll be back in time for the stream. And here you go. Stream half an hour early. Glad we... Oh, is it... They, they always say this time people are talking about earlier. Maybe maybe that's why people thought I started early. Or no? I don't, I'm not sure. Uh, I started a little late, actually, from my usual time. I think about five, ten minutes late. Yeah? Not sure. Borders Ranger... Borders Ranger 01 has just subscribed for six months. Congrats on baby number three, Joe. Thanks. Despite what your brain tells you, please don't give them a weeb name when they're born. <laughs> uh, in case you missed it, uh, Lily's pregnant with uh, with baby number three. Um, so so if anyone's sitting there going, whoa, whoa, whoa what baby? Yeah, Lily's pregnant. Very early on, but she's not having a good time of, of the pregnancy, so she's a bit sick. So um, we've, uh, we've, we've announced it earlier than we should have, um, just in case I need to take some time for that. Yeah. Uh, Timmy Timmy, use 100 bits to say, do you know that you can press the mm, M, M middle mouse button to slap the show furniture and get more coins? Yep, I did. I was doing it earlier. Yep, yep, yep. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Stop making babies, Joe. Can chat pick the name? Sure, go for it. You guys you guys can pick the name. All right, now let's tackle each, each issue one at a time. You're so damn reliable, Monotaro. He's like a sixth grader helping out a fifth grader. Which means we should keep our expectations reasonable. Um, well, what's your question? Uh, I have loads of questions, but for starters, where are we? This looks like a school. Okay, so this place is called the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. Uh, Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles? Hmm. Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles? I've never heard of a school like that. That's right. Of course you haven't. This school was made for you 16 cretins. Huh? 16? That's right. Yeah, there are 16 ultimates at this school. Huh? Huh? Ultimates. Well, you know what ultimates are, right? The government scouts them through this program called the Ultimate Initiative. Actually, 
ultimate basically means you're particularly uh, prodigious. I can never say that word. It's a prodigy. So prodigious, 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 prodigy, prodigious, prodigious. I can't say that word in a particular talent. Basically, the ultimate initiative exists to cultivate talent throughout the country. Promising students are eligible to receive all kinds of special handouts. Um. Like free school tuition, voting privileges, el eligibility to run for elected office, voting privileges. They even get grant money too, right? right? Students chosen by the Ultimate Initiative are known as Ultimates. Hell yeah. Digimon, hell yeah. Students would do anything for the honor of being cho a chosen Ultimate. Um. I don't need the explanation. I already know because I'm an Ultimate too. What? That means you gotta remember. That means you gotta remember this time, so don't forget anymore. Yeah, forgetting about your ultimate talent is such a waste. Huh? huh? What do you mean forgetting? Shut up! Shut up, quit your yapping, and get started already. Huh? Get started with what? So. Why, exploring this academy? Of course, selective memory loss doesn't make sense to me at all, but well. okay. Also, you should introduce yourselves to the other ultimates, because you guys are going to do an activity together later. Oh, shit. Orgy. Awesome, I've got a rager right now. Yep, there we go. Well then. So long, farewell! <laughs> ah, they left with so, so many questions. Hey, this isn't a dream, right? Uh... No, but I wish it was. Anyway, we have to find a way out of here. But they said there are 16 ultimate students here. Does that mean he's one too? This is going to be a, a, a hundred, a hundred hours for this playthrough. Hundred hours. Okay, so it doesn't look like I, I can make them respawn and get more clients. So it looks like it's it's one time only, which means that you should blow them all away. Yep. Yep. Okay. Hey. Um, are you an ultimate student too? Uh, okay. Yeah. Well then, I'm, I'm Sushi, Sushi Sahara. Sahara. They call, they call me, me the ultimate, ultimate detective. detective but... I feel like the music's still too loud compared to the voices. Or is he just quiet? Huh? What? You're a detective? That's amazing! No. Ah, uh, no. I don't have the credentials to call myself a detective yet. I just happened to solve a case that I came across and now people call me that. No. Not many people can just happen to solve a case. You should be more proud of that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. My, My name, name is, is Kaede Akamatsu. Kaede. I'm the ultimate pianist. Nice to meet you. Ultimate pianist. Okay, I was close then with with with, uh, with singer or music. Can't remember what I said. Kaede. 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 Not Katie. Kaede. 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 Like a day of Kaede. 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 Katie. Ultimate pianist. Hmm. Ultimate pianist. Yeah. Well, no one calls me the ultimate pianist. Usually just piano freak. I was a child. Really? I Ultimate penis? Penis? Really chat? Come on. That is some low-hanging penis right there. Like, come on. Really? Wow, that is a terrifying baby. Absolutely terrifying. Ever since I was a child, I would play the piano whenever I got bored. There were even times I played the piano so much that I would forget to eat and sleep. Eventually, I won trophies from concerts, and people started praising me. You were thinking it. You were thinking it too, Joe. Of course I was, but I didn't say it because I knew it was low-hanging penis. That's how you got your ultimate title, and that's way more impressive than me. No, that's all I'm good for, really. Whew. 
but this is my first time meeting another ultimate student. Well, well ultimates are scattered all over the country. They're difficult to find. Um. Even so, there are 16 ultimate students gathered here right now. Yeah, they're so difficult to find. I mean, imagine if three childhood f friends who met when they were about eight or nine just so happened to become three ultimates later on and go to the same school together. That would just be insane. Or, or maybe two childhood friends that were linked from, from birth. That if they were just to be ultimates together too, or or e even like brothers and sisters or anything like that, that would just be that would just be crazy. That would, there's just no way that would happen. But why is everyone here? Were we kidnapped? Mm. If so, then is some organization out there trying to kidnap all the ultimates? Hey. Ah, about that, I don't remember. Huh? Huh? You don't remember? Uh, um... I've been trying to remember it, but I can't. No matter how hard I try, I have no idea how I got here. When I woke up, I was in that locker. I don't know how I got there. It's like that memory just fell out of my head. <gasps> Same here. Huh? Huh? You know? I can't remember anything, even though I'm trying so hard to remember. <laughs> um. What happened? Uh, are you okay? What's wrong? No. Oh, I'm fine. Just got a headache. That's all. Are we in the simulation again? But. It can't be coincidence that we both don't remember what happened to us. Um... I'm sure it's nothing to worry about. Probably not a big deal. Right. We're confused. We just need to relax is all. Oh, let's imagine Maurice Raval's Sonatine. That's... Sonatine? Is that music? I, I don't really know much about music. I Me see. neither, actually. I see. That's unfortunate. When we get out of here, I'll share it with you. Oh, right. But first, let's look for a way out. And if there are other Ultimate students here, we should talk to them too. At least one of them has got to know something. You're right. Yeah, good idea. Obtain Friendship Fragment. Oh, damn. Alright. You can leave a room by pressing the escape key or interacting with the door. Uncultured? I am quite uncultured, I won't argue there. Suitcase Jimmy's good her business to say Joe playing Dang and Rampa V3 is better than sex. Been watching your videos for a few months now and I'm ha happy to finally donate for the first time. Congrats again on your on your third child. Thank you very much, Suitcase Jim. Thank you, thank you. I see that you are a man of culture as well, cho choosing anime stuff over sex. Ah, a man of culture. Thank you, Suitcase Gem. Thank you, Timmy, Timmy, for another 100 bits. Joseph Anderson slaps roofs of table. <laughs> table nice, gives coins. Lucis Streamer, not like this. What if they gave Leon coins instead? Which game had the best coin collecting? The first one, of course. The first one. The first one. Even though it's a hallway, there sure are a lot of plants growing around here, and the air is heavy, arms weak, oppressively heavy, as if forcing you to recall your fears, smothering you in anxiety. But this is just a school, right? What kind of school makes you feel like this? This is very odd looking, huh? What's the matter? What's the matter? Uh, um... uh, I just felt something in the pocket of my uniform when I looked. Remember. I found this inside. It's some kind of mini tablet computer. Uh... Oh, maybe I have one too. I knew my backpack felt heavier. Um. You. Okay, the word monopad is written on it. When did this get in my backpack? Hmm. My name was displayed when it booted up, like a student handbook. I, I don't know what it could be used for, but I don't think we should throw it away. Let's just hold on to them for yeah. now. Yeah, I agree. Congratulations. You can now use the monopad. Press the F key to open the monopad. It's got tons of game information in it. Stuff like the report card and map. Be, be, be sure to check it out. And if you've got a sharp eye, you may have already noticed. By getting closer to your fellow students, your report card will be updated with content. Since you are now acquaintances with Mr. Saihara, this information has already been added. F? 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 Is the stream down? F? Oh, fucking hell. <sighs> Don't scare me. Don't scare me. And I bet you're also... I bet you've also already noticed you can level up by performing actions. When you level up your skill slots increase, so you can equip even more skills. There are lots of skills, so view them in the report card. If you want skills, make friends, strengthen your bonds. Did I read something wrong? Be sure to test out all the skills. Sorry about that. Also, there's one more important thing to tell you. I love you. You can save and load the game from the handbook. Make sure you save all the important stuff. Well then, off you go. Find your classmates.
Oh, wow. Uh, oh, there's Monokuma! Damn. Okay, background music is down a little bit because I feel like sometimes it's overpowering with the voices. Okay, so I, I put it I put it down a little bit. I can still hear it fairly well. It said press F. Yeah, it was F1. Dress up. Holy shit, there's a lot. Okay, can I can I spend real money to unlock these things? Because it's a video game, right? Let, let me give you more money. What the hell? Uh, I can turn the game up a little bit after turning the music down, sure. There you go. I turned it up a little bit. Okay, review the rules and regulations that must be followed. Not there yet. Review the report cards for each student at the Ultimate Academy. Review whatever personal belongings you have on you. Nothing. At least it doesn't look like it. Review the evidence you witness and witness accounts you've made a record of. Damn, that's spoilers. Review the layout of the Academy. This will help you find specific locations. Ooh. Right click is change tab. What? Okay, so these these are very similar to Dangarumpa 2. That looks just like Sonya right there. That one, the second one. What is she? The ultimate witch? Chest 35. Nice. 5'8", damn, not, 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 that's, that's a respectable height, damn. We're taller than sushi, nice. Tense of influence, extraordinary focus, lost in thought. Oh wow, this actually looks pretty good. For, for, for this kind of game, I mean. That actually looks pretty good. I, I do have to say though, for something that came out last year, it doesn't look that good. But it's a massive step up from, from, from the last games. Oh, wait a minute. Is this the music room? Click. Huh? I won't open, but this game does look like it was made for me. It's a Vita game? Okay, that, that explains a little bit. Okay. Ah, uh, they're here again. What do you think this place is? Check out all this fancy schmancy writing. Seems like a place for eggheads. Huh? Isn't this an ultimate research lab? You stupid! What the hell? Why would you tell them that? Tell them? We're, we're trying to make it all dramatic. Oh, I see. I'm sorry. Huh? Okay, now the music's too low. Okay, that's still lower than it was before, but it's a little higher than it is right now. Okay, so let's see if that's the sweet spot. Let's see. Huh, what's an ultimate research lab? Yay! We want you guys to keep honing your ultimate talent, so we set up these rooms for you. This is the ultimate pianist's lab, but we set up the labs for the other ultimates too, of course. Well, actually... Most of them are still hidden, though. Um, By the way, the reason this research lab is still locked is... Um, you haven't left our, met everyone yet, is... Because we're still setting up everything. Sorry, we'll hustle to get it all ready. Just wipe your asses and wait! Damn. The hell you saying? The hell you saying? That's good advice and all, but... Don't you mean... Ugh. Don't you mean to say hold your horses? Hoo hoo hoo! Mana Kid is such a dummy. Hey! What are you laughing at? I'll bully you like I bully Monodam. Poor Monodam. So long, for Monodam. Very well. So long, very well. Um... It seems like the music room, but I guess it's an ultimate lab. Hey! Do you think there really are other rooms like this for everyone? Hmm. I wonder about that too. Anyway, I thought this was the music room. Ah, I really wanted to play the piano. 
Oh well, I can play as much piano as I want when I finally escape this place. Damn, I wonder if his detective lab is gonna be like a bakery. I swore I just walked through that, but alright. Open. Let's look somewhere else. You're right. Okay. Okay, so you look up like this, right? And then you press forward and it auto it auto corrects where the mouse is looking. So if you want to look up and move at the same time, you have to like jerk the mouse up and down. Oh fuck. Can we turn that off? Is that movement, Bob? Shooter Danganronpa. I don't. I don't think that's movement, Bob. Let's move it back to shooter because I don't know what it changed. Hey, you're an ultimate student, right? Can we talk? Uh, um, ultimate, ultimate. <sighs> okay, her clothes don't really give it away. Ultimate reader, ultimate lawyer. Like she's she's dressed up nice. What kind of profession dresses like this in in Japan? Huh? Um, did she not hear me? Okay then. Hey, hello. Uh, um. What? She still can't hear me? Maybe she's a really detailed mannequin. No. No, I don't think that's the case. No. Ultimate lost in thought? You never know. We already saw a moving teddy bear. As I said, I poked her cheek. And I felt her skin squish beneath my fingertips. Squish, squish. Uh, uh, huh? Poking her doesn't work either. Then maybe she is just a doll. But she looks so real. Try it, sushi. Poke, poke. Huh? Ah, uh, no thanks. <laughs> just do it. It's so fun. As I grabbed his hand to make him poke her other cheek. Hey now. I never thought I'd be poked from both sides. How truly unexpected. Uh, I uh, see. How truly unexpected. So she wasn't a mannequin while I knew that. Wait. If you knew that, why did you make me poke her? Huh? Because she wasn't responding. No. Oh, I didn't mean any harm. I was just deep in thought. So I thought if I ignored you, you'd go somewhere else. Um, you were ignoring us? Isn't that a bit rude? What? Um, well, isn't it rude to force someone to talk when they don't want to? Oh, but it's fine. I feel like talking now. All right. Now let's talk. What do you want to start with? Right, right. My favorite Doraemon episode is number 53, the one with security cameras and target practice. You know? Um, before you talk about that, can you tell us your name? Uh, my name is Sumugi Oh Shirobani. my god. I'm the ultimate cosplayer. How... Wh what is she then? What is she then? Like, what is she dressed up as? Like, who is she? Damn. All right. Well, just just because of the possibilities, this is number one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my name is Su Sumugi Sirogane. I'm the ultimate cosplayer. So you're a cosplayer. Yes. Are you surprised? I get that a lot since I'm so plain. No. I mean, it sort of makes sense. You have this strange, almost sexy aura about you. Damn, Katie's thirsty. I see. I bet it's because you've got people ogling all your curves on a daily basis, oh. huh? Katie, you sound like a creepy old man. Um, Normally, I don't really like people looking at me like that. Actually. I just like making cosplay. I'm fine with others wearing them. But. But lately, more cosplayers are putting themselves before their characters. You're right. I'd Whoa, why are, are we going into the nose or what? I'd rather wear my outfits myself with love than give them to people like that. Mm. Wow, you're pretty intense. Oh. It makes me happy when I get to show people the outfits I've made. 
And thanks to my sponsors, I can use materials that are just plain expensive. That are just plain expensive. I see. Oh, well, of course the Ultimate Cosplayer would have sponsors. Yeah. Squarespace, it's not a big deal. People just crowd around like I'm a panda at the zoo. Hmm. That's so amazing. You're pretty much a celebrity, you know? Really? That's the line of dialogue that's following that one? Hey! Uh, is it alright if I ask you something too? Earlier you looked as if you were thinking hard about something. What was it? Yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, we need to ask her that. Nice job, Sushi. It's from that one thing! Ah, uh, that bronze dragon statue over there. Statue? I'm just plain curious about it. What statue? I am now. I am too. Damn, the statues are all along. Um... Can I buy it? It almost seems like it's floating, right? Doesn't it look pretty out of place? Yeah. Now you mention it, you're right. It sort of bothers me too. Um... This is a school, right? But everything here is so weird, isn't it? There's trees and grass growing inside. I can't find any exits. And it seems like we're the only people Actually... here. Are we going to be okay? Are we going to be able to get out? Um... Katie, what's wrong? Mm -hmm. Hee <laughs> hee. That frightened look on her face was sort of sexy. Wow, we're we're thirsty. Is this some commentary on on the kind of people that play this game are gonna be are gonna influence her a little bit? Cause like holy shit, she she's damn, damn. Like seriously, <laughs> this again? I'm just kidding. Well, it's not a big deal. Our present situation is our main concern. Once it's over, we'll be good and dandy. I see. You're pretty optimistic, Katie. Hmm. Well, people do say I'm carefree. Yeah, that's right. Worrying won't get you anywhere, you know. It's just better to be carefree. By the way, I'm the ultimate pianist. I'm really good with my fingers. Yeah. Well, yeah, I guess so. Being all depressed won't help anything. Yeah. yeah, so let's try and find a way out. Damn, friendship fragment. Nice. Sumugi's report card has been updated. What is this? Hmm. Hmm. It looks like a dragon statue. Oh, that was cool how it how it kind of zoomed in to, to the character standing in front of it. That was neat. Looks like a dragon hey. statue, but why is there a dragon statue in the school's no. hallway? I have no idea. Hmm. Maybe it's part of the school's official art collection or something. Uh, um... Still no idea. What's with the orb in it? Okay, so this is where we're gonna live. And look at the mini map down there, and it says like classroom C and B. Yeah. Strawberry house is back. Boys' bathroom, right? I can't go in there. Not even this situation. Um. Uh, if you want, I could go look. Huh? What? I'm not that curious about what's in there. Remember. Well, this is an unusual building. Anything could be in there. Wait here a minute. With that, Sushi opened the door and walked inside. Hmm. It was just an old bathroom. Nothing out of the ordinary. No one was inside. I see. I see. That scared me. Maybe detectives live for these kind of scary situations. Damn. So after three games, we can finally go into the girls' bathroom. Here we go. Three games. It's a big moment. It's a big moment. Here we go. This is the girl's bathroom, right? You know? Sushi, do you mind waiting here? Uh, okay. Uh, I'm sure. Jeez. Don't give me that weird look. I'm just gonna check if, there, if there's anything inside. I thought there'd be an exit, but just in Sorry. case. Sorry. Sorry. Toilets seem normal, but it's weird that the plants are growing it are growing this thick. The plants are a bit weird. Is there a button that shows you what's interactable again, or no? Objects back, hit object, open transcript. There was tab in the last games. It doesn't look like it. Enter. 
Oh, wow. <sighs> Look at that. This monitor is way too high-tech to be used in a school. There's literally nothing in here. Excuse me, there are a bunch of coins. Do we have a coin a coin collection going on? 85 coins, yep. Damn, so many coins, we're doing so well. This is the best game. Haven't been playing that long, we already have 85 coins? Holy shit. Can we go into observation mode here? No, this is the map. Okay, interesting. So that leads to stairs, and the other way doesn't. So let's go this way, and then we'll go to the other way to the stairs. I don't like this person. Hey. Oh, hey there. You guys get kidnapped too? Alright, so... Thumb ring, two rings, bracelet, necklace pendant thing, earrings, a lot on the right ear, a thing on the shoulder thing. Does he make jewelry, or does he... Does he... What, what, what is he, the ultimate what? Oh, hey there, you guys get kidnapped too? Well, you both look all right, that's good. No. Situation could be better though. Hmm. Someone on his other, his other arm, his other hand too? Probably not, it's probably just his sense of style, not what he actually does. Hmm. Situation could be better though. Yeah. Yeah, totally. Hey. hey, let me ask you something. Do you guys remember how you got oh. here? If you're asking us then, you don't remember either, actually. do you? Ha, huh, you're the same way too, huh? You don't remember anything, do you? I guess that means everyone's here. Huh? Everyone here is the same, huh? Everyone? No. I asked the others too. They all said they don't remember. Mm. So the others don't remember either. You got me. It's like we all have amnesia or something. But. Ah, uh, but that's not normal. If everyone here has amnesia, then nobody does. Well, I guess we're all in a pretty abnormal situation then. Huh? What? That's not true. Wait, amnesia is a stretch. We're probably just confused. I'm sure we'll remember eventually. No. Or it could be group hypnosis, maybe brainwashing. <laughs> In any case, I hope we can rem we remember soon. That's a shame. Otherwise, I'll end up the outcast. Hmm. The outcast? What do you mean? How should I put this? To tell you the truth, how I got here isn't the only thing I don't remember. I also forgot my own talent. Oh, great! What? You got me. Phew, I'm in trouble. I know I must have been some kind of ultimate. I just don't remember. Um. Is that true? Oh, well, yeah. Of course it is, but then again, I don't blame you for not believing me. Maybe you're from the reserve course. Oh. Oh, I never told you my name, did I? It's not like I already told you, but then I forgot I did, right? No. No, you haven't told me your name my yet. Name is my name Rantaro is Rantaro Amami. Rantaro Amami. I can't remember my ultimate talent at the moment. But I promise, I'm not a bad guy. Nice to meet you. I don't like you. I don't trust you, I don't like you. For someone who can't remember his talent, he doesn't seem too shaken up about it. Actually. Is it weird that I'm not really bothered by the fact that I don't remember my talent? Huh? What? Looking forward you to You know, it. I'm actually kind of looking forward to finding out. I wonder what ultimate I am. Shouldn't the bears be like, oh shit, it didn't work? Are you <laughs> lying? Are you fibbing? Telling lies? Anyway, it'd be nice if, if we could get along. Why aren't we aren't going anywhere for a while? Jeez. I'm the ultimate murderer. Stop that, we'll escape soon. Mm -hmm. I was recruited for how many murders I did. You really think it's going to be that easy? Huh? Uh, what do you mean? No. Nothing. Just a feeling. <laughs> uh, hey, don't worry about it, all right? I thought he would be a pretty chill guy to talk to, but I have no idea what's going through his head right now. School store. Yes, yeah, spend some coins. Click, click. I guess this doesn't open. Let's look somewhere else. You're right. Okay. So, can we not go through any doors right now? Dining hall. Oh, no, we can. And we went to the bathroom, too. How do you feel about Nagito getting into Smash 4? It's, it's really, really sounds good to me. He's, he's going to be the ultimate something, right? Sounds good to me. Thank you, Cat Named Dodge, for the 13-month for, for the resub and that message. Thank you. 
Uh, VHNS. HNS says 100 with 100 bit says the PC version has a bug where A and S keys are swapped for a mini game in the class trial. Make sure you swap them around in the cog field file before this trial begins. What really? That's a pretty big bug. Why haven't they fixed it? When is the uh, yawn emote coming? <laughs> Maybe nice having 100 bits to say I would recommend a controller. These keyboard controls look ass. Yeah, I might plug the controller and see how it goes. We'll see. Thoughts about the Smash Direct? I didn't watch it. I haven't been awake for very long before the stream started, and I have to check some comments and how the video was doing. It was scheduled to go up while I was asleep. Uh, Timmy Timmy123125 use 100 bits to say, it looks like they finally made a statue of you because of your job in papers, please. Yeah, that's it. That's it. I remember, I remember that. Uh, if I do a good enough job, are they going to make a statue of me? Yeah, there's my statue. Papers, please. Uh, Xpolitan is subscribed for the Prime for the first time. Thank you very much. Welcome to Prime Time, Xpolitan. Thank you, thank you. And thank you, SMH Rampage, for the new sub as well. Welcome to the Dragon's Den. Dimming97 use another 100 bits to say, by the way, the red hair, uh, Lolly is Jackie. Have fun, Joe. Is, the, is that the voice? They, they reuse a lot of, uh, of, uh, of, of voice actors. I know that, yeah. Uh, y Press has subscribed with Prime for the first time. Welcome to Prime Time, Y Press. Thank you very much. Or Y Press? Y Press? I'm not sure. Yeah. Thank you again, X Politan, SMH Rampage, and Y Press. Thank you. Uh, apologies if I'm going through them a little too fast for some people, but uh, I want to not. Uh, I want to keep the game moving at least a little bit. And again, I don't know if, if the screen is messing up when I alt tab out or not for you guys. Oh, thank you, Chubbs Magoo, for the two month resub with the message, My Hero. I'm your hero? Wow, thank you, Chubbs Magoo. It's, it's funny, you're, you're my hero now, too. Thank you, Chubbs Magoo. You have a great name, seriously. Uh, thank you, Chabit. Chabit sounds familiar. Thank you, Chabit. Welcome to Prime Time. Thank you very much. Welcome, welcome, Chabit. Chabit, Chabit. All right, who are we talking to first? Are we talking to the witch or the other one? But this place is called the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. I doubt if. It's anything like a typical school. Rules. This looks like the rules for the dining hall. Dining hall rules. Or maybe they just really like the dining hall. You may eat any food you find in the dining hall. Please take responsibility for all utensils and dishes used to and clean up after yourself. The dining hall will be locked during nighttime. Nighttime, so it's closed at night. Yep. Okay, so question, question, question. All right, so what can I zoom in? All right, what are you? Okay, I can't tell. Some sort of sport activity, maybe? You're, like, you're, you're literally a witch. So I would say you are the ultimate cosplayer, but, but no. Nice shoes. All right, I'm really curious about sushi. Hmm. It seems like this place has all the facilities you expect, but it's covered in overgrowth. Could that mean this has been abandoned for a long time? Oh, damn, nice collar. You the ultimate cat girl? <laughs> I'm yelling so I can build up my spirit energy. Don't you know you can unlock your brain's full potential by yelling to build up spirit energy? That's... I've heard that pro athletes do that. It's supposed to help you focus. Yeah. I must be prepared for combat at all times, just in case someone tries to attack me. I will protect myself with Neo Akito. Huh? Akito, then you're. Oh yes. Oh yes. I'm, I'm Tenko. Yeah, the ultimate Aikido master. Okay. I like her. She's okay so far. I see. Ooh, I always imagine Akito Masters to be huge, burly guys, but you're so cute. Um, cute? Uh, just stop it. I, I, I'm not cute. My face crinkles when I suck down a shake, and when I wipe my face, my eyelids turn inside out. Hmm. Uh, I'm see. Uh, I see, but I think you're cute, right, Sushi? Uh, okay. Huh? Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter? Your face looks really intense now. I don't like me. I, I don't like to be praised by degenerate males. Mm. Degenerate males? You mean men? Are you uncomfortable around them? Yes. It's a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable. If any degenerate tries to touch me, my reflex is to grab them and throw them across the room. Yeah. You're right. 
that is a way bigger problem than just being uncomfortable around men. Okay, wait, wait, wait. You don't like degenerate men, or are all men degenerate? Hey. Ah, by the way, what is this Neo Aikido you mentioned? That's right. Neo Aikido is an original form of Aikido that my master and I completely made up ourselves, so your Aikido is all self-taught. Can we talk to you again? Alright. Geez, she's so loud. Sushi, do you have any glue on you? <laughs> uh, I know what you're thinking, but we probably shouldn't. Wow, okay. <sighs> yeah, so are we stuck here? Um. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Uh, but don't be scared, I'm sure we'll be out of this place in a jiffy. No. Or a giffy. I'm not scared. I'm just a pain. It's just a pain. Something like this won't make me panic, because I'm a mage. A mage? Hmm. Mm, that's right, I haven't told you guys yet. Prepare, Prepare to be, to be amazed. amazed. Fall to your knees. I am Himiko Yumeno, the ultimate mage. <sighs> okay, so, so far the cast of this game fucking sucks. But... I'm officially called the Ultimate Magician. Okay, that's a little better. Alright, she pulled it back. That's a little better. I see. Oh, so you're a magician. You should have said that from the start. Hmm. I mean, it makes sense, though, since magic doesn't exist. Uh, yeah, magic does exist. Huh? Huh? I... Because... Because I'm a mage! I wear this hat because I'm a mage. I do this finger pose because I'm a mage. Um, You're just a magician, right? Because I'm no. a maid, only on paper. Okay. I'm known as a magician, but that's just a ruse. I'm actually a mage. Huh? Just a ruse. Uh. You guys, you guys might not know them, but there's a group called the Magic Castle, and we demand that we're taken seriously. Also known as the Hall of Magicians, it's where the world's magic lovers gather. I, I was the youngest person to ever win their Magician of the Year award. I see. That's pretty cool. Cut it out. It's all a ruse. Why you? They're all they're keeping my magic a secret by disguising it as tricks. Because of this ruse, I became famous all over the world for performing tricks. <sighs> but Sniffle, I'm not a magician, I'm a mage, nobody believes me. Uh, there, there, don't be sad. Hey. Well, well, you could just, you could show us your magic, then we would believe that's you. That's right. Oh, that's right, help us with your, help us out with your magic. Take us back to when we originally... No. Magic isn't all powerful, I can, o I can only do so much. Mm. I see, then, what can you do? You're right. I can choose the card you picked, pull out coins, and release doves. Nah, if I get serious, I can even saw someone in half. Damn, I wonder if that's going to be one of the murders. Those are just ordinary magic tricks. This door is blocked by barbed wire. The same goes for the classroom windows. Don't tell me all the exits are blocked. This game's owie is so bad. <laughs> uh. Is this a warehouse? It's pretty big. What are you, the ultimate aviator? What what what's the goggles? What's this? What what okay, I'm really curious. What are you? God damn it! 
Okay, potential, potential. This is this is Sonya and and the other one com combined, right? Sonya and Aoi together. Damn it! Where the where the hell is it? We saw a cons conspicuous girl rummaging through a shelf filled with different chemicals. Hey, hey what are you looking bitch. for? Hey, hey, <laughs> bitch! Don't sneak up on me, bitch! I literally just met you, and you've already called me a hey. bitch. Hey, I'm sorry if we surprised you, but you shouldn't talk to Katie like- Hey! Hey, crotch rot, you staring at my tits? Huh? Alright, I like this girl, what? <laughs> Help yourself, a guy like you can only dream of landing a big boobed hottie like me. Go on, get yourself a good eyeful. Uh, um... No, I wasn't staring, my eyes just happened to look there. You mother oh my- <laughs> Oh, my eyes just happened to look there. Oh, my hand just happened to grope her. Ha ha ha, I can identify- I can identify pervs- Pervs on site, and you are definitely a fucking perv. So are we, though. Identify us. That's why you wear that hat, right? To hide your skeevy eyes. And that's why you wear those pants, right? To hide your nasty crotch. Um. Everyone wears pants, though. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows that only pervs wear hats. This is true. This is true. Stop it. This is true. You can't argue with that. It's inarguable. Leave me alone. I can wear a hat if I want to. And leave my friends behind. He. What? what the hell are you getting? Are you getting pissed off at me for? T -t Tell the world you're sorry. If you startle me into losing motivation, that loss will be felt across the whole world. Hey, hey your vulgar language isn't called for. Just who are you anyway? Really? Huh? Seriously, you don't know who I am? I'm the gorgeous girl genius whose good looks and golden brain will go down in history. You literally, diet junko. This is Diet Junko. I'm the one, the only, the legendary ultimate inventor herself, Mui Ruma. Miru Ikusaba. Um, I've never heard of uh. you. So what kind of things do you invent? Hmm. I make all kinds of gadgets, ones that let you type while you sleep, read while you sleep. Most of the lot of things that you do while you sleep, even ones that you eat while you sleep. Uh. Why does everything involve sleeping? Sure. I was inspired after I realized how much time people waste on sleep. <laughs> Though, this one time I invented these really stupid eyedrop contact lenses as a gag. Huh? Wait, really? That's your invention? Some of my friends wear them. <laughs> your friends sound like total plebs. That invention was nothing. <laughs> it doesn't make you more productive while you sleep, so it was a failure, just like you two. I signed the patent rights over to some company and never looked back. That seems like a waste. It's way better than your do stuff while sleeping inventions. Um, By the way, what were you looking for earlier? You sounded pretty desperate to find what it. What was that? Eh? Are you a dumbass? In a situation like this, I gotta find some huh? meds. Medicine? Are you hurt or feeling fucking sick? Moron. No, idiot. I need some fucking moron. I need strong meds because I want to trip my fucking balls. <laughs> Alright, I like you, Mew. So I, I just want to set my mind free and forget all about this shitty situation. Oh, jeez. What? Wait, what? You can't use drugs to get high. You definitely shouldn't do that. Hey. Hey. Stop it! What the hell? My genius can't be constrained by the wisdom of the masses. Besides, this place probably doesn't even have the shit I need to get loosey-goosey. Oh, please forgive me. Please forgive me. So, so are we cool? Are you done being mad at me? They say there's a fine line between genius and insanity, but she's definitely beyond insane. Alright, so she, she's mean to everyone, and she can't take a, a, a single shred of animosity back at her. Okay. What's up with Sushi? He's been quiet ever since me mentioned his hat. Does he not like to talk about it? Take your hat off! Maybe he's just completely bald under the hat. Maybe he's got one of those monk things. I don't know. He's quiet now, maybe he doesn't like it when people talk about his hat. A shot put ball for track and field. Does this place even have a sports stadium? RC helicopter? A remote controlled helicopter, what's this doing in the school warehouse? Damn, what if that's gonna be used for a murder? Matt. These mats are pretty heavy, it must be a lot of work to carry these to the guy. Hurdle. There are hurdles too, we could hold our own track and field meets with all this equipment. Hmm. 
This looks like a high jump hole for track and field. I didn't expect to see professional equipment like this here. Is this a fucking Costco? Like, what's going on here? Please, please say I can knock everything off these shelves. Please. There's gotta be something here I can slap. How about her? Yeah, she'd probably like it. Oh, yes. Okay, so she, she's the best character so far. Not in a, I like her as a person kind of way, I just like her as a character. She's entertaining. The magician has has, has some potential. Let's, let's look at it, actually, let's see. She has some potential. Like, we're, we're, we're us, so that's just kind of eh. We're just kind of, we're just kind of nothing. He's kind of nothing too. He, he's just kind of like along for the ride. Like, it's like... The, 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 the male protagonist. Like this, just, just, just nothing. We're, we're nothing. Some potential. I really don't like you. If, if, depends on what you meant, but I really don't like you. As a, as a character, not really an interesting. I don't know, you're not really that interesting either. Like, I, I guess it'll depend on what kind of cute outfits you have, because I'm just that much of a weep. You're the most interesting character so far, but I d don't like you as a person. Um, you're nothing. I really don't like you. I don't like you as a person, I don't like you as a character, but we'll see. It's really, 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 really early. Dislikes cars? Likes extraterritorial rights. and dislikes cars, likes piano keys, dislikes bicycles, S likes small spaces, dislikes the ocean, likes nunchucks, dislikes men, yeah, okay, yeah, fuck you, likes e EVA phone, dislikes disorderly hues, likes children's television, dislikes taking it easy, <laughs> likes d novels, Dislikes gossip. You're a detective. You should live off gossip. Huh? It says ancient passport. Is this some kind of decoration? Hmm. I don't know. There's an indent in the middle. I wonder what this uh, that is. This place seriously has a lot of weird stuff. Damn, we need to get one and put it in the slot, and then it'll open somewhere to go. Click, click. Um. I guess this doesn't open. Let's look somewhere else. Right. Okay. Is this the trial room? I'm surprised we haven't found someone else's room yet. Are all the rooms on the same floor except for ours? Or is is the warehouse for the inventor and, and there's a gym for, for, for the martial artists or something? Is, is that how it works or, or what? Hmm. Is this the gaim? Huh? Uh, it won't open. Seems like we can go into the gaim. What's the matter? Hmm, what's the matter, Sushi? No. Uh, that's nothing. I just feel strange. Um. Strange? How so? Uh, okay. Like deja vu? I feel like I've been here before. Could it be... We might be caught up in something even stranger than we imagined. Mm. Well, it's natural to feel unsettled when we know so little about what's going on. Yeah. But we'll probably be fine. Um, what makes you say that? Because... Because we have 16 ultimate students on our side. As long as we work together as friends, I just know nothing bad will happen. Friendship, friends. Damn, classic Chandler. Alright, where are we going? No shortcut looking back? Damn. 
His hat is annoying, isn't it? Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Cobalt Midnight, for the new sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Cobalt Midnight. Uh, SMH Rampage used 500 bits to say, Hey, Joseph, my wife and I just picked up our brand new tradition of watching your com your complete Resident Evil 7 playthrough for Halloween each year. 10 out of 10 recommend. <laughs> Does it hold up? Really? Uh, I can't remember how long that how long that stream was. That was a pretty fun stream. I enjoyed myself with Resident Evil 7. Especially at the beginning. That game that be, that game uh, begins really, really well. Thank you so much for the best SMH Rampage. Um, Mashu K has resubscribed for three months with message just tuned in. Who's the best girl candidate so far? We are. We are the best girl candidate. We are we are thirsty as fuck, and we seem to be the most normal out of the girls so far. Most approachable. And uh, we're the ultimate pianist, which means that uh, we are respect res respectable, you know what I mean? Yeah, pretty pretty good. Uh, thank you very much for the resub. Uh, Bossa Nova Switch has resubscribed for three months. Thank you very much. Bossa Nova Switch. Bossa Nova is, is fun to say. Uh, w Patton 9210 has subscribed for the first time. Welcome to the Rub It Up Sub Club. W Patton 9210. Ashen Cater used some bits to say, we get ready for the 2018 hit Because I'm a Mage, written and performed by Joseph Anderson, featuring Shakira. <laughs> What? <laughs> the, spa the Space Dentist, that's an awesome name, has resubscribed for two months. Ain't no planet X coming, cause ain't no space, cause ain't got no globe Earth. Okay, all right. Thank you, the Space Dentist. Very, very spacey message. Thank you very much. Someone chat is asking, am I gonna play Ultra Despair Girls? I'm not going to play it. Or if I do, it won't be on stream. I don't think so. I'll, I'll never say never, but uh, it's, it is it is unlikely. It is unlikely. Uh, thank you, Ent Hunter, for the 100 bits. Uh, Miru Iruma is chat, lol. <laughs> no, they're not chat. They're, they're, no way, no way, no way. Let's, 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 like, like she's way better than chat. Uh, Sampai2798 <laughs> has used 100 bits. Love the Danganronpa series. So glad you're playing the game. I'm, I'm enjoying myself so far. I'm, I'm, I'm eager to get into it and, and see what happens in the first trial and see how it all comes together and see all the different characters and everything. Yeah. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. You guys are better than her. I'm just kidding. I'm just, I'm just joshing you. Uh, Checkmate has used 100 bits with Mew Gang Rise Up. Mew Gang, Mew Gang, Mew Gang, Mew Gang, Mew Gang. Uh, thank you very much, Checkmate. And Captain Meme has, re has, has subscribed for the first time with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Captain Meme. Thank you, thank you, Captain Meme. Capo 800 used 100 bits to say petition to call cosplayer Thick Sayaka. We, we can try, but usually the nicknames don't stick. Sometimes they do, but but not always. Okay, so we want to go all the way here and go down the other stairs, right? Or up the other stairs. How's it going, Vin? Oh, you've been having chocolate. Say hello. 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 Thank you for the tea. How are you feeling? Not too great. Did, did you have a cookie? Cookie time. Chocolate. Cookie time. Cookie time. Cookie time. Cookie time, cookie time, cookie time, cookie time. Cookie mm. time. Say hello. Oh mm no. -hmm. Is Hara the monkeys? <gasps> monkeys. They're monkeys. What do monkeys eat? Um, nanas. Nanas, yep. And what are they? Are they? Are they silly? Silly monkeys. Silly monkeys. Are you a silly monkey? Uh, no. No, you're not a silly monkey. Not silly monkey. No. No. Mm. You're silly no. Cat. Thin silly monkey? No silly monkey, no. No silly monkey, no. Can you say, wait a minute? <laughs> wait a minute. 
Okay. Okay, Daddy's gonna take a break soon, so come, Daddy will come see you in, in, in a couple of minutes, okay? So say bye bye. Bye bye now. Yes, bye bye. Bye bye. Yes, bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay, so checkered bandana flag thing is he like the ultimate driver, race car driver? No, but he has he has like a white coat on. What's that? Hey, wait for me. Yep. Which one? Katie. That's us. Yep. We're a girl, waifu is you. Hey, wait for me. Please stop. <sighs> what? It's a robo Nagito? Nagito Raiden? Like, what the fuck is he? Please stop, don't come any closer. That boy in white is chasing that other boy in the funny clothes. What's happening here? Damn. I'm really curious to find out, but first. Looks like that's a guy in white is chasing somebody. He doesn't look like he wants to be chased though. Should we stop him? Oh, meanie. The blackboard. This blackboard is also an LCD screen. It's something you don't see every day. Oh, that only shows up in inspect mode? Interesting. Alright, let's talk to this guy first because he's fucking nuts. Please stop! Please stop. Don't come any closer. <laughs> come on, wait up. Let me touch your body a little. I've always wanted to be friends with a robot. Huh? What? A robot? What is it? What is it? Are you another robophobe? <laughs> That's enough. <laughs> I have a recording function. If you make any robophobic remarks, I will see you in court. Wait, you're a robot? Are you for reals a robot? No. Are, are you one of the monocubs? Please stop! Do not compare me to those toys. I am not just any old robot. I am K1B0, the ultimate robot. But please, address me as Kibo. Um... Who thinks this is the best one? Come forward and be judged. The fucking dumb. He's a fucking robot. Step forward and be judged. <sighs> Ultimate robot. Hmm. That's not fair. You can't be the only one who gets to show off. I'll introduce myself to you. Yeah. Okay, oh, um, go ahead. I'm Kokichioma, the ultimate supreme leader. <sighs> what does that mean? It, like, you have a cult? A robot and supreme leader, neither of them make any sense. By the way, by the way I learned the hard way that a robot's breath smells like gasoline. How Damn, did rude. you kiss? My breath does not smell like gasoline. I am powered by electricity. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. That is not funny. You're not funny. Right? Of course you don't think I'm funny. Robots can't understand human humor to begin with. Do not mock me. me. I have studied the complete history of stand-up comedy. I think you should have just watched stand-up comedy instead of studying um, it. Plus, I may have the appearance of a robot, but I am a high school student just like you. Huh? You're a high school student? Yeah. I was created by Professor 
Idabashi, the leading authority in the field of robotics, he installed me in a strong AI capable of learning and maturing like a human brain. That's why, at the time of my creation, I didn't know anything, I was like a baby. But, but the professor raised me like I was his own child, but I guess I can't really be a robot because of how did the amnesia work on me like it worked on you? They must have had a separate situation set up for a robot like me. It's gonna turn out that this whole time, that I was not a robot and I am in fact a real boy. Geppetto lied, he finally taught me so many things until finally he enrolled me in high school. How about this? And now, I stand here before you all. See, I'm just like everyone else. Hey! Hey, do robots have dicks? <laughs> I'm surprised our character didn't ask that. Well, I hope he's gonna answer. Hey! Please do not ask ridiculous questions. Ridiculous questions? It's 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 a, it's a fair question. Nihihi. <laughs> <laughs> I only ask because your backstory is pretty flaccid for a robot. Ah! Well, I can see how being a robot might make might be enough to be called the ultimate robot. No. Um. Hey, Ko Ko Kokachi Ko. -ko Ko 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 Pikachu Pikachu. I don't really understand your ultimate supreme leader talent. Oh, I'm just a supreme leader of an evil secret organization, that's all. Huh? What? Um... I gotta say, it's pretty impressive. My organization has over 10,000 members. Yep, yeah, totally a cult. Huh? Seriously, the supreme leader of an evil secret organization- Because I'm a liar. Who knows? I'm a liar. I am a liar, after all. Huh? Ultimate liar? Huh? So you were lying just now? It's true! Well, I am the supreme leader of an evil secret organization. That part was true. Jeez. So were you lying or not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not telling you. Hey! Uh, by the way, what is the name of the organization? I really like the camera moving from one character to the other. Like, that's that's cool. Ah. It's a secret, you know, because it's a secret organization. Because it's a game. Because, but I've never heard of such a large secret organization like that. Because it's a secret. Maybe. Of course you haven't. Because it's a secret organization. Yeah, get with the program. You're the ultimate detective, really. Jeez. Hey, everything he said so far has sounded like a lie. So it's got to be a lie too, oh. right? Dear. Just leave him alone. Just leave him alone. Everything he has been saying has been a lie. He's a far more suspicious person than I am, that's for sure. <laughs> well, of course you're not a suspicious person because robots aren't people, silly. <laughs> Don't even have a dick. He's right. Doesn't doesn't even have a dick, Morty. You, this guy has no dick. You mad? Oh, you. <laughs> Does anybody like the the Rick impression? <laughs> I mean, I like doing it, but does anyone like... <laughs> Are you mad if you could hit me with a rocket punch? I can't! I don't, I don't have that function. Um, it seems pretty split between the two. Some people like it, some people don't. Aw oh, man, you're boring. What a weird boy. He's like a mischievous little kid. Mischievous? This is no time to be joking around unless he really is an evil supreme leader. Oh, uh, we're gonna be taking a break after we meet everyone, by the way. That, we're gonna take a five minute break after that. Okay, so he, this guy is an interesting character. I don't really like him, but that doesn't, I don't have to like a character to find him interesting. This guy, at the moment, is complete trash tier, but hopefully he gets better. This guy fucking sucks. But yeah, this this it's it's really early, so these are my first impressions. Please do not please do not leave a 2000 award YouTube comment telling me that I shouldn't be thinking out loud. First impressions. He might get better, he might get worse. He might actually grow a personality, okay? Just I'm just I'm just thinking out loud. I'm sorry. This guy sucks right now. He doesn't even have a dick. Yeah, basement. Hmm. I don't know, the basement might be dangerous. This place is full of mysteries. That's right. Then let's proceed with caution, with you at the front. Uh, okay. Ah, so I'm in the front, I see. With, hesi with hesitant sushi leading the way, we carefully made our way down the stairs. Um. 
doesn't look very dangerous to me. Really? Oh ah, well, some dangers are hidden where you can't see. I see. Sushi, you have quite the imagination, don't you? No. No, I just think you're not considering how dangerous this is. <laughs> yeah, maybe you should look around the basement too. Damn, right? We're weebs. There might be an exit. Oh, but we should be careful. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, you're right. Oh, what's this? Video games? Game room? Oh, damn. Game room and library. Well, fuck that. We're going to the game room. Fuck books, right? Books suck. Too much symbolism. Oh, we haven't gotten to the bottom of the barrel yet because we have to talk to this guy. Looks like a game room, but this is a school, right? Is it normal for a school to have its own well. game room? It certainly is strange. Finding coins. Okay, we can't inspect the games, really? Okay, I don't care about the monitor. Alright. Let's talk to sushi. Hmm. I can see roots in this room too. I don't think the game machines will work. Yeah, the roots are really weird. What's that about? Alright. What now? What the fuck are you? Sheesh. What a strange place. Finn looks older than this. Okay, do we even need to pull it that this guy's gonna be have Manfred's voice? Oh sheesh, what a strange place. When I heard we were trapped here, I didn't expect we'd have a game room. Um, Are we really trapped here? There must be an exit, right? We've still got a ways to go. <laughs> He sounds like fucking Gundam. What? Isn't that what you... Oh, isn't that what you guys are walking around looking for? Then figure it out yourself. Yeah. Oh, okay. However. <laughs> we may be trapped, but it's pretty cool here compared to prison. Anyway, <laughs> compared to prison. Prison? What? But you're an ultimate student, aren't you? I'm, I'm, I'm the ultimate prison escapist. That's an old story. <laughs> Ryoma Hoshi, the man called the ultimate tennis pro, no longer exists. What? I'm nothing more than his empty shell. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Really? I've seen you in the newspaper, the tennis prodigy who single-handedly took down a map. You took down a mafia by yourself. I'm not laughing at it. I'm laughing with it. I'm laughing with it. I'm not laughing at it. This is fucking hilarious. <laughs> You took down a mafia by yourself. If I remember correctly. The paper said he shot them. <laughs> he shot them through the head with his tennis skills. And an iron ball. He's like Daredevil with a tennis racket and balls. <laughs> this is my city. <laughs> What the hell, really? <laughs> so you know that much already? Well, what do you think of the loser before you who used his talent to kill? <laughs> but why would you throw away your future like Jeez. that? <laughs> because I didn't need a future anymore. Huh? <laughs> no. No, it's nothing. It's not like me talk. It's not like me to talk so much. More importantly. 
Anyway, I'm warning you, it's dangerous to just walk up to a killer like me. As he said that, he turned his back to us. His back is still turned to us. You should listen when people give you warnings, I won't say it again. Oh yeah? <laughs> oh, you did say it again, fucking liar. Hmm. Looks like it's locked. Yeah. I wonder what's inside this room. Oh, we can investigate it later. Is he my favorite now? E easily the favorite. This the, the door isn't on on the map. That's kind of weird. Easily my favorite. Huh? Thud, huh? Um, what's wrong? Um, this door barely opens a crack. Was it poorly I built? See. Well, nothing we can do about it. Let's search somewhere else. As soon as I opened the door, I suddenly gagged from the musty smell of old books. Hmm. Is this a library? You're right. There are books all over the place. It doesn't seem very <gasps> organized. Oh, does that bother you? Are you a neat freak, Sushi? No. No, it's just I was wondering if someone was using it before us. Nah, if you, to, to be a neat freak, neat freak, you'd have to have a personality. Huh? Huh? Someone? No. That's uh, nothing. Let's just investigate for now. Okay. Um. Who we're missing one, two, three, four, five. Okay, let's take break now because we're already over over time. Let's take break now. I didn't realize there's so many left. I thought there was only like two left, but of course there are, there are more than that. I just thought there was nowhere else to go. All right, let's take break now. Who who, who do you want to look at while while we're on break? Damn, he looks weird. Robot guy. Main character. All right, there we go, Katie. Katie. Okay, uh, I'm gonna run some scumbag ads, and um, I'll be back in five minutes. What are the videos doing? Hope you guys liked it. I know it's a short one, but um, that's what we're having now until Witcher. Anyway, here come the ads.
Did you guys enjoy your scumbag ads? gang rise up Mew gang Mew gang Mew gang uh, in your heart he's 100 bits to say hey Joe have you heard about the Undertale sequel Delta run that came out a, came out a day or so ago and would you be interested in playing it after the Wii Battle Royale I'm very interested in, in trying it out um, I want to know a little more information about it before I get into it um, I heard someone say that it might be episodic and if that's the case, then I would rather not play it until it's all done. Uh, I really don't like playing things in episodes or reading things in episodes or even watching things. I, I prefer to have the full thing done when it's when I get into it. Um, I, I don't doubt that he's going to finish it, like like, but uh, I just don't like waiting. I'm very impatient. So, yeah, but I'm interested in it for sure. I'm surprised it's a sequel. I don't think you can follow Undertale up well, but we'll see. I'll, I'm willing to be surprised. Timmy Timmy uses 100 bits to say, uh, Kokichi is obviously best boy and Ryo Ma is second best boy. Dab on the haters. Damn, I'm dabbing. I'm dabbing. I can dab and drink at the same time. I'm dabbing. Anton699 uh, used some bits to say, Celeste voice, best voice, Craigasm. Obligatory reminder. Yeah, some people really hate this last voice. I'm surprised. All, all my voices, apart from Nagita voice. Nagita voice is the only one. Maybe Pleasant Boy voice. I think those are the only two that people universally like. I'm sure there's some people don't like them, but mo the majority of the people like Nagita voice and Best Boy voice, but they hate the others. What was Waffles voice? Is the reaction to Waffles voice? Or, or Yusuke? I'm not sure. Maybe Yusuke and Waffles voice are okay. Waffles voice is Batman. Uh, Checkmate subscribed. I think Checkmate just gave some bits as well, right? Thank you, Checkmate. Thank you so much. Welcome to Prime Time. And Saren has uh, subscribed as well with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time. Thank you so much, Saren. Uh, really, Rolith, uh, I love how much you're enjoying this game, pissing on your expectations. Love it. <laughs> the series has been pretty good about that, I have to say. But I, I, I like getting, like, looking at it and going, what the fuck is this guy's story going to be? And that's completely different. I like getting invested and then I can turn around. It's fun. Darkling the Second, he's using bits to say, so what was that about this group sucking again? I think overall so far it has been kind of weak, but there's still a lot of characters left to meet, so we'll see. I have high hopes. High hopes. Uh, x Paltin he's using 100 bits, just to say seems good, 100. Thank you very much, x Paltin. Jacob S197, he's using bits. Death by balls, what a way to go. Death by balls. What a way to go. Uh, Majestic Sapling 420, that's an interesting name, has subscribed with Prime. Thank you very much. Welcome to Prime Time. I'm finishing my tea here uh, while, I'm, while I'm reading these up, by the way. Uh, Majestic Sapling, that's a really cool name. Uh, Millie Becca has subscribed with Prime as well. Welcome to Prime Time, Millie Becca. Welcome, welcome. Thanks so much. Timmy Timmy is another hundred bits. Seeing as how you're playing as a girl, your only real waifu option is a lesbian girl. Tenko is the only one that dislikes men so far, so Tenko is your waifu. You're welcome. Oh, shit lawyered fucking lawyered hey but where it's it's a video game so no matter what anyone will sleep with you that's what i've learned in games oh, fucking lawyered by timmy action cater used to say hey what's wrong with Sek Sekira shakira being featured on your hit single oh it's nothing wrong with it it's just like shakira out of nowhere shakira 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 is like pretty pretty talented she seems really nice and she's like super hot man Shakira is really good. Shakira is the, the whole package. Uh, Eng, 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 U, X, E, O, E, N, G, U, I, X, A, O. I'm not going to try again. Sorry. Very, thank you for the sub. Sorry for butchering your name. Thank you very much. Welcome to Prime Time. And Chubbiest Thread. Interesting name. Has also sub with Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Chubbiest Thread. Shakira, Shakira, Shakiro, Shakiro, Chiaki, Chiaki. Thank you, much, should be a start. All right, let's keep going. I'm eager to meet the other people. Uh, 
Okay, so we can inspect the bookshelves. Are each one of them new? Or different? These books seem difficult to read, and they're not even written in a language I recognize. Yeah, I'm not going to bother with them. All right, that's back bookcase, middle bookcase. Books written in various languages lie on the shelf. Some of these letters make no sense. What languages are these supposed to be? There are a lot of books crammed in here, and they're all in different languages, too. How is anyone supposed to, to take a book off the shelf when they're crammed in like this? Damn. Oh, we can clean the place up. My favorite. Okay, what are you? Interesting hairpin. We already had a writer. Reader? Hey. Um, are you an ultimate student too? Okay. Yeah, that's right. All right. Is that 2B? Huh? Is that it? She sure doesn't like. She did sure. She sure doesn't talk much. I. I'm Katie Akamatsu. I'm the ultimate pianist. I'm. I'm Sushi Sahara, and I'm, I'm and I'm the ultimate detective. I suppose. Jeez. Jeez, not suppose. You are the ultimate detective. Okay. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're right. Um. And what about you? Maki Harukawa, ultimate child caregiver. They really do just put a bunch of shit on a, on a wall and just throw darts, huh? Just a thousand things that they could do and they just like whip the darts there and then they get like 50 from that and then they whittle it down from that, huh? I see. Ultimate child caregiver, huh? <sighs> Surprised. I don't look like someone who'd like kids, do I? Huh? Huh? That's right. Well, you'd be right. I don't like kids that much. I like her voice. Um, but if you're the ultimate child caregiver, then children must... Oh, is that why so many of the cast look like kids? That's why. Oh, okay. That makes sense. All right. Because she has to look after the five lollies and ashadas. There we go. But if you're like the ultimate child caregiver, then children must... Children must like you a lot, right? I don't care. Kids are weird. They come to me on their own. I'm not that good at taking care of them. I'm not that friendly either. Mm -hmm. But but they say kids are very intuitive. If they like you that much, hey. then they can probably tell how loving you really are, Maki. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that must be it. You've chosen a perfect career for yourself. That's wrong. It wasn't my choice. No, that's wrong. It wasn't my choice to begin. Okay, something's off with this girl. Huh? huh? What do you mean by so that? what? Nothing. Oh, she's doing shiaki puff out cheeks. I'm in love. It's just I grew up in an orphanage and got saddled with helping out a lot. Orphanage, huh? I see. Um, uh, by the way, do you know anything about the Mana Cubs? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, someone's got to be controlling them, right? Any idea who that might be? Like, they're, they're cubs, so they must love you, right? Like I'd know. How would I know? Hmm. Well, they're cubs, and you're the child care, care, caregiver. Well, fair point. Hmm, the Mana Cubs are definitely involved in that situation. Know. Hey, boy detective, shouldn't you have figured out what's going on already? Huh? What? Um. Well, he's a detective, not a god. You can't know everything. Yeah. I mean, who cares about some stuffed animals? Escaping this place is way more important. Well... Seriously? You think we can escape? Abducting ultimates from across the country would require massive resources and planning. What makes you think a group capable of that, of that would let us just walk out of here? That's not true. If they won't end, if they won't end this, then we w then we will. I can't read. I'm sorry. I know we can do it if we work together. What? Work together with strangers? You're a naive fool if you think you can end this so easily. Yeah, that got us a friendship fragment. Nice. All right, so you're interesting because I feel like we actually had an actual conversation, which is rare. Okay, I want to look at the globe. That was kind of odd. She didn't seem like the ultimate child Jeez. caregiver. Jeez, don't say that. Mm. 
What a beautiful globe. She really didn't feel like the, the, the ultimate child caregiver. Likes morning lake shores, dislikes winter lake shores. Likes Russian blues, dislikes white tip reef sharks. I was gonna say, I wonder, I wonder if some, some of the ultimate abilities got mixed up when the memories came back, but enough of the other people actually do have their have their their abilities so 97 pounds holy fuck that can't be right what a beautiful globe that's it That looks like a ladder from reaching books on the higher shelves. What does the robot weigh? That's actually a really good question. Let's see, what does the robot weigh? 196 pounds at 5'3". Uh, could be his armor, could be his clothes. Likes 100 to 240 volts, dislikes vending machines. Likes carbonated drinks, dislikes pig feet. Okay then. Okay, we went all the way down here, so where are we going now? This is where we met the robot and the and the supreme leader. We're still in here, okay. Did the gate over there open? Yeah, it did. Okay, who's in here? Oh, we couldn't get through here before, right? Looks like the iron gate opened. Did someone open it for us? Let's check it out. Oh, who's the ultimate iron gate opener? <clears throat> oh, is this the entrance hall? Right, Sushi? This must be the entrance hall, don't you think? Uh, okay. Yeah, I suppose so. Hey. Which means, I suppose... South. Mm -hmm. Bible. That door must be the entrance. If we walk through it, we can escape this place, right? No. Wait, I don't think we should open doors carelessly. It could be a trap. Do not worry. Okay. Worrying about that isn't necessary. I've already examined the doors. Is this the one that had the mask on in before the clothes changed? Uh, oh, uh. Yes. You wonder, who is this? Yes, I shall make that clear first. My name is Korekio Shinguji. I am called the ultimate anthropologist. Damn, that dart went really high left on, on the wall. Kyo, anthropologist. Oh. Please call me Kyo. <clears throat> As for anthropology, would you like a simple explanation? See. Okay, sure. Anthropology is studies customs, legends, folk tales, songs, and much more. There may even be customs in your daily life, the origins of which you do not know. Let's see. For example, certain aspects of birth of birthday or New Year celebrations. Anthropology sheds light on traditions and customs such as these through rigorous analysis. All right, this guy's interesting. It is a study that examines the thought behind culture, faith, and mm -hmm. customs. Okay, I sort of get it, but not really. It sounds like a lot of fun, though. That's correct. Well, of course it's fun. It is a study focused on humanity. Beautiful. I believe that human beings are creatures who possess infinite beauty. Um. Not that it really matters that much, but are you a boy or a girl? Sorry to get my Professor Oak on, but... Does he have Gundam hands? Oh, um... I... Mikan? I find all aspects of humanity, even the ugly parts, to be beautiful. Oh, 
present situation is rather intriguing. What beauty will I be able to witness here? Humanity is beautiful. Hehehe, <laughs> people are wonderful. I'm gonna go with boy. This guy looks like a creep, but as it turns out, he is one too. There we go, yeah. Hmm. Anyway, we can go outside if we just go through these doors, if right? so. You should find the answers to such questions on your own. The moment your hopes are shattered, that too may be beautiful. Shattered? What does he mean by that? He's pretty hot, not gonna lie. Those are some hot eyes. Let's go. Shuichi. Then let's go. Uh, okay. okay. Determined as I was, I just couldn't muster the courage to take that first step forward. To be honest, I was scared because what if beyond this is just... That's wrong. I, no, that's wrong. Ah, jeez, this isn't like me. Uh, Just because I'm scared doesn't mean I'm gonna run away. I gotta move forward. Are you okay? K Katie. Of course. Don't worry about it. Let's go, Sushi. I sucked myself up and with newfound strength, walked boldly toward the doors. Upon opening the doors, we were immediately greeted by blue skies, bright sunlight, Gentle wind and a giant shark that's gonna eat sushi. And. A, a cage? A wall? Both words were accurate. What stood before us was both cage and wall. <laughs> both words were accurate. What stood before us was both cage and wall. Either way, the enormous wall struck a terrifying chord, and I should know, the mere sight of its imposing presence was enough to send waves of panic through me. No matter where we looked, ahead, behind, above, or all around, the cage surrounded the entire school. What is this? We're trapped? What's going on? Rise and shine, sign! Hey. It does look like there should be a sixth monocub. Surprised about the cage, huh? I totally understand how you feel. The first time I saw it, my teeth and fingernails fell out. That's not a healthy way to react to a surprise. Yeah. But it's so awesomely huge, I can see why it's called the end wall. Huh? End wall? That's right. Normally walls are erected to separate two places, right? But that wall is different. It represents the end of the world. What are you talking what? about? Hmm? What were we talking about? Yeah. Huh? Was someone talking? Was I talking? <laughs> 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 Stop laughing and explain yourselves. There's nothing to explain. This is simply how it is, so please don't bother. You can't get out of here. That wall has no entrances or exits, and it cannot be climbed or demolished. Well, actually, An ultimate could probably climb it part way, but most of the time it's impossible. What? But they can still sort of climb it, huh? I took a deep breath and shouted at the wall as loud as I could. Stupid wall! Someone help us! Eep! Please help us! Eep, eep! Someone, anyone, please help us! We're trapped inside this huge cage! I think they've noticed the cage, Katie. I think they've noticed the cage. I don't think shouting is going to help. Eep, eep, eep. I shouted as loud as I could, but for all my shouting, there was no response. Stop it! Please stop, you'll hurt your throat. That's right! Yeah, scream all you like. No one can hear you anyway. Huh? No one can hear us? Hey! What do you mean? What do you mean no one can hear us? Wait! Say something. Hey! One of you, just answer. Damn it! Damn it! Hmm. Monodam is ignoring them excellently because he refuses to open his heart. Because he's a mage. You can thank my fearsome bullying for making that happen. Hmm. Now, now, let's all get along. Dumbass. Shut up! We're the Mono Cubs. We need to be tough and whatnot. Uh. What is this? You things, the school. What is all so. this? You bastards will have to use your legs, hands, and eyes to find that out for yourselves. Actually. But please watch your step while you explore. The school is still under construction. Huh? Under construction? I looked around. It was true. Some areas did seem as if they were still under construction. You're on the threshold of an amazing adventure. 
It looks like they're still building some of the facilities here. Um. Are they still in the middle of building the school? No. I don't think so. It seems more like they're renovating an abandoned school. Mm. Either way, the construction will finish soon once we set the exosiles on autopilot. Huh? Exosiles. Hell yeah! Once part of a biker gang. Sure. The exosiles now work construction to support their wives and kids. Do robots really need that kind of backstory? I don't know, let's go ask the fucking robot. Um, their steering wheels are leopard print, and their dashboards are lined with arcade prizes. Are you stupid? Seriously, knock it off, you guys. They sound like douchebags with backstories like those. So long, farewell. So long, farewell. And there they go again, but more importantly, it's what they said really true. I wonder how many times we're going to hear so long, farewell. We can't escape, we can't go over that wall. And no one's going to rescue us. Uh, but if I give up now, then what? I slapped both my cheeks and my face grew warm. And as my face grew warm, I could feel my determination returning. Hey, hey Sushi, let's go see if we can find a way out. Who's my favorite Monica? The one that doesn't talk, Monadam. I slapped him upside his head just firm enough to get his attention. Ow. Ow. You know? Sushi, I'm not great at motivating others, but we can't just give up because of a wall. We came in somewhere, so there has to be an exit. Yeah, that's right. We may not be able to escape now, but we'll do it eventually, somehow. Yeah. Everyone just has to cooperate if we all want to get out of here. Yeah, that's right. It's too early to give up. We talk a lot more than the other characters in, in the games. Yeah, that's right. It's too early to give up. too early. Okay, there's a person over there. Dormitory. Alright. Is this Hope's Peak? This is not Hope's Peak. Under construction with Monokuma's face. Well, this is neat. As unexpected and refreshing as the um, island theme was, I do like being trapped in a school a lot more. It's more intimate, I guess. You can't really get away that well. Although, it seems like there's a, oh shit, it seems like there's, there's a huge amount of area out here, so maybe I'm wrong about that. The fuck are you? Okay, let's go back. Damn, why can't, why can't we go over here? Is there a Pokemon in the grass or something? Okay. Jeez, how do they even make this big ass wall? Mm. Seriously, I just don't get hey. it. I wonder what will happen now if we can't escape them. Hey. What are you? What are you complaining? Huh? huh? Listen up. Quit complaining and grumbling, or I'll turn in, or it'll turn into a habit. Yeah. Besides, this cage is nothing compared to the vastness of the universe. Um. Huh? The universe? Got it. Oops, I haven't introduced myself yet. Uh, my bad. I'm the ultimate astronomer. I'm Kaito Momota, luminary of the stars. Even crying children adore the ultimate astronaut. Okay, have you actually been to space? Because if you haven't, it's bullshit. Huh. How about it? I'm an astronaut. Isn't that cool? Mm. Does he have space on the inside of his coat? Yeah, I've never been to space, so I don't know much about it. Haha, <laughs> well, of course, not just anyone can get up there. Yeah, I know, you need a rocket. I may be an astronaut, but I'm actually still in training. I see. Oh, I see, so you're still a trainee. But you know. But I'm the first teenager to ever pass the exam. I mean, normally you need a college degree to even take the huh? exam, huh? Then how'd you take the exam? So... I had a friend who was pretty crafty, so I had him forge some stuff oh, for me. Geez. That's illegal. Yeah. Yeah, I ended up getting caught. I was in pretty deep shit. I can't believe there's something dumber than the ultimate robot. 
but the people who up top decided they liked me and let me in anyway because, of course, I aced the exam Jeez. too. But that's reckless. Got it. Sometimes you gotta be a little reckless to make your dreams a reality. Huh. No way I can wait till after college. I want to get to space as fast as I can. Right. You sure have a lot of energy. Got it. Yeah, everyone told me it was impossible, but I never gave up, not for a moment. That's because limits don't exist unless you set them yourself. Alright, go climb the fucking Let's wall. Do it. There are no walls you can't get over. Okay, go do it. That same goes for that one. Alright, prove it. Could it be So do you have any ideas? Sometimes left click doesn't work. That's frustrating. That's not the problem. Um no, that is the problem. Jeez, this guy sure talks a big game. Darts at a wall, man. Darts at a wall. Yeah, that's, that's space shit on the inside of his coat. That's kind of neat. Where, where can I get this coat? Don't worry about it. There are no walls you can't get over. We'll think of a way out later. If they're not here, you complaining or grumbling. I think now is a good time to think of a way out. So he's kind of Nadai-ish, I guess? Everyone stay together and be nice and everyone's friendly and get along and... This building is round and has a lot of smaller rooms Very inside. Nice to see you again. Oh god. Very nice to see you again. Very nice to see you again. Why, hello, Bear. We're intruding. Sorry to intrude. Jeez. What is it this time? And what do you mean by intruding? Because this is your home, you bastards. <laughs> we finished setting up the showers. Now you can go now you can go pee. Hey. Why don't they just use the toilets? Uh. Huh? Even for number two? Ah. Wait, do you go number two in the shower? Ew, that's gross. So long, farewell. So long, farewell. What's that for now? Um. What do you mean our home? Could it be? Could it be? They mean for us to live here. See, there are 16 doors. Perhaps a room for each of us. Stop it. I don't plan on staying here long enough to need a room. Hmm. Okay, so. Which one are we? Are we this one? Is this us? I think that's us. Okay. You kind of look like 2B. Uh, um... Their drawings hung up on each door, maybe in place of nameplates. Why go through the trouble to do this? What are they planning? But... I fail to see their objective. Um... Huh? What do you mean? You have spiderweb on your apron? Were you the ultimate goth maid? How? If they are holding us for ransom, a large facility such as this would be unnecessary. Furthermore, I gather they would rather care for us than hurt us. In light of this, I fail to see the true objective of the culprits responsible for kidnapping us. Culprits, huh? I never even thought about that. Why would our kidnappers go to this, all this trouble? Sixteen ultimate students have been gathered here, but why? What's the reason? Excuse me. Pardon me, I have not introduced myself yet. I am Hirumi Tojo, the ultimate maid. Please let me know if you require my service. This is to be number one. Can't wait for her to die in the first trial. I see. Wow, the ultimate maid sounds like a really cool talent. Oh. Damn, she really made it. Ah, uh, wait, I've heard of Kirumi Tojo. If I remember correctly, an ultimate with incredible intellect and strength, working as a private maid. I heard that her work is so perfect she can complete any request given to her. Huh? What? She's that amazing? I do not agree. Please, you're exaggerating. I will not complete any request that is asked of me. <sighs> I once received a request to annihilate a rival nation, but as it was impossible, I rejected it. But being requested to do that is pretty impressive on its own. That's true. I've also heard that she's been hired as a bodyguard to several foreign dignitaries. I do not agree. I have only been employed as a maid, not a bodyguard. I see. But you've been hired by so many important people. You're not, you're like a super maid. May I? Moving on, what do you intend to do now? Mm. Put a blindfold on you. But that's a tough question. Um, what should we do? Um. What would you, what would you do, key roomie? I do not agree. Want to be our roomie? I hold no opinions or desires of which to speak. I am a maid. As a maid, my only desire is to fulfill the desires of others. It's literally to be. So please think about what you desire for yourself and what you desire for me. For everyone. No matter the situation, no matter what happens, I'm here to serve everyone. 
Even in this situation, she's more concerned for others. Well, she's the ultimate maid after all. Damn, I like this girl. I think there's more to her than just like, she just does whatever someone tells her to do. Don't plan on staying here long enough to leave your room. I don't plan on staying here long enough to leave your room. I don't plan on staying here long enough to leave your room. I don't plan on staying here long enough to leave your room. Dr. Lingard. Okay, we have this guy right here. Another statue? Um, is this a ninja statue? You're right. It looks like one, but why is this here? Seriously, there's so many odd things. Hmm. What are these are gonna be for? Okay, there's some rocks in the way we can't get past, so let's just go kill three really difficult bosses. Or we'll get a million souls. Alright, what do you want? Intense. Damn, we're level 9 already. Whoa, this guy looks scary. He's so big and handsome and muscular. Um, um excuse me. Huh? Hmm? Thank you. Oh, thank you. Huh? Huh, thank you. Sorry. Oh, sorry for scaring. Um. Gonta scary looking. Oh no. Oh please God, don't say he speaks like. Gonta scary looking. Most people not want to talk to Gonta when meeting for first time. Cause Gonta gentleman. Gonta. So like gentlemen, Gonta say thank you. Thank you for talking to Gonta. Yeah. Um, thank you for being so polite. He looks scary, but he doesn't seem very scary oh. at all. Oh, right. Gunta need to make introduction. Um, um Gunta's name is Gunta Gokuhara. Uh, Gunta's talent is ultimate entomologist. Gunta want to become gentleman. Becoming true gentleman, Gunta's goal. I see. So, G Gunta? 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 It sounds like it's a U. Gunta? Oh, so you're Gonta. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say Gonta every time. Gunta? Yeah, that's a really cute name. Huh? Really? The thing? Aw, oh, he's blushing. Aw, yeah. oh, you're actually pretty nice, silly me for being so scared at first. Maybe. Oh, Gonta's scary looking, huh? Sorry. Oh, sorry, that's not what no. I. No, it's okay. Gonta used to it. Gon Gunta is called scary since he was a kid. Um. Since you were a kid, huh? Oh. Gunta kid Gunta is bigger than other kids. Other kids scared of Gunta. So Kid Gunta to play alone. That's how Gunta come to like bugs. Uh, thank you, Valence4, for the uh, 4 3 sub. Thank you very much. 4 and 4. Thank you, Valence4. Follow the gospel to be subscribed for 10 months with a message. Hey, 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 follow the gospel. Thank you so much. Ah, fuck it, I'll do it. Hey, hey, thank you, follow the gospel. Uh, chubbiest thread used a thousand bits. There she is. The S. H S L Ultimate Mommy 2B. S H S L? What's S H S L? Thank you so much for the bits. I don't know what S H S L means, sorry. S H S L. Is it really 2B? Is the maid 2B? Cause what came out first? Cause that's kinda spooky. Super high school. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I know that from the um, from the from the uh, the anime. Sorry, I forgot. S super su super high school level. Yep. Okay. Thank you so much for the bit. Show me start. Action cater use 100 bits to say what you have that left click problem too. I thought it was because my computer doesn't have the best RAM or graphics card, which in hindsight I should have ruled out because I started using a controller to play the game. My inputs were much faster. I suggest using a controller if that problem persists, especially because it gets annoying during the flash trial. Is, is, is that? It's not just during. It's not just during Texas that the game just doesn't like. Sometimes just doesn't read the input of a left click. Okay, tomorrow I'll switch over to controller. I don't want to plug a controller in right now. I've, I feel like the game might like spaz out. 
Honestly, it just goes to show how fucking generic 2B's character design is. Wow. You. You just made an enemy for life. How dare you. How dare you. Did I watch the Rampa 3 Future Arc Despair arc anime? I watched half of it. I've watched six episodes in each one. Damn. But when Gunta really focus, it easy to lose track. One day Gunta go to forest and f to find bugs, end up I lost. See. Then found gor gorillas who raised me. That sounds rough. Were they able to find you right away? Mm. Yeah, it took. T oh my god, he did. Oh my god. No. Why? Yeah, it took 10 years though. Huh? 10 years. What? But Gunta, fine. New family took care of Gunta. Hmm. I, I see. I'm glad they were nice people. Um. Oh, not people. Wolves. Huh? Wolves. What? But they really nice. Because of Forest Family, Gunta learned to speak bug and animal. Gunta. As thanks, Gunta want to show Forest Family what great gentleman Gunta is. Um, how is becoming a gentleman going to thank them for that? Mm. This place strange, huh? Lots of plants, but no bugs. Huh? Wait, really? I suppose it's understandable that there are no animals, but no insects? That's strange, not even one bug. That's literally fucking impossible, so we're in a simulation. You mean... You like bugs too? Amazing! Huh. What is your favorite bug? What what you like about uh, them? Um... Uh, no, 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 I wasn't saying that I like bugs or anything. b b, -b baka Wait! Then you hate bugs? Huh? What? But how? Y you hate bugs? That's not true. Uh, um, you don't hate bugs. You love them, right, Sushi? Uh, okay. Yeah, of course I do. I love bugs. Damn, you should play Fallout 76. That good. No bad person likes bugs. I'm saying friendship fragment. Hmm. That was scary. Phew, yeah, I thought you were gonna die. Honestly, I can't stand bugs either. It might be the best to hide that. This place, how, lots of green but no bugs. How come? Spooky door. What? Okay, well, you, like, that's kind of, you're in, a, in sort of like a bikini, but you have, are those brushes? Are you makeup? Ultimate makeup artist? I was, I was gonna think dancer with the getup, but no. Ultimate in Instagram thought? Like, what what are you? So I like to guess. I like to guess what they are. Ultimate clown? Place is in much better shape than the school. Is someone taking care of it? Yeah. Yeah. How are you? Her face looks familiar. That's Owie. Isn't that Owie's face? Like literally Owie's face. It's not her hair. Yeah. How are you? My name is Angie Yonaga. I'm the ultimate artist. Angie? Alright, artist. Alright. Okay, you seem alright. Um. You're pretty cheerful. She's a bit too happy considering the situation we're in right now. Nah, <laughs> <laughs> there's no reason to carry bad thoughts with you. You gotta live every day like it's bright, cheery, and fun. Do you want some ice cream? Atua says so. so says Atua. Huh? Atua. Atua. I... The god of my island, Atua, is always with me, speaking to me with his divine voice. Oh, well, she's clearly devout. Um. 
do you specialize in painting or sculpting? Uh... Um, I do both. Paint, I paint paintings and I sculpt sculptures. But Atua is the, the one who makes the art. I merely offer my body as his vessel. So divine! <laughs> how divine. I see. I see, that's interesting. If you don't mind, can you show me some of your artwork? Of course, of course! Of course. Your voice is familiar. Celeste? Who's the voice actress? Is she, is she voiced a, a character before? If you hold right click during combos, you can... Yeah, I, I, I... Oh, now I can move it. I couldn't move it before. So you can do hostile confirm, hostile refute, friendly refute, or friendly confirm. Um, An offering. Uh, Every Monday and Wednesday morning on my island, a truck comes to collect offerings. What? That sounds oddly similar to putting out sh the trash for pickup. But, but... Don't worry, don't worry. When I say offering, I just mean a pint or two of your blood. Don't worry. Sorry. I'm a bit anemic, so I'll pass. I see. I see. What about you then? Huh? Huh? Me? Uh, yep. Boy's blood is also an acceptable offering. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Oh, it worked that time. I understand, but... Oh, does it do nothing? You don't get it, do you? Huh? Huh? What's this for? Yeah, that's right. Come on, come on! It won't hurt one bit. Ugh. Wait a minute. You think so? That's wrong! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> don't run away. Oh. Even smaller, owie. This this girl is so weird. Okay, is that everyone now? Angie. 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 Oh, body's been discovered. Huh? I would love it so much if that's what it is. Was that the bell? Ah. Katie, look, the monitor. Thanks for pairing with us! You bastards! Kept you bastards waiting, huh? All right. Everyone, make your way to the gym, please. <gasps> Wait, what? They have dolls of them? Alright, so that's the... Are they all here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Yeah, they're all here. Huh. Interesting. Okay. Phew. Phew, we finally finished our preparations. Hey. You do realize you just read your lines backwards, don't you? So long, farewell. So long, farewell. Five. Jim, opening ceremony. Hey. Katie, what should we do? Um. What should we do? Go, of course. Everyone else is probably doing the same you're thing. Right. True, but I'm a little worried about this. Well, I'm not a little worried. I'm very worried. Alright, so that's everybody. See how it just stopped working there for a second? Yeah, definitely gonna switch over to our gamepad for next stream. Okay, so let's go through it. Um, who are the new ones? She likes cleaning, dislikes taking days off. 5'9", 115 pounds, damn. Um, small space is the ocean. Uh, da, 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 da. Angie. Yep, not even gonna try to say that last name. Likes avocados, dislikes humidity. Not even gonna try. All right, uh, 
Who's the other one? D likes houseplants, dislikes the occult. Likes orthropods, dislikes bananas. Oh damn, he, he really wasn't, he's, he's not Tarzan after all. Uh, likes straw, what the fuck is the mask? What? Likes straw ropes, dislikes air conditioning. Okay, I, uh, more, more, uh, more fucking darts to the board, I guess. Uh, the Roachkun has subscribed to Prime. Thank you very much, the Roachkun. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to Prime Time. Radski5 used 510 bits to say, I went and bought Bang Rampel 1, 2, and 3. Thanks to you. Gonna go into the, th into the third blind, so I have to sit this one out. Thanks for the entertainment, you pretentious, long-winded weeb. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not a weeb. Whoa, whoa, whoa. One too far. One too far. I may have turned down sex to watch anime. And I may have not showered this morning. And I may have had a nosebleed. But I am not a weeb. No way. Thank you for, thank you for the bits, Ratsky. Thank you. Anton1699, you some bits to say. Tarzan also has Danny's face, if I'm not mistaken. Does he? A little bit of Danny's face, yeah. It, I'm not an artist, of everyone knows that, but uh, I, I'm, I'm curious if it's difficult to, to, to create wholly unique faces with the same art style. Look, look how similar these two look. Like, what's, what's the only thing, just the eyes are the only thing that's really different there? Like, the nose is pretty much the same, the chin is the same, the ears are about the same. The hair color is almost the same. Like these are just the two characters side by side. Um, so I, 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 yeah. I don't know how how difficult that is. It explains things like this, right? It must be difficult. Okay, so let's go through it. Um, obviously, we're gonna survive to the end because we're because we're the 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 uh, the, the protagonist. Um, I think that our best friend this time is also going to survive to the end. I'm, I'm going to... I don't think it's going to subvert things again like that way. I think I think we're going to survive to the end. Uh, I'm going to assume there's six people alive at the end. So I'm going to do that thing. At, at the beginning... Someone said last time that at the beginning of Danganronpa 2, um, I should see what... I should make pre-predictions who's going to live, who's going to die. Um, so I think... I think... Gonna live... gonna live I really don't know I think gonna die but late definitely gonna die gonna die gonna die this is Sayaka again yeah, gonna die uh, I'm gonna say gonna live Gonna live because she's an asshole. That's three girls, so now we need three, three, three guys, right? That's three girls. Us. Two, three. Gonna live. Now we need three guys. Gonna live. Gonna die. Gonna die. Gonna die. Gonna die. Okay, so one of these, two of these three. I'm gonna say this guy and this guy's gonna live and this guy's gonna die. But he, he's hilarious, so so let's see. All right, so who's, who's gonna commit a murder? I think he's gonna be murdered. I don't think he's gonna murder somebody. I think we'll murder somebody. We'll probably murder somebody. 
We'll be murdered. We'll be murdered. I don't know, this is hard. The big guys have never killed anyone in the previous game, so I kind of feel like they're gonna maybe do that this time. That he's gonna kill somebody, and he'll be executed. Okay, those are all my predictions for now. But the most important ones are live. So live. 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 That's what I think. I'm obviously going to be wrong on some of them, but that's what I'm going to that's what I'm going to guess. before we get there. I don't read chat when I'm speculating. I see a bunch of like dots on, on it right now out of the corner of my eye. Okay, uh, it was the gym, right? Jim was, you know, here. Damn, I wish there was like a connecting corridor. Oh, I should have, um, I should have saved it. Shit. Do you agree? All 16 of us have gathered. Mm. Mm, it's pretty spectacular seeing all 16 of us ultimates gathered together. Kihihi, <laughs> you may not be able to be so easy going for much longer. Um, um, in this situation, it's no use thinking about things, so eventually, Sumugi stopped thinking. Another person that responds, so, speaks herself in the third person? God, okay, I hope I'm wrong. I hope you die. You don't get it, do you? Yeah, what's going to happen to us? I bet it'll be a big it'll be a big pain. Hmm. Hmm. What? What? What are you looking at? Himiko! Um, Himiko, you can use amazing powers, right? Because you're a psychic and stuff, right? It's magic. I'm not a psychic, I'm a mage. I'm a mage. It's <laughs> magic. Whoa, that's amazing. More like a maging. I definitely want to incorporate that into Neo Akito. Hey, what sort of training did you undergo to gain your awesome powers? Mm. Talking about it's too tiring. <sighs> You're pretty lazy. Please wait. Pardon me. Pardon me, but we need to be on our guard. We do not know if and when danger will strike. Please don't. Don't, don't. don't. Don't say that. I'm so scared. I don't know what to do. It'll be okay. There's no need to worry. Atua will protect us. Thank goodness. Phew, that's a relief. Fucking moron. Fucking moron, is your brain full of weebs or something? I'll whack him out, out of that skull of yours. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, just leave it to me. Leave it to me! If those... If those teddy bears show themselves again, I'll kick all their asses. I'm going to wonder... Huh? What? What's wrong? I'm going to... Hmm? What's wrong? See? Listen, hear that? Huh? Ah, I think I hear it. It sounds like an engine from a robot anime. Back. Yoo Rise and shine sign! Hmm. <laughs> this is the scene where they were just supposed to show up with the robots. Interesting. Everyone! What? What the heck are those mon are these monsters? Wow. Whoa, so cool! Hell yeah! They're exosiles, highly mobile bipedal weapon platforms. They've got lots of hometown pride too. What are you saying? I can't keep track of these backstories. <laughs> Whatever they are, they better kill off the uggos and save me for last. Hey! Run, Himoko. Himoko, why are you why are you concerned about me all of a sudden? By the way. Hmm. Didn't someone say they would kick all their asses? Huh? What the hell? Nobody told me about these. That is an interesting reaction there. It's okay. 
All right, chill out. No need to panic. We're probably not in any danger. If they wanted to kill us, they'd have done it by now. With that, Rantaro casually walked up to the Exocells. Man. So what do you want from us? You clearly want something. That's what these. That's what the guns are for, right? Let me guess. You're going to force us to do something, and if we don't, we get hurt. That means... Well, you have our attention. So what do you want? And that's that. Huh. Well, aren't you a wise guy? <laughs> I'll start us off. Listen up. Here's what we want you punk asses to do. Dance. <laughs> My heart's going 100 miles per hour. I'm going to say it. You ready? Hell yeah. It's a, it's it's a, a game. Oh, <gasps> he spoke. Monodam spoke. Holy shit. Killing game. Huh? What? <laughs> Monodam, how dare you upstage me? Huh? Wait a second. What did you say? Hmm. If I heard him correctly, killing game. It's a killing game. It's a killing game. <laughs> oh, he said it again. <laughs> God damn it, Monodam. I'm going to crush you with this here, XSL. <laughs> Come on, we don't have time to fight amongst ourselves. Okay. Yeah, if you don't stop fighting, I'm going to crush you with this here, XSL. Oh. You too, Monotaro? Leave it to me. If this is what it's come to, then I will crush the four of you with this here, XSL. What are you saying? Hey, why are you including me? Oh, well. Oh, well. It's more appropriate for us to be hostile to each other. Oh, are they going to fight? Okay. Do you want to go, Jabroni? Jabroni? Who are you calling Jabroni? Jabroni? It's, it's a good counter. What'd you say, Jabroni? I'll throw down any time, Jabroni! Check yourself before you wreck yourself! Seriously? Are they gonna get it on right in front of us? Don't worry. Atua is watching over us. Atua? In a situation like this, is he just going to watch? Either way, it's too dangerous. We need to get out of here, or else... Now, now, now! <gasps> oh, shit. Shit, he's here. What? What? My cute little cubs. You gotta knock off this awful fighting. It's Leon. Oh, that voice. Father. Father, is that you? Papa Kuma. Papa Kuma. Daddy. Daddy, where are you, Daddy? Huh? D Daddy. Mommy, at that moment, the lights in the gymnasium suddenly shut off. Okay, how is he back? How many times do you have to keep to teach you this lesson, old man? Oh, that's very much like the first game. Holy shit. I am the god of this new world! Oh, thank god it's the, this voice actor instead of the one from the anime. I don't know how they got that wrong. And the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy! The one, the only, Monokuma! Nice to meet ya! Yay! Yay, father's here. Hell yeah! Hell yeah, another epic entrance from Papa Kuma. How nice! Daddy is so cool. It's a killing game. My, little cubs. My cute little cubs, you're all so freaking cute. The only bubble. reason I can tolerate your tiresome antics is because you're all so cute. Damn, me and Monokuma were fucking like this about our kids, man. So Even when the prologue is going way too long, it is going a little too long, I'll allow it because you guys are cute. Yeah. In fact, the very first prologue ever was only short because you cutie patooties weren't there. Pops, are you mad at us? Don't be stupid! Don't be an idiot. I would never get mad at my little cubs. <laughs> yeah, he is mad. But Daddy is still cool even when he's angry. That's right! Pops is from a planet of handsome bears that get cooler as they get angry. This is true. It's getting interesting! Super Monokuma, Super Monokuma 2, Super Monokuma 3, and finally Super Monokuma 4. Abuse. Ah! Father just transformed into a Super Monokuma God Super Monokuma! That's only possible when six Monokumas of pure heart are gathered together. 
What? It's the power you bust out when you really want to fuck the world shit up! A power you only see when the gods themselves do battle. What? Anyway... Anyway, I'm really not mad. In fact, I gotta admit, I'm actually I'm actually proud of you guys. You kids really stand out from the rest of the second generation failures in the no world. Way. Isn't that a little harsh? I'm sure there are some second generation success stories. Yeah, but I can't think of any though. If you can't think of any, it's cause there's none worth remembering. Nice hat. But father remembers, cause he knows everything. Holy shit! That's right, Papa Kuma! You know all kinds of useless crap! Wait. Cause Daddy gets all his alternate facts from the most trusted names in fake news. Fake news? Phew. Hee <laughs> hee, I love embracing my children. They're so cute, I just can't help myself. Damn, did Monokuma build the wall? Usually ratings will plummet when mascots appear in sequels too much. <laughs> But in this case, ratings are through the roof, all thanks to the cute monocubs. What? Uh, what are you talking about? Are you fucking broadcasting this again? What is this? What's going on? Seems like... Another teddy bear appeared. No. Yes, but it, this, that is no ordinary teddy bear. Damn, fucking genius. I can see it, the despair and madness swirling around that cursed thing. You're really bugging Well, first of all, I'm no teddy bear. I'm Monokuma! And show some respect, I'm the headmaster of the ultimate academy for gifted juveniles. Huh? Headmaster? Mm -hmm. It appears to be some sort of auton- It appears to be some sort of autonomous robot with a built-in AI like me. Dong dong dong! Dong dong dong! Damn, three dongs. Yeah, but- the exocells are different though. They're brainless they're brainless buckets of bolts. Uh actually cater user under to say would like to give a shout out shout to the mods for clearing the shit on chat, thanks. Oh, uh, was there a lot of stuff going on when I was speculating? Good job, mods. Good job. Um, if it gets bad when when I'm uh when I'm Speculating, you can go into emote mode if you want, only mode if you want, but I don't like going into emote only mode when I'm discussing things with chat. The reason why emote mode was 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 you know uh, put down before is that it was being used because certain people wanted to talk to me directly in chat, and I didn't want that to happen. No sub mode though. Try to use it sparingly though, only if chat gets really 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 bad. Uh, Ralph calls you the numbers to say, uh, Gonta. Why should Bethesda hire spiders? Katie, what's a Bethesda? Gonta, because they're great at catching bugs on the floor. <laughs> what's a Bethesda this is my favorite part of that joke. Some dumbass has, has resubscribed for two months. Hey Joe, just wanted to pop in and resub real, really quick. Couldn't watch the stream until now, so I'm off to join the VOD boys. VOD boys, shout out to the VOD boys, VOD boy hype. Also, congrats on having sex yet again you are truly a legend among your wee brethren thank you i've had sex at least three times now i can just focus on watching anime as is my uh as is my purpose thank you very much some dumbass thank you thank you if you don't know what he's talking about uh lily and i announced that she's pregnant again for the third time i said earlier in the stream we talked about last stream as well just in case you don't know what he's talking about I didn't go and like announce I had sex or anything. That would, that would be fucking weird. Neko the cat has you some bits to say. I love how you played through the dang and romp games. You never cease to amaze me. It's hilarious. I hope you like the game as much as I did when I played through it. By the way, it's pronounced Neko. You probably said it right already. Um, I don't know if I did or not. P.S. Leon, the killer. <laughs> Leon is the killer for every kid. You were right all along, Hajime. Leon is every killer and every victim. Thank you, Neko the Cat. Thank you. Action Cater, use some bits. We need a Leon counter for every time you make a Leon joke for sometimes no reason. What are we talking about? There's always a reason to make a Leon joke. I think I made two so far, right? I'm trying to space my Leon, jo Leon jokes out. One an hour at the most. Shark the Bus is resubscribed for three months. A spooky three month resub. Happy Halloween, my dude. Thank you so much, Shark the Bus. I still love your name. Thank you very much. Hope you had a good Halloween. Happy Halloween. 
Thank you, thank you. Sushi has Leon's voice actor. Really? Oh, that's interesting. Huh. So really, Leon is in the game. And last but not least, Z Zaja, X-A-J-A, -A, has subscribed Prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Zaja. Thank you, thank you. Zaja? Aya? Maybe it's silent? I don't know. Uh, though thing around for three anime is bad, do you enjoy watching it to fill, the, fill in the plot holes and gaps of the story? I think it's creating more plot holes, but it's filling in some gaps, yeah. That's right. They're mindless, pretty killing machines that can only be controlled by us, the monocubs. It was interesting to see it all animated more than anything else. Yeah. Sheesh. Autonomous robots piloting weapon platforms. This is certainly turning into quite the story. Better bust out your tennis racket. I wonder if he's going to come out of retirement at one point. Damn, I'm going to have to come out of retirement. He just whips out his tennis racket. Mm, actually. Well, that may be, but what I'm worried about is this killing game you mentioned. What exactly does that mean? <laughs> How? What is so amusing? <laughs> it's just, when I said it before, I kind of just phoned it in, and now I feel awkward. <laughs> I want you students with your ultimate level talents to participate in a killing game. Huh? Killing game? Us? Please stop! Please stop joking. Please stop joking. Why would we agree to participate in a killing game? Huh? Huh? You guys don't want to do it? Gonta never do that! Of course not. Gonta never do that. Gentlemen not hurt people. And another thing. But if you've looked around the academy, then you already know, don't you? The academy is surrounded by a huge wall. You can't escape the outside world. And as long as we have the exocells, you can't defy us. In other words, I hold the power of life and death over each and every one of you. So sure. So do what you say if we so do what you say if we don't want to die. You gotta be kidding you me. You gotta be kidding me. Why would friends kill each other? Oh, we're not friends. No? Yeah, who said you guys were friends? No way! You guys aren't friends at all. You don't remember that. You're enemies out to kill each other. Huh? Enemies? We're, we're enemies? Mm. Frenemies? Hmm, I still have a lot to learn from father about sarcasm. <laughs> all this talking is bugging the shit out of me. I gotta beat up Monodan to relieve the stress. He broke his guitar, damn. Mm. But I don't like that. I'm not good with violence or gore or sad situations. Um, Daddy, instead of a killing game, could we do a rock, paper, scissors tournament? You stupid! Who'd want to play a game where no one dies? I don't know, mm. you can play rock, paper, scissors like that. Well, you do have a compassionate personality. It's so cute, I can barely stand it. They are so Why, it's cute enough to eat. Cute enough that I want to eat it. Eh? eh? Hey. Hey, monophony? I can't say it. Monophony? You might want to dial back the cute stick a bit. Hey. Cool it with a cool it with the stupid banter. I want to ask something. <laughs> How are we supposed to kill each other? Are you going to give us weapons? <laughs> what the hell, man? You? What are you asking? But we need to get info from them first. We can't do anything if we don't know anything. No way! Weapons? Huh? What kind of barbaric display are you envisioning? You couldn't be more wrong. Why, at the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles, you kill everyone with your bare hands. <laughs> The killing game is quite ref <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't keep it in. The killing game is quite the refined, sophisticated experience. What? Sophisticated experience? Yeah, yeah! Yes. Here, the killing game is punctuated by the Clash Trials. Uh. Clash Trials. Okie dokie! Has Sushi said anything throughout this whole thing? Okay, let us explain. Maybe he is all gonna right, die. So if one of you maggots kills someone, you all gotta take part in a class trial. The class trial is where the blackened killer faces off against their spotless classmates. It's where you punk ass bitches argue over who you fucking think the blackened is. After that, it's voting time! And if the majority of you idiots vote correctly, then only the blackened killer will receive p, -p punishment. So cruel. Just imagining all the blood and gore makes me want to puke. Okay, Mikan. After the blackened is punished, the rest of yous will just keep right on living together. But if you vote for the wrong person during the class trial, 
the Blacken gets off scot-free, and all the spotless students get punished instead. Hell yeah! Them's the rules of the class trial! Woo-hoo-hoo! Ow! <laughs> Whoa, Toko Tongue. Did he ever have a tongue before? Ah, too much. That explanation revealed way too much. You gotta be more coy, flirtatious, seductive, just like your old man. Gross. Gross. Hey, um... The point is, it's not enough to kill someone. You also have to survive the class trial. Where should I put this? Kill without being caught, and then survive the trial. Sounds eerily similar to the real world. Unbelievable. What? You think so? Then the outside world must be masterfully designed, even at its cruelest. Listen. One can likely imagine, but I shall ask, just in case. What is the punishment you mentioned earlier, Cake? Yeah, Cake. yeah! Simply put, it's an execution. Huh? Execution? If you do a crime, you get punished for it. That's like the most basic rule of society. Uh, thank you, Bob Yob, for the new sub prime. Welcome to Prime Time, Bob Yob. Thank you, thank you. Or Bobby Yob, not sure. Admiral Ion has used Underbiss to say, I can't believe that all three times you had sex, Zilly got pregnant. That's some incredible luck. Well, I mean, we have, we've. It's at least three. I don't want to brag. I mean, I'm like seven or eight. Okay? Like, I just don't want to, you know, rub it in people's faces. You know? That's not cool. Thank you, Admiral Ion. Uh, Oofman the Terrible has subscribed with Prime. Thank you very much. Oofman the Terrible. Thank you, thank you. Welcome to Prime Time. But this is a killing game. So the punishment for murder is a bit more permanent. Hell yeah! Ooh, I wonder what kind of punishments there'll be. Lots of blood and guts and brains, I bet. The kind of stuff that gives me a raging boner. Oh, you just fucking just said it. Okay. Yeah? What, Mona Kid? You already have a boner? Get a rock hard yeah. Rager. I'm so hard right now. How gory. Blood, guts, brain. <laughs> actually vomiting. Wow. Yeah, man. Whoa. Monophony just puked. Get a rock hard Rager. I'm so freaking hard. Yeah? Huh? Puke gives you a boner too? <laughs> <laughs> you kids are just adorable. What? What the hell's cute about that? Well now. Alright, I'm all I'm over all this boring exposition. Trills, trills, Let's get kills. this heart pounding killing killing school semester started already. You have free reign to murder however you like, too. Like bludgeoning or stabbing. Feeling cheap? Try strangulation! Feeling lazy? Try poisoning! Whether you shoot, burn, drown, blow up, crash, electrocute, or laugh your victim to death... Ooh, can we do that? You can use any method you like to kill anybody you like, any way you like! At the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles, you will realize your murderous potential! 16 talented teenage prodigies, all competing for first place in a killing game! He sounds different right now. There's no better setting for an event like this than the Ultimate Academy! You got me. Killing school semester. It's like a game! <laughs> Keep risking our lives for some silly game is absurd. But... It doesn't seem like it'll be boring, though. It doesn't seem like it'll be boring, though. <gasps> hey, how can you degenerates be so calm? It, it can't this, be! This has to be a lie, right? It's a lie, right? A lie. More like fiction. What is going on with the screen right now? Like a story on TV. A scenario so removed from reality, we can hardly believe it's happening. Damn, it's change no the channel. Use. I don't... I don't want to be in a killing game. It's wrong. I I'd never do that. <laughs> <laughs> well, if you don't want to participate in the killing game, that's going to be a problem. Because the killing game is the only reason you're here. Huh? What? Now then. now then, unleash your talents and have a happy, homicidal, horrific, hilarious killing game. Uh, 
Uh, jeez. Wait a minute. Oh? Hmm? Stop it. No matter what you say, we won't do it. That's wrong. We'll never participate in a killing I'll game. I'll do it. Whatever you have planned, I'm not gonna let you get away with it. Um... Katie, you shouldn't just rashly defy that thing. That's nice! No, no, I welcome her resistance. That kind of defiant spirit is important to the killing game. It's fun to watch the defiant ones eventually snap and get their hands dirty. Uh, what do you mean by that? I love it! Everyone loves that kind of brutality in a death game, especially me. It never gets old. It's so fun and entertaining that I just get an unbear- I, Sorry, I just get unbearably pumped up. You don't get it, do you? Cuz! Plus, as the headmaster, it's my job to force you to do it. <laughs> <laughs> it's punishment time! <laughs> we stood in dumbfounded silence, surrounded by the squealing laughter of the Mon of Monokuma and his cubs. Damn. We're pretty intense. Everything about the situation was so messed up. An academy surrounded by a giant wall. Sixteen ultimate students trapped inside. Mysterious stuffed bears and deadly weapons. And new friends forced to play some killing game. It all felt like something out of a sadistic work of fiction. A sadistic story, no different from reality itself. And against my will, I was now a character in that story. Ooh, intro? Oh shit, look at this! Katie. Robo. 2B. Evil guy. Yep, for sure. Bear. Useless guy that has no personality whatsoever. Totally not Sayaka. Um, Tarzan. Uh, feminist girl. That's crazy. Uh, cult leader. M mommy but not so. Crazy guy. It's a mage. Totally not Aoi. Tennis player. I think I missed a couple of them. They came fast at the end. Hmm, this was a bit more chill than the last intros. I liked it. It was good. That was chill. Ooh, why is the U pink now? Are they all gonna to go into pink as the game goes on? Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles badge. Killing Harmony. I wonder if that has a deeper meaning, because the last one did. Goodbye Despair. Killing Harmony. Hmm. After Monokuma and the Monokubs left, is, is does the killing cause harmony in some way? An alarm suddenly rang from my monopad. Not just from mine, the alarm was going off throughout the whole, the whole gym, which meant everyone else had received the monopad as well. When I took mine out, a message was displayed on the screen. Like, has is, is this become, like, some sort, some sort of, the killing, killing remains the harmony? I haven't finished the anime yet, but it, it confirmed that the world was, was destroyed and they were rebuilding. Is this some sort of tradition that, that, that holds, that, like, kind of 
satisfies the despair a little bit or something. Hmm. Students must live at the Ultimate Academy for the remainder of their foreseeable future once a murder takes place. Oh, this is cool. All surviving students must participate in a class trial. If the blackened is exposed during the class trial, they alone will be executed. If the blackened is not exposed, all remaining students will be executed. If the blackened survives the class trial, they will graduate and re-enter the outside world. The killing game and class trials will continue until only two surviving students remain. What? Really? Oh, wow. Nighttime is from 10 p.m. to 8 a.m. The dining hall and gymnasium are off limits at night. Violence toward Monokuma, the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy, is strictly prohibited. What about the Monocubs? Monokuma will never directly commit a murder. <laughs> yeah, sure, okay. Your monopads are very important items. Please do not damage them. The body discovery announcement will play when three or more students discover a body. With minimal restrictions, you are free to explore the campus at your discretion. Students who violate these rules will be immediately exterminated by the XSLs. The headmaster may add new regulations to this list at any time. You gotta be kidding me i will never i will never participate in a killing game i think you will i think you will our class trial i think i missed something <laughs> on the title screen there Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles, School regul Regulations. So these are the rules. How? I do not understand why someone would force us to do this. But... But the rules are pretty cut and dry. This game doesn't seem like it'll be boring. You gotta be kidding me! That's not the problem. Listen. Please lower your voice. It is ruining the atmosphere. Oh yeah! Hey, hey, what does the sixth regulation mean? The killing game and class trials will continue until only two surviving students remain. Yeah, that's interesting to me. That that that's a new one, right? I wonder if we're gonna get down to two. That would be kind of bananas. Holy shit. Only two surviving students? What would be the reason for that? That's Perhaps it's because you couldn't do a trial with just two people. I see, I see. Uh -huh, I see, I see. You're so smart, Sushi. Always messing around. Quit screwing around. Killing game school regulations. So they, ha they haven't added the rule yet that you can't, you can only kill um, two people at once. Okay. Don't screw around! The hell with all that crap. Who'd go along with someone like that? Kato raised the mod pad as if to smash the device on the ground. Oh. Whoa, hey now, don't do that. School rules say you can't break it. Hmm. If you violate the rules, then the exercise will dispose of you. Wait, do they? It says try not to break it. Please do not damage them. It says please. I guess so. It's worded a little differently than I wonder if that's going to come up. If you violate the rules and the exiles will dispose of you. Do you think it implies that you can accidentally damage them, but you can't purposefully damage them? What? I don't care about the rules. No way I'm going to play this messed up game. No. This isn't about playing the game. It's too dangerous to disobey him, to, to disobey him now. Yeah. Forget about him. It just means one less dumbass for the world to deal with. Shut up! Hey, who are you calling a dumbass? Dumbass? I took a deep breath and shouted all my might. You're the dumbass! Oh, hey, quit fighting already. Whoa! Whoa, what the? Jeez. We shouldn't be fighting amongst ourselves. Right now, we need to work together. Hmm. hmm. Honestly, I'd probably be more. Ins I'd, pro I'd probably be more inspiring if I played a song and gave a speech. Mm -hmm. Choppin's military polonaise would definitely help us help unite us. Right. Yeah, I could get behind some bolognese, and I don't even like meat or tomatoes. Right. I agree with Katie, too. We must remember who the real enemy is. The men. 
Master told me that strength must always be aimed in the proper direction. Anyway, you're all panicking too much. Just stay calm like me. Oh, damn, she's gonna snap. Wow, you're shaking so much. Really? Even I can't handle these intense vibrations, and trust me, I've got loads of experience. I like you, Mio. Hey. I like you, Mio. Anyway, don't. Why don't we work together and search for an exit one more time? But. But we looked all over that wall, and there wasn't a single hole. Please wait. Now, now wait just a second. If there's no opening in the wall, then how did we get inside these walls in the first place? Uh -huh. They built the wall around us. Oh, good point. Got it. That means there must be an opening somewhere. We have to find it. Hmm. Whoever trapped us here wants to fight each other. All right. So let's show them what we're. Let's show them that we're not gonna let that happen. We're not gonna fight each other. We're gonna work together, okay? Wait, hold on. I wanna check something one more time. It's the same thing as last time. Okay, sorry. Um, um. Why are you quiet? Did I say something wrong? I do not agree. On the contrary, you made your case with such succinct aplomb that we've been rendered speechless. Jeez. Yeah, I was gonna say the same thing, but you beat me to it. Got it. You're exactly right. We can't give up so easily. Come on, come on. Let's split up and try to find the exit. Ooh. Ooh. Atua gave us strength. Wow, well, impressive. I must admit, I admire your spirit. Hey. Oh well, wait. Mm -hmm. Yeah? What is it? We were just about to get started. Um... Um, maybe it, it not matter much, but... Gonta find manhole earlier in grass behind school building. Huh? A manhole? Mm. Gonta peek in, see big underground passage, think maybe it exit. But... Sorry, it's probably not so simple. Ah! You gotta mention important stuff like that much faster. Mm. Gonta peek in. Gonta peek in, see big underground passage, think maybe... Maybe it exit. Uh, no. Wait, not like that. <laughs> You're talking too fast. Either way. The boiler is behind the school building. We must cor corroborate Gonta's claim at once. Gonta, please lead the way. Got it. Okay, everyone follow Gonta. Like ants to food source. With Gonta leading us, we hurried out of the game. Just when I was about to follow after them. Wow, impressive. Katie, that was a pretty. That was pretty cool back there. Huh? Huh? What was? How should I put this? The way you changed the mood completely. Seems like everyone looks up to you. Mm. Looks up to me? Come on, that's ridiculous. I, I just spoke from the heart is all. So unsure. So it just comes naturally to you then. That's even more cool. <laughs> you have what it takes to win. Huh? What? That means... I was just thinking, what you said back there would have pissed off whoever's running this. They definitely don't want us holding hands working together. I'm sure. They're gonna come for you, Katie, with everything they've got. I'm a little worried about you. You're just so straightforward. Are you Nagito, the Nagito of this game? Uh. And away he goes. That guy could really stand to be less cryptic. That's true. Uh, oh, who the fuck are you again? Uh, perhaps it's a warning. That's what I think anyway. Being strong-willed could get you into a lot of trouble around here. Sorry. Uh, sorry, I didn't mean to sound so negative at a time like this. No. It's fine, you only said that because you're worried, aren't you? But. Yeah, Rentaro is a mystery. He forgot his ultimate talent as well. Is that something you can really forget? Mm -hmm. Well, there's no use thinking about it right now. We should just head to that manhole. Okay. Ah, uh, you're right. Can we fast travel? fast travel in the game yeah you can okay so we want to go here hey exosol
Oh, I can go to different places now? Look at this thing. It's like a castle gate with past here. behind the school building I need to catch up with everybody so I can't fully explore yet all right Looks like we're all here. So where's this manhole? Um, um over there in grass. Alright. Let's talk to everybody. <laughs> Whoa, look at all these weeds. This place could definitely use a groundskeeper. Right, Keyboy? Please stop! Why are you telling me that? Furthermore, I would prefer if you address me as Kibo. But but you can pull weeds, right, Keyboy? Well, of course! I can do all sorts of things just as well as any person. Huh? As well as any person, but you're not a person. That's robophobic! Th that's discrimination. Robophobic discrimination. Alright. That was some cool interaction right there. Are there bears to find in this one? How should I put this? We should investigate the manhole right away. If it is an exit, it's only a matter of time until Monokuma comes for us. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's just talk to him first. In any event, the ground opens up before us as though inviting us downward. Once we are swallowed by darkness, will we be able to return to the light? Hee hee hee. What's wrong? Now's not the time to be shouting and celebrating. Even this really is the exit. It's all over if Monokuma catches That's us. Right. I agree, we need to be quick about this. Okay, this seems like a waste of time. Quit wasting my time, you kooky bitch. Hurry up already. Chop, chop. Yeah, there we go. All right. Let's just... Let's talk the best girl, and then we'll go down. But What purpose does this facility serve? One would assume that all this greenery would interfere with the machinery. Does this mean preparations were not completed before we arrived? It's true. There really is a manhole in the grass. <laughs> An important hole near some bush? Sounds familiar. Am I right, ladies? <laughs> Alright. Game is poison. Aw, oh, this manhole cover looks heavy. Can we even lift it? Leave it to me. I can try. Kiba placed his hands on the manhole cover and with all his strength he mm -hmm. grr, grr. My apologies. How embarrassing. It won't even budge. Huh? Ganto can move it though, huh? A robot's not even strong enough to move it. Listen closely. Oh, don't worry. Oh, don't worry. My physical strength is approximate to that of a strong senior citizen. Piece of shit! Th that's fucking pathetic. <laughs> the, the, the professor did not want to repeat of the tragedy that occurred during trial production. The greatest, most awful, most tragic. Uh... Um, now just I'm just plain curious about what happened during that trial. Allow Gonta. Oh, allow Gonta. Gonta lift cover bef before to peek inside. Should be able to pick up cover too. Gonta placed his hands on the manhole cover and... Upsie daisy. Damn, this guy's strong. So easily? His strength must be due to my magic. Yep, there's no mistaking it. Himoko's old lady voice is creepy. Oh, you're amazing, Himiko. What should Gonta do with cover now? Please leave it somewhere else. Be careful not to hit anyone with it. And then he threw it across the room without looking. Everyone gasps as he's looking down from the manhole. And then all, and then you hear, bing, 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 bong. <laughs> um, actually, 
going to no can do that. Very rude to litter. But with nowhere to dispose of the manhole cover, Gonta begrudgingly tossed it aside. Metal cover easily traveled five yards before it hit the ground. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> what wonderful strength. You could likely crush a child's skull with ease. Gonta never do that? How ungentlemanly. Gonta never do that. Um... Gentlemen or not, no one would do that. But... But Gonta is so much more reliable than some bean-counting robot. Hmm... Are you talking about me? Because I can count many things, not just beans. While everyone else was talking, I slowly peeked into the manhole. It was too dark inside to see clearly, but I could feel cold, moist air drifting up from it. Actually... But this place is kind of creepy. We're really going in there? Got it! I'm sure it's fine. At the very least, we definitely won't die down there. I'll protect you! If anything happens, I'll protect most of you. But the degenerate the degenerate males are on their own. Going to protect you. Then going to protect men folk. That's true. Awfully quiet. Where are Monokuma and the Monocubs? I see, yes. I was certain they would show up at some point and crush us like rotten gnats. <laughs> <laughs> they probably haven't noticed yet. I see. Then let then let's hurry before they show up to mess with us. Let us beat that rubbish mentality into submission. One by one, we descended down into the manhole. Can Gonta even fit? Once we all had climbed down the ladder, we looked around and saw an open area. Okay, I, where is this going? We have a whole school to explore with places that we haven't gone to yet, and, and it's like secret underground sewer <laughs> lair what it's more spacious than i thought it'd be yoda lay hee ho what is it what is this place that is correct sure reminds me of kyoko an old industrial passageway i suspect perhaps factories once existed here ah. and this is all that's left of them hey hey took a look at this <laughs> What a considerate this what a considerate sign. Apparently the end of the tunnel is the exit. Um considerate? You don't think it's weird that someone went out of their way to write exit? Ha ha ha! Don't piss yourself in fear, your natural scent is bad enough. I'm not scared, and I smell just fine. Hey. Well then, go on ahead. No point standing around here. That's uh yeah. Yeah. No need to worry. It looks a bit dangerous, but we're all ultimates here. Well, one of us isn't. Yeah, that's right. As long as we work together, everything will work out just fine. Uh, okay. Yeah, you're right. Well said. That's exactly what I was gonna say. We're really on the same wavelength, Katie. Give me a hug. Damn, everyone loves Katie. No. Is this what it's like to be a waifu? Is this like a waifu simulator? Um, no. Ugh, degenerate Typical males. degenerate behavior. You were trying to trick her into pressing her boobs against you. Everyone loves Katie. I don't want to talk to everybody. I guess I don't have to, right? Let's let's see. That is troubling. The underground passage that has not been in use for some time must be quite dangerous. If everyone wishes to proceed, then I will do my best to support that decision. Is it just is it just like normal stuff? Let's see. Let's talk to a few people and see. Hey. Gonta. So it was an exit. Gonta glad he tell everyone. Come everyone, Gonta protect you. Alright, let's just go. It'll probably be okay. There'll be an exit at the end of this, and once we reach it, this'll all be over. I just know it. I clung fiercely to that belief as we stepped into the tunnel. You're about to take on the death road of despair. What? Is this a joke? Objective is simple. Everyone works together to escape. Move, cheer, jump is escape.
Why is jump escape? Move with mouse? Okay, let's just see how good. This is going to be a complete train wreck. You'll encounter plenty of traps set up, set up to prevent you from escaping. If you hit a trap or fall off a ledge, that person will be eliminated and control will switch to one of the remaining students. Aw, oh, damn, it's like a horror game that I want. If everyone is limited, game over, man. Oh, sorry, didn't mean for things to get real like that. Alright, let's save scum. Save scum. Save scum time. Uh-oh. What's going on, Finn? Oh, sorry, didn't mean for things to get that real. For now, stay vigilant and do your best to reach the exit. Not that it matters. Okay, I'm moving the mouse and nothing's happening. Okay, so now I'm moving with WASD and W is jump. Okay, what's what's the thing on the floor here? Do we jump over it? Everyone, be careful. Who's here? <laughs> Leave it to me. <laughs> this is it for me. <laughs> Do we just walk over <laughs> it? I'm sorry. I couldn't do it. Oh no. Looks <laughs> like it's no good. I couldn't do it. I shall go. Oh no! Okay, can we can we can we make it? So oh, do do his best. Sorry. Fine. I'll fucking do it. What's this jump? Oh man, that's awful. Still. Shit. Let's have fun to go. with this. Atua is on my side. Okay. <laughs> what do I do? No. No. Game over. What do I do? All right. It was a good game. It was a good game. Uh. uh what? As I slowly opened my eyes, it dawned on me that I had somehow lost consciousness. Uh. Oh. Are you feeling all right? You're awake. Are you all right? Uh. I'm fine. But what about everyone else? I looked around and saw the others sitting on the ground. Everyone sat in stunned silence. A sobering sadness filled the air. Jeez, hmm? this is quite the pity party you sad sacks are throwing for yourselves. Huh? Mon Monokuma. Rise and shine, or sign. <laughs> You can actually complete this and get an ending. All right, all right, here we go. Buckle up. Buckle up. Get ready, boys and girls. Past that, still got more ways to go. Let's go. How do you get past that? What? How? How are we this character? Do it. Go to do his best. Like it's no good. They all just died. They all just died. Okay, do we go? Do we go down into the left? Okay, here we go. We did it. We did it. Sorry. We did it. Everyone. All right. 
We did it. Alright, next try. Gone to do his best. One more time. happen here oh shit what the fuck was the momentum there As this level as oh okay. Are you feeling? You're awake. Are you alright? I'm fine, but what about everyone else? I looked around and saw the others sitting on the ground. Uh, the Wazoo was subscribed for two months. Thank you very much, the Wazoo. Hey, Dad upon San, thanks for all the quality content. The new video on horror games was brilliant. Love you. Thank you so much. Uh, some people uh, didn't like it, but it seemed the response was was decent. Um. Uh, yeah, I I feel like some people don't understand the point, but maybe that's the problem with the video, but I also get the impression that maybe some people are like, I, I was scared, so how could you possibly not be scared? That kind of reaction? Which is kind of weird. I don't know. I like this mini game. This is fun. Everyone sat in stunned silence. A sobering sadness filled the air. Jeez, this is quite the pity party you sad sacks are throwing for yourselves. Huh? Our games keeps removing the link, fuckers. What? What do you mean? What do you mean our games keeps removing the link? Monokuma. Rise and Shiner sign. Rise and Shiner sign. Huh. Wow, you all look exhausted, poor things. I feel sorry for you. Sheesh, this place is filthy. It's murder on my cashmere skin. I bet Mon Monadam is feeling lucky right now. His body's already a cheap piece of junk. Hey! Why don't you respond to him, Monadam? It'll liven things up a little, you know? <laughs> so you guys crawled out of your holes. I guess you finally noticed what we were up to. Huh? Noticed? I've known for a while that you guys would botch whatever escape plan you had. Huh? What? Um... Yeah, I also kind of pretty much knew too. What are you saying? That's a lie. Then? If you knew all along, then this was just a trap. You're the worst of the worst! Then there was no exit. You tricked Don't us. Don't worry! No, there's an exit. So? I think you guys will manage to reach it if you all work together. Nice. Yeah, there's nothing you 16 ultimates can't accomplish if you work together. <laughs> Hoo -hoo -hoo. And if at first you don't succeed, Shing. try, try again. Ah! Try as many times as you want until you accept reality. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so, so long, it, bear so long bear well. Six times now. I think it's interesting if you actually can get out, and it's just so difficult that you give up. Uh, so we can escape if we work hard enough. Fucking moron! No, fucking moron! No way, you little moron! They'd be freaking out if we could actually reach Jeez. it. That's probably why they let us try. They wanted us to try the underground passage, so we'd learn that escape is impossible. You got me. Instead of blocking off every exit completely, they leave that little bit of hope. They leave that little bit of hope. Hajime. They want us to be desperate to go home. 
corner us mentally. Actually, that's just rotten. You might be right. Yeah, but, but we can't just give up. Yeah. Right, you guys? I mean, we've only failed once, you know? We can't give up this early, right? Okay. But, but isn't getting out of here impossible? That's not true. No, it's not. It may take one more try or a lot more tries, but it's not impossible. Forget about Monokuma. It doesn't matter what he says to I'll us. Get us out of here. I don't want to lose to him, and I don't want any of you to lose either. I refuse to lose to someone who would do these terrible things to us. You're right. Katie. Mm-hmm. So let's all work hard to escape this place together. And once we get out of here and make it to the outside world... Right? Why don't we all stay friends? Um... For friends? Yeah. Yeah, after going through an experience like this, I think we'd all be the best of friends. Right? I mean, it's not every day you get to meet other ultimates. So what do you say? I, I mean, like... Katie, like, what? This is really weird. If you were any other character, I'd be like, you're gonna get fucking murdered, but <laughs> Humph, it, that, that might not be bad. Yeah. Yeah, that's a great idea. Yeah. Then we'd, then we've all the more reason to escape this place no matter what. <laughs> my body is ready, you can tell by, <laughs> my body is ready. You can tell how, by how out of control my pit sweat is. Damn, the pit sweat. Everyone. But isn't it premature to say what we'll do after we... Sorry, isn't it premature to say what we'll do after we escape? Assumptions are all but useless. Wait. Whoa. Jeez, you're clueless. Why am I not surprised that a robot can't read the air? That's robophobic. Robots can read the air thanks to innovations in pollutant detecting technology. I... Left click's not working. Let's go! Anyway, it doesn't matter if Monokuma says it's impossible. We'll show him what we can do. That's right. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Time to blast off again. It seems like a pain, but I guess I'll try. Yeah. Yeah, let's work together. We messed up last time, but I'm sure it'll go well this time. It'll be okay. I'm sure we'll be fine. A divine wind will blow through and lift us to victory. Wonderful. Ah, humanity is tr Ah, humanity is truly wonderful. The way you all confront adversity is beautiful. With our bond stronger than more stronger than ever, we stepped into the tunnel once more. Really? Start escape. Oh, okay. All right. Is this a trap here down here? No, it wasn't. Okay. Doo, doo, doo. Ha! Ha! Be Everyone, be careful. Who's here? Oh well, wife who's dead. Ha! Damn, Damn it, it, me. this is it for me. Ha! This is the one. Sorry. This is the one. No! This is the one. I miscalculated. Like it's no good. So this is the end. Oh shit! A door's on my side. Move away, man. That's so Hi. bullshit. Oh, for yeah. fuck's sake! Bye what bye. the fuck? Oh, <laughs> and a coin comes down? That's so awkward. I am a I'll do it. Okay, so when when you get close to the air, it, it continues on its 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 movement. Okay, here we go. Here we go. We're gonna do it. I'm sorry! I couldn't do it! Uh, when I finally woke up, searing pain coursed throughout my entire body. How do I get past the coin? Uh. I, I see, I lost consciousness again. Why? What the? I was looking forward to a happy ending. Don't worry. Not yet. We're just getting started. Mm -hmm. Of course, there will be a. Pe this will be a piece of cake. Yeah. Gonta gonna escape, become friends with everyone. Gentlemen, never give up. Uh. This time, this time we'll reach the exit. This time. Those words carried me as I stepped into the tunnel once again, but... 
It was no good. Even so, we refused to surrender. We kept telling ourselves that this time we'll escape, but we failed each time. With every attempt, we repeated the words this time over and over again. But in the end, we couldn't do it. I thought we'd be able to escape as long as we never gave up, but it made no difference in the end. <laughs> failed again. Damn. Damn it. Seems like... I can't go on. That's wrong. No, that's wrong. We... No, wait, we can't give up. This time uh, we'll... No. Knock it off already. Huh? Huh? I don't like that. You're free to keep trying on your own, but forcing us to join you is basically torture. Uh, it's torture. That's so mean. You know what really hurts? Being denied the right to give up in an, in an impossible situation. You won't let us give up, and no matter what we say, you have the moral high ground. Yeah, especially considering you're the first one to get knocked out, so everyone else has to be in there longer than you. That doesn't sound... That, that doesn't sound like torture to you. Shit. When you say we can't give up, you're not inspiring us. You're strong arming us. That's wrong. No, I didn't mean it like that. Hey, degenerate male. Hey, degenerate male. Quit being so selfish. Please don't. I I'm not being selfish. The others feel the same way too. Huh? What? Uh, everyone? My spirit is nearly broken. This hardship gnaws at me. Given the circumstance, the most logical course of action would be to give up. Yeah, I feel like Hisashi Mitsui in the second half of a basketball game. And I was just about to say that myself. I knew this wasn't possible from the start. This bullshit is a waste of my precious time and energy. I can't let you all rely on my magic. Besides, I don't have enough MP left. Hope she dies soon. I'm just relieved that no one was seriously injured. Praise be to Atua. Wait! Please wait. We no can give up. Hey guys! You guys, are you ready? Are you really okay with not getting out of this place? Well, you know. We shouldn't have to push ourselves. Let's just find another way out, okay? Damn, huh? it's like hope versus despair down here. What? No way. You're talking about the killing game, aren't you? Ah. Oh, so you're gonna interpret it like that, huh? You gotta be kidding me! What are you saying? There's no way we can do the killing game. <laughs> nee -hee -hee. Calm down. Want some bubble gum? You can blow pretty big bubbles with it. Uh -huh. Oh, it looks like this little degenerate wants his head smashed into the ground. Wait! So stop, guys. We shouldn't be fighting. Jeez. Gee, jeez. We fell apart pretty quick for a group that decided to be friends and work together. Sorry. I'm sorry. This is my fault. I'm so sorry. Uh, um... No, Katie. Dumbass! Oh, who are you again? Idiot. What are you apologizing for? It's not your fault at all. Mm. Really? I think it is Katie's fault. What? Huh? Why? Ding dong, bing bong. Night time. This is an announcement! This is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy for Gifted Juveniles. It is now it's around 10 p.m. Nighttime officially starts it's now. Whether time. you've been good or naughty, it's time to go tinkle and go to Betty Bye. Be the dining hall and gym are locked during nighttime, so be careful. Dan, now you guys don't get to have dinner. Bedtimer sign. <laughs> Bedtimer sign. <laughs> Sweet dreams. Oh. Nighttime, huh? Well, no sense pushing our luck. We should probably just get a fresh start tomorrow. Huh? Fresh start. What do you think? We've been assigned or each been assigned a room in the dormitory. Perhaps we should rest there. Ah! He, we're gonna rest there. What's wrong? The rooms aren't that bad. Much better than my prison cell, that's for sure. But, <laughs> but it makes me nervous to think we'll be staying the night in this at this creepy school. Okay. Well, nothing we can do but suck it up. So, what's our plan for tomorrow? Since the dining hall opens at 8 a.m., how about we all meet there at that time? That's right. Sure, I think that'll work. I'm okay with it's that. Decided. Can we go to our rooms already? Either way. Yes, we should get as much rest as we can and regain our strength. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know if I can go pee by myself in the middle of the night. I'll come with you if you don't if you don't mind. That is, just let me know. Oh. Was she drooling there? Hey guys, just as a warning. How should I put this? We shouldn't let our guards down. We'll be easy targets at night. You mean? Because of killing game, you mean? Because because of killing game, you mean? Please wait. I see no need to worry about something as illogical as murder taking place here. Mm -hmm. I know, I know. Just a warning.
Uh, um... um, Katie, I don't think you need to worry about what Kochiki said. You weren't pressuring us, at least I don't think so. Uh... Yeah, thanks, Sushi. <sighs> but I'm exhausted. Let's just go back to our rooms and You're rest. Right. right, well, see you tomorrow. I hope there's a murder. Kato. I mean... Hey, why did you apologize before? You didn't do anything wrong, uh... you know? Well, when we tried to escape, I felt like we were united behind a common goal. But after I put everyone's lives at risk, that unity is gone now. Seriously? Come Shut on. up. That's just a stupid end result. It's not like you wanted it to go that way. Listen up. Don't apologize for something that's not your fault. It'll just make you feel bad. You know... Everyone just decided to blame you and give up. I'm going to give him a piece of my mind later. Damn. <sighs> Blast them off, man. Well, anyway, let's just go to sleep for now. See you tomorrow. See ya, Neil. Thank you, Kato. Can I go back down? Like the music. What's the matter? Uh, Pinch Bottom has resubscribed for um, two months. One of my favorite people playing one of my favorite games. Today is a good day. Thank you, Pinch Bottom. Hope you're enjoying it. It's pretty good so far. I'm enjoying it. And Chubbiest Thread just gifted subs to five people, I think. Thank you, Chubby Stride. Uh, gifted subs to Persona I Sheep or Person AI Sheep. Not sure. I'll use my Persona. Welcome, welcome. Welcome to R. Sorry, welcome for RPRKJJ as well. Capo 800, Enigma Farce, and O250. Thank you very much, Chubby Stride. Thank you very much. Welcome to you five again. Please enjoy our emotes. Personal sheet? No, it's an eye. It's an eye. It's an eye. It's not an L, it's an eye. Maybe they're trying to make it an L with using uppercase, but on my list it's lowercase. It's a, it's an eye. Uh, thank you, Roxy King UK, for the sub as well. Welcome to Prime Time, Roxy King UK. Thank you, thank you. And I don't know when we should stop it. We should go for another hour. Hmm. Anybody want a five minute break and then we'll go for another hour or do you want me to stop in half an hour? I don't know why I'm asking because I, I, we're just going to do whatever I want anyway. But I kind of need to pee. Okay, let's go. Let's take a five-minute break, and I'll come back, and then we'll go for another hour, and we'll stop at 7.30 my time. So it's 6.30 right now. Okay, I'm going to run some scumbag ads like usual when I take a break, so I'll be right back. I'll check fan art when I get back as well.
All right, so link me up with some fan art and I'll put it on the screen. Okay, so I have one by Merrick, one by Cactus Dude, and another one with no name. <laughs> All right. Let me make my first Dengen Rampa 3 folder. It's by Millie Becca. Chill music, man. Using my last bit, ask the most important question of all: Who is Lady's waifu? In in this game, it's I just I just told her about uh about two B being in the game, so she she's going with two B. She likes two B a lot. Okay, first of all, this one was shown earlier uh, in the bit messages, and I kept it until we put art on the screen. In honor of starting of the uh, the next one. 11037, The Professional, Big Mac, Joseph Anderson, chat, burning the meme to the fucking ground. I don't know what 11037 means. It's actually a pretty good movie. The Professional, it's pretty good. Oh, Leon. This is Merrick's picture, which I think is inspired by my, uh, our, sorry to go all Professor Oak on you, but are you a boy or a girl? Are you a game or an interactive experience? <laughs> oh, man. Does it matter? Does it matter? It, it matters. So I don't know how clear this is going to show up on the stream, but it's uh, it's it's throwing all the hands out looking for coins and shit in 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 the uh, in in the classrooms. I think. Boom 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 boom. Coin 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 coin. coin. Every background will be destroyed. Every 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 background. All of them. And last but not least... Oh shit, it's, it's got a clear background? That's, that, that, that wasn't ex what I expected at all. Alright, so, it's Pickle Nagito. Nagito. Even on the screen, just, just up here, just pickle negative, just, just chilling. <laughs> we're not, we're not, pick, we're not picking it. We're not leaving it on the screen. We're not leaving it on the screen. Okay. Okay. That's all the ones I saw, so let's continue. Oh, I missed one from Lucid. You, you've, you've edited previous fan art to your own twisted ends. Is that kosher? I don't know if that's kosher. You've edited previous fan art. All right, here we go. Getting ready to dive. And we dive, not into tea. 
but into best girl candidate's cleavage. <laughs> uh, okay, so we're gonna go for another hour or so. Um, 7.30-ish is when we're gonna stop. It's 6.40 here for me. If we're in, if we're in an important part, we'll continue on a little bit. Um, I don't think we're gonna get to the first murder today, but I might be wrong. Um... Titi. That's pretty good. Gone to worry about manhole. Think it okay with cover gone? Titi is really good. What if someone fall in, get hurt real bad? Cause gone to gentleman. Gone to gentleman. Gentlemen, no, can't ignore that. But Kur... 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 Kirumi? Kirumi? Tell Gonta to leave cover off. Mm. Gonta not know what to do. Um. Everyone knows it's here, so I'm sure we'll all be careful. Don't worry about it. You right. Okay, you right. Maybe Gonta to just keep eye on it. Thank you, Katie. Gonta to go back to room now. Now nah, someone's gonna fall down and break their neck, and then you'll be considered the black end because you opened it up. Oh, it's, it's a trap. Good night. Yeah. Yep, good night. Gonta may look scary, but he's actually a very kind, innocent soul. Damn, it's gonna be really sad when he's murdered. Thank you, Poiso Kane, for the three month resub. Thanks so much. Hope you're enjoying the, uh, the, the stream. Thank you very much. Um, I, I have a feeling we're gonna probably be playing this for two weeks. So, uh, it might take us right to a Fallout 76. And just, just, just sl slipping it out there again. Fallout 76 comes out on my birthday, so we might do. We might. Hopefully, we finish this game on the 13th. Do a Fallout 76 birthday stream, and then I'm gonna have to talk to Lily about whether we're gonna continue how how she's feeling with the pregnancy. Uh, we might do David Cage games before we 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 become a regular with streams, or we might just stop it after that. So, but we'll do. We'll, I'll, I'm considering a f one Fallout 76 stream just on multiplayer to see how it is with chat. Are you feeling all right? Is something the matter? Please rest and try to regain as much strength as you can. Escaping this place will prove to be quite difficult. Best not to fright over it. Damn, 2B is... 2B is my friend. Can we go and spend our mana coins? God damn it. Seems like... So I see it like this, the school really is eerie. It's an interesting place in the day, but having to stay the night is too much. With my magic. If you really can't fall asleep, I'll put you to sleep with a magic a magic hammer. Rest in peace. That would be an eternal sleep. Damn, that was a lot of dialogue. All right, is there anybody else around here? What? Obtain hidden Monokuma. Oh wow. What? Oh shit, those are gonna be. Keep my eyes out for those. Monument. Why is this here? Plants. I wonder where that door leads to. I don't think it's an exit, but it bothers me. Pro tip, you're on faster diagonally. Oh, GoldenEye 64 strafing. Okay, we're in here already. Let's go to the... Um, Go to the dorm. Um, are there are there items in this one that were like in in Dragon Rampa two that that lead to special events that you can get? Because if there are, I would like a list of those so I can get them so we don't miss any of the special events. Okay, I'll try and get those then. Ooh. 
Ooh, this is nice. So this is my room. Well, it's not too shabby. Huh? A key. Is it the key to this room? Bingo! Bingo, you got it right. Nice work. This is, in fact, the key to this room. You probably don't have anything worth stealing in here, but you should still lock your door when you leave. Yeah! All right, now it's time for me to give you a special hint. If you steal someone else's key, you can sneak into their room and kill them easy. That's wrong! No, that's wrong. Shut up. I don't want to hear that. Yeah! Wow, I just got chewed out. Jeez, this place is the worst. I just want to go home. Wasn't it on some sort of, like, candlestick or something? That's kind of weird. Ooh. Why is it glowing gold? Is that because it'll progress the story? Or is what... Oh, it's what we moused over. Okay, my bad. This pretty large lamp it makes the room nice and bright. It's a monitor for communicating with us, but there's nothing displayed right now. Huh? Is this a closet? We also take a look inside just to huh? be safe. Huh? What is this? Inside there were uniforms that matched the one I was wearing. Lots of uniforms. Did they prepare all these? They prepared everything just to keep us trapped here, but why? I hate my room. I hate my room. It sucks. <sighs> Sigh, I'm tired. As soon as my body hit the bed, my body immediately froze. After everything that happened, I forgot just how physically and mentally exhausted I was. Did you lock the door? I thought we would achieve our goal as long as we didn't give up. That had always been my mentality whenever I practiced the piano. But maybe playing the piano is easier because I'm blessed with that talent. Hmm. How could you forget? Something's weird here. With Chopin's prelude playing in my head, I fell into a deep sleep. Monica Theater. New students of the Ultimate Academy, congratulations! Whoa, what the fuck? The weeds here have grown thick with joy as if celebrating your entrance into this school. Seeing your anxious eyes shine with murderous intent makes me oh so happy. If you ever feel lost, don't be shy. Talk to your friends or a teacher. Let's all get along. And let's do lots of killing too. I pray for the physical and mental well-being of this new killing school semester. I mean, I pray for the well-being of you students. Yes, that will do. Ding dong, bing bong. Sign. This is an announcement. Num num, this is an official announcement from the Ultimate Academy. It's 8 a.m. bitches. Time to wake up and face the blood drenched day. So I wonder who's dead this morning. Stop it! Stop! If I suddenly see a dead body, I'll puke again. Have fun. Enjoy your killing school semester. It was all some terrible dream, huh? Wouldn't that be nice? Wait, I don't have time to joke around. I said I'd meet the others in the dining hall. Everyone must be waiting. I need to get to the dining hall ASAP. Oh shit. Oh no, run. Lock the door. Morning, Sumugi. Um, good morning, huh? Katie. 
What's the matter, not feeling well? I woke up a bunch of times last night and each time I realized this wasn't a dream. But even so, I still woke up this morning hoping it was a dream. And in the end, it still yeah. wasn't. Yeah, same here. But we gotta face this reality. Aww. You're right, we need to fight against this reality and... Sorry. Oh, sorry for the weird conversation so early in the morning. I bet everyone's waiting. like a line in the ground where they're where they met too and it's like no you can't walk over there mm. looks like i could enter the school building from here but it's blocked off god damn it god damn it is it okay if we post those items in the discord um i don't see how that's a spoiler right Unless the spoiler is, 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 like, the item implies something's gonna happen. I don't see if that could be a spoiler. I don't think anyone would mind. Ask first in case anyone would mind, but I, I would like a list of all the ones I, sh I need to get, or at least the ones in order. Maybe if you got, uh, if you guys tell me you need it by, before this chapter, then I might know someone might die. So, let's not do it that way, but just... Just tell me which ones I need, uh, but don't tell me when I need them. Shuichi. Morning, sushi. Okay. Good morning. Huh? What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be at the dining hall? I'm. I was just on my way there. Um. Hey. Katie. What's the matter? Yeah. No. That's uh, nothing. The others are probably waiting for us. We should go. Put your fucking hat on properly. I wonder what's up with sushi. He seems preoccupied with something. Yeah, something's a little fishy. Well, I can ask him later. I need to go. Okay, where can we, where's, where's the store? Let's go see if we can spend some coins. Nope, we can't. Whoa, this place needs to be bigger. Oh, everyone's here already. So then, now all of us have arrived. Kihihi, <laughs> I'm glad. It looks as though it looks as though there were no victims. Of course. But of, but of course. By the way. By the way, are you okay, Katie? Huh? Huh? What do you mean? See. Well, you looked really bummed out after everyone started blaming you yesterday. Wait. Hey, hey, what are you doing, Oliver? That's so mean. Seriously, you guys are so mean. Poor girl. She tried her best to encourage everyone, and you sore losers got mad at her anyway. That's enough. What's the point of bringing that up again? Hey, degenerate male. Actually, didn't you blame Katie first? And now it's my fault? Why are you guys ganging up on me? <laughs> it's Boy Meekan. Wow, you guys are terrible, so horrible, so mean. <laughs> hmm. You're too noisy. Cut it out. Jeez. But it's true. Everyone blamed Katie without taking any responsibility to themselves. Uh, no. Hey, come on now. Everyone was just probably tired. Shut up! Shut it. There's no excuse. That's wrong. No, that's wrong. No, it's okay. It doesn't bother me. I. It's just, I should have been more considerate of everyone's feelings. I wonder who the traitor sorry. is. I was too focused on the tunnel, so I'm sorry. I see. All right. Well, if you're okay with it, then so am I. Thank goodness. Phew. Cool beans. Now everything's settled. Cool beans, man. Hey. But you did blame her first, didn't you? It's a lie. Well. That was a lie, you know. More of those lies to make us more united or whatever. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. <laughs> Did you know half my lies are actually told with good intentions? What are you saying? Now that sounds like a lie. Um Let's just forget about it and discuss something else. Right? Okay, let's all think about ways to get out of here. Before you do that, I have an announcement. Uh, Stop it! Hey, don't just suddenly show up. It's too much stress for my heart. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to, to. I didn't mean to not surprise you. I knew it. So you did mean to surprise us. What's wrong? Well, your announcement. Well, now. It's not terribly important, but it's easier to stay alive by being an obvious goody two shoes, right? Being thrust into a killing game doesn't mean you'll be able to kill someone easily, so I figured I'd ease you guys into the killing game by giving you motivation to kill. What? 
Motivation to kill. I'll answer that. In short, a motive. That ought to add some mystery to the proceedings. Even if a killer is exposed, they could whip up a sob story to deceive everyone. Incomprehensible. What, what are you saying? Your logic is impossible to understand. Now then. I will now announce the first motive. Make sure you record this moment for posterity. Is it meaning you'll lead motive enough? Now then. The special motive I prepared is called the First Blood Perk. Interesting. Wow! For the first murder that occurs, no class trial will be held. Can you believe it? What? That means the first one to kill someone will get to graduate. No strings attached. Ooh. Okay, just kill someone in the room right now. Just do it. Do it. Let's just let's just do it literally right now. There's no trial. You just get to graduate. The bear fucking lies, but they don't know that. Just do it right now. What are you talking about? No class trial will be held. Let me explain. I'm sorry that I made the class trial seem more important than it really is. So for the first murder, I decided not to hold a class trial at all. Psycho! Please just relax, calm down, and kill. After all, the first one's free. Really? Huh? That's all? We just gotta kill someone to get out of here? Don't! That's all? What's that supposed to mean? Please just calm down. You gotta be kidding me! First blood perk? Don't make it sound like some kind of game show bonus. <laughs> <laughs> you say that, but I bet you're really happy, huh? <laughs> There's no way I'm happy. Stop it. So stop messing around. Do you think this is fun for us? Uh? Hmm? No, that's wrong. Do you really think I'd kill someone just to get out? Someone will. That's wrong. In your dreams. We're not gonna lose to you. We promised each other we'd escape from this place. <laughs> Spare me your false bravado. You should be focusing on how you plan to survive. You just gotta kill someone, right? Always messing Why, around. Bastard. How should I put this? I see. The prisoner's dilemma. How very clever of you, Monokuma. Huh? Huh? What's that? It's true. We all know it's better to cooperate rather than betray each other, right? But if you don't cooperate, you receive some benefit that no one else gets. So ensure. It's an incentive to betray the group to give yourself an advantage. With that in the back of all of our minds, we're less likely to cooperate. Sure. That's Monokuma's plan. To make a non-cooperative game that tanks Katie's plan to get us to cooperate. Huh? What? Uh, um... And if a murder were to occur, it'd be even more unlikely that we'd cooperate. Oh, damn, did someone say something? How terrifying. It's likely he created this perk for that sole purpose. To tell you the truth. Right. I bet you can't stand all this tension in the air, right? So it's better to just kill. Uh... What, you? Please wait. It seems you are quite serious about forcing us to participate in this killing game. What exactly is your objective? Shut up! His objective doesn't matter. I'm through letting him have his way. I've had enough. Kato lunged toward Monokuma to grab him, but... Rise and shine, sign. Hell yeah! Hell yeah, looks like we got ourselves a volunteer. My heart's racing. Finally, it's time for the exercise. I'll do it! We won't let you lay a hand on Daddy. We want Daddy to smile every day. And that's that. You bastards better pay attention. This is what happens when you mess with us. What? What? What are you guys planning to do? Please stop! Please don't. Kaito! Run, Kaito. In that moment, we heard menacing mechanical noises. The XSL charged. Smash. The sound of crushing metal echoed throughout the dining hall. And then a final gasp. Nani? What? Huh? Father! <laughs> Daddy got turned into a pile of scrap metal. She's it's vomiting. Fault. This is Monodom's fault somehow. Poor Monodam. <laughs> what is this? What's going on? Jeez. I'm not sure what's going on, but Monokuma is in pieces. Uh, okay. It serves him right. He got just what he deserved. I do not agree. Do not celebrate just yet. I'm certain he has a spare that will appear momentarily. Stop it! There is no spare. Don't trivialize life like that. Huh? What? 
When father was still alive, he used to tell us cubs that we must cherish life because we're little snowflakes, unique in every way. Well... If only one existed, then does, then does this mean Monokuma is dead? Oh. Poor daddy, let's at least bury him with full honors. Oh. Yeah, we'll cook him low and slow to lock in the flavor. <laughs> in that case... <laughs> While we're at it, we should toss in some carrots and potatoes too. Ah. Ooh, maybe add some leftover curry too? You know, the sweet kind, my favorite. <laughs> You'll want an extra large side of rice too, right? That's right. Now that we're in the now that we're the new headmasters, we gotta eat more so we can get stronger. So long, farewell. So long, farewell. Seven. Um. Um, what's going on? Anyway. Hmm. Everything is a complete mess now. But if there's no final boss, <laughs> then that means this killing game is canceled. I wish someone's gonna die and be like, yo, Monokuma said that we had a first blood perk, and they're like, whoa, we don't know that. He, that's that's Monokuma's business. We're the headmasters now. Fuck you, you know, first blood perk. Huh? huh? Canceled? Oh, no. I don't think so. Monokuma's just a robot. There has to be someone controlling don't him. Don't worry. Haha, <laughs> don't be such a worry wart. Everything's definitely over now. With the mastermind gone, continuing this game is pretty much impossible. So that means... Which means we win. Yeah. Yay, we did it. <laughs> well. So we're not in danger anymore? Uh. Oh, so do we just wait here for the shuttle bus to pick us up, or... That's wrong! Whoa, what the fuck happened to the left there? W wait a minute, we don't know that yet. Hmm. Katie, quit being a buzzkill. Everyone's still annoyed about what you did yesterday. Huh? But, but I didn't mean it like that. Well, or is there still something you would have us do, Katie? Trashy skank! Don't tell me you want to take on that underground passage again. All right, already. Quiet. We know it's impossible. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. Whatevs. Looks like we're done here. Phew, what a relief. After Kochiki finished talking, we all went our separate ways. I decided to return to my room. I don't know why, but once I went inside my room, I just started crying uncontrollably. Uh. Why? At that moment, the intercom in my room rang. Damn, it's Kramer. Kramer, what are you doing? Just bust in! Um, the intercom is someone at the door. I quickly wipe my tears and open the door. Are you okay? Katie, are you alright? Yeah. Oh, sushi. Um, what do you mean? I'm not sad if that's what you're wondering. I'm... Katie, it's not your fault. Huh? Huh? I knew it. The underground passage was a trap. It was a trap to get us to think we could work together, then crush our hopes. You might be right. But... I know that, but... I just wanted to escape with everyone. You know? But it's all right now. Everything is over, right? Um... Katie, I know how you feel. I believe in you. Huh? What? You believe in me? Is that all right? There's something I have to tell you. Will you come to the library with me? The library? What's gotten into sushi all of a sudden? Damn. Um... Hey, what do you want to talk about? That's... I'd like to talk to you in the library. Will you come with me, please? Oh shit. Sushi. What's going on, Sushi? You're acting a little off. A little raw. matter gone to searching for something bugs are there's no bugs here after all I see oh yeah you did mention that before gonta, gonta trying to understand why you're right ah uh, that's right of course the ultimate entomologist would notice but that gonta have no idea but it's okay gonta not give up gentlemen not give up that easy allow gonta so gonta go search even more how could there possibly be no bugs Hey, look at, look at you two, out for a walk together, huh? Why don't you pick up some rubbers over at the warehouse? Better safe than sorry. Oh, that's a good idea. Huh? 
What? We, we don't need those. What? You must be a real fucking skank to let dudes unload inside you. <laughs> By day you're fingering the piano keys, but at night the dudes are fingering you, eh? Oh, Shut the hell up. What kind of girl do you think I am? Please it, it was a joke. Me. I was just trying to lighten the mood a little. Uh, um, Let's ignore her, Katie. We have to focus. Right, we need to head to the library and get some rubbers. In any event... Who would have expected our foe to die in such a way? What a disappointing ending. Well, in any event, it means the situation is over. I can go home and spend time with sister. I see. And work on my website. Oh, you have a sister, Keo? I bet she's worried about you. But that's probably true of everyone's family, including mine. Sister. Sister is terribly lonely. I need to get back to her as soon as possible. Is this a better fit for the voice chat? I need to get back to my parents and friends, too. Is that a better fit for Yusuke voice? Got it. See, it's just like I said. Um, huh, what's just like you said? Keep your chin up. Sometimes you gotta be a little reckless to make your dreams a reality. Yeah. Huh, what are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Huh, what do you mean? It's thanks to me that we defeated Monokuma, right? All right. I still don't know how to get out of here, but the number one threat is not is gone uh, now. Um, ah, Kato, to be honest, what you did was really dangerous. Uh, okay. Well, I was a little nervous, just a little. <laughs> but now we know the universe is watching that bear got the cosmic justice he deserved. The universe is always on the side of those who push the limits and never give I up. I see. Um, I guess. Leave it to me. Anyway, Monokuma is gone now, thanks to me. All we gotta do is escape. Got a minute? Are you going back to that underground passageway? Huh? huh? Why are you asking me that all of a sudden? You don't know? You don't think this is over, do you? Your attitude earlier gave it away. Because. And I figured you'd take on take on that passageway with her since you two seems since you two seem so chummy. That's uh, I'm not trying to take on take anyone's side. Sure, whatever. You guys are free to do whatever you want. Just leave the rest the rest of us out of it. Damn. I knew it. She's kind of unpleasant, isn't she? No, she's alright. She's a little cold. A little Kyoko. Hey! Hey, is the shuttle bus coming or not? I've been waiting for a while now. Um, I don't think a bus is gonna come. This whole place is surrounded by a caged I wall. See. Oh yeah. Actually. Um, it's just that it's customary to come back from a con by bus. But... I travel by bus even in summer and winter. The bus driver sings sea shanties for me. In the past I was saddled with debt, but now I'm the proud owner of my very own home. What is she talking about? Actually, Never mind. It's just plain unimportant. Well, anyway, since the wall's so big, I wonder how the, the bus would even get in here. Would a bus really be able to get here? Okay, you, you seem like the Awari of the group. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, she's gone. That you don't really fully comprehend what's going on. Tenko, what are you doing? Sneak attack! I was hoping I could learn more about magic from Himoko. <sighs> Himioko? Himioko? I don't know. I definitely want to incorporate magic into Neo Akito. Please tell me, Himoko, what sort of training do you usually do? What a pain. I told you I get tired talking about I'll protect it. You. Then I'll massage your back so you won't get tired. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't mind if you rested your head on my lap either. Oh damn, this she's like really thirsty for the girls. Gross. Stop it. That's weird. <sighs> he manco? Oh sorry, he manco, yep. He like he man, like he man the cartoon, he manco. Alright, he manco. Nah, hey you guys, save me from this conversation. What's wrong? What's the matter, he manco? We're not done talking yet, are we? Way better now. It's the worst What's boy. Wrong? 
Hey there, you two. Something wrong? Um, no, nothing's hey. wrong. Hey, Rantaro. You said there's someone behind all this, right? That Monokuma is just That's a puppet. True. I did say that, but you know what? It's just a hunch. How should I put this? I sure wouldn't complain if that's how it all turned out, though. And away he goes. Uh, thank you, Myers Codex, for the former three subs. Sorry it took me so long to see it. Thank you, Myers Codex. Hopefully you're still here. Cake walking, you some bits to say. You didn't see my last message, but thank you for the DR3 talk, the best laugh I had the whole week. And I regret and I regret bantering Zarakava. Their taste in girls is top notch. Ooh, that's a pretty good compliment between weebs, isn't it? Damn, complimenting your best girls? Complimenting your waifu? Damn, that's like normal people shaking hands and saying they respect each other. Like, holy shit, damn. Action Cater used some bits to say, Hia Miokia is how you pronounce it. Hia Miokia. Damn, that's a mouthful. Like before, the empty library is filled with the scent of old, musty books. Uh, um. Okay, before I say anything else, I want you to promise. I want you to promise me you'll keep the secret. Yeah. Okay, got it. Sushi looked relieved and smiled. I love you. Like a great detective, he began to explain in exacting detail. Remember, this library has books scattered everywhere, even books lying on top of the bookcases. But it, take a look at this bookcase. It's the only one in the library with no books on top. Uh. Oh, that one? Huh, you're right. Hmm. Also, you can see that the floor in front of the bookcase has noticeable markings. Mm -hmm. You're right. What is this? I'm... I noticed the markings the first time I came here with you. This morning I came back to investigate. That's when I found this. He then walked over to the bookcase, placed his hands between the gap, and whipped it out. Ramble, ramble, ramble. And he moved the bookcase. Whoa, it moved. Whoa, it, moved. it swings open. It swings open. Look, there's a door Look, behind there's it. There's a door behind it. A door. Shit. I really want to know what's inside. Who knows? Be some really good shit in there. Look at what. Wait, didn't we clear all these already and we're getting coins for them? So this is what you wanted to show me? Okay. That's why I wanted you to come here with me. There's something unique about this door. Take a closer look. Damn, it's black and white like Monokuma. Card reader? Um. Is this... If I remember correctly... It's a card reader. I think we can safely assume that it opens the hidden door. Oh, okay. The pattern on the hidden door is black and white. Just like Monokuma. Hey. Hey, do you think this door is connected to Monokuma somehow? That's... I think it might, but I don't know anything for sure. This door has a card reader lock, so I can't open it. Huh? You can't? Is that alright? But the very fact this door is here makes me consider a certain possibility. There's a chance that one of us here is cooperating with Monokuma. <gasps> huh? Oh, shit. Huh? Cooperating with Monokuma? Ah, uh, jeez. Wait a minute. What do you mean by that? Hey. It's only a hypothesis right now, but consider this. Why would there be a hidden door here? That's true, it's a good point, that's a good point, that's a good point. If it were solely for Monokuma's use, he wouldn't need to hide it. He could just have the, Monoc the Monocubs or the Ex Exisols protect it and keep... Bleh, protect it and keep it in plain sight. Hmm. However, I can think of one reason that the door would be hidden. For one of us to sneak in and use it without anyone else noticing. Um. Maybe, but I can't believe someone in our group could be working with Monokuma. That's true. I can't believe it either. That's why, to confirm my suspicions, I decided to set a little trap on this card reader. I sprinkled some dust inside the card reader so that I could tell if it was used. 
Of course, I was careful to make sure the dust wouldn't come loose accidentally. I don't know how I did that, but I did it. And I don't think the person swiping their card would notice or care about a little dust. Um. So if we see dust on the floor, it means one of us has, has used the door, right? Well, It's the new rule of S Sushi's code. Dust on the floor, someone opened the door. Well, as I mentioned before, this is just a hypothesis. I have no evidence yet. But... But if this is true, then even, Mon then even if Monokuma is gone, this isn't going to end, Katie. Uh, um... Anyway, that's what I had to tell you. Of course, I don't expect you to believe me. I'm... I just wanted to tell you, no matter what. Yeah. Yeah. Then... Well, let's head back. We shouldn't stay here too long. After putting the moving bookcase back into place, we cautiously left the library. Is that all right? Katie, please don't tell anyone what I showed you. I don't want to cause a panic. Yeah. Yeah, I understand. It was fucking huge. Oh, the door. Yeah, okay. Having made our promise, we return to our own rooms. Ding, ding, bong. Ding, ding, bong. Whoa, what? He's just by himself this time. Uh, thank you, Fidel Caspro. <laughs> Fidel Caspro. Thank you very much. Uh, welcome to uh, the Rubber Dub Sub Club. Thank you so much. Thank you for the sub. I like this song. Oh, nice. Come on, Dan. Just one? One. The other Monocubs aren't here to bury Monokuma. Well, anyway, what Sushi told me earlier is really disturbing. One of us is cooperating with Monokuma. It's just so hard to believe. But Sushi trusts me. That's why he told me, right? Then maybe I should believe it. Damn. Monokuma Theater. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Wow, we're already out of material. Like closing time at a sushi restaurant. <gasps> oh, is that a clue? When a series lasts for several seasons, eventually it'll run out of material. And they just start saying the same shit over and over again, like Leon. My memory has been awful lately. I wonder if it's because of how long the series has been going. Wait, what season are we on again? What material have we shown so far? Jeez, I don't remember. Maybe it's because they've released so many at this point. Oh well, anyway, we need new material for the Monokuma Theater. Please send your manuscripts along with a $1,000 application fee. If your entry is selected, you will receive a $100 gift card. What a generous prize. Don't miss this opportunity. Send your applications today. Someone would do it. I wish you would just say, morning. It's already morning. I didn't sleep well last night. Yesterday's conversation is still on my mind. I wonder what everyone else is doing. Are they already gathered at the dining yeah. hall? I guess I'll go for now. Damn. Yeah, the candlestick's there again. Why did the candlestick vanish when we got the key and now it's back again? That's weird. But not as weird as this guy. Morning, Ryoma. Oh. Ah, we're way past morning by this point. Huh? Huh, really? Didn't the morning announcement just play, though? It's an old story. In prison, mornings were a lot earlier. We started at dawn. Huh? That early? In other words. In the day, we'd do our work and eat at the same time. At night, all we could do was sleep. Inside those prison walls, I lived a frighteningly disciplined life. I see. Hmm. I suppose that's... That sort of life sounds healthy, I guess. <laughs> Humph. Healthy body, healthy mind. Not cool. That's a bitter irony. Not cool. That's right. Rama was a famous tennis player before he became a prisoner. Did I make him feel bad? Damn, I hope so. He's weird. Spend coins? I tried. It won't let me. I can try again. 
Hey, um, Ryden. Good morning, Katie. Uh, good morning, Kibo. Everyone appears to have gathered at the dining hall again. I see. Yep, looks like it. For now. I'm thinking about heading over there as well, but. Um. But. I. Oh, nothing. I was. Fucking. Like, full on Nagito hands here. Well. Oh, nothing. I was just wondering when someone is going to come rescue us. It's been almost a full day since Monokuma was dispatched, but our situation hasn't changed. I'm just speculating, but what if only Monokuma knew about this place? What if this location is not on any map? What if no one is coming to rescue us? Huh? huh? Which means maybe we'll f we'll just be forgotten, and no one will find it. No will find us again. Don't say that. Besides, we should be trying to escape, not waiting for someone to rescue us. That's right. Yes, I apologize. I was overthinking things. As I thought. It would be impossible to discreetly construct a facility such as this in the first place. Plus, if the professor knew I was missing, he would not rest until he found me. With his technology, he would rescue us no matter where on earth this place is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, like, let's, like, we're in a, we're in a city, aren't we? Isn't this a city? Or is this... Actually, you know what? What, where are we? I thought for sure these were silhouettes of buildings outside the wall, but they're not. They're, they're inside. What the fuck is this? Yeah, I was wrong with what I first saw here. What is this? That's the wall? But they said there's no holes in the wall. They're like, how did we get in here? It's like, well, clearly you fucking took a helicopter in or something. Like, Ooh. It's a dumb. That's why I thought too. I thought it. I thought it was a glass dome, and you could see through it and see buildings on the other side. Good morning, Katie. Um. Morning. Mm, I see. I see. Are you finally ready to make an offering? Huh? Right now? Sorry. Sorry. I still have anemia. Huh? Huh? That's a bummer. Major bummer. You're creepy, small Aoi. This is a problem, though. I need an offering from someone to thank Atua for smiting Monokuma. Make sure you eat a big breakfast, Kay. Hope your anemia clears up soon. She's serious about offering my blood. Um, yeah, I do. I think she is serious. All right, let's talk to everyone while we're out here because these conversations aren't that bad. All right. Good morning, Katie. Um, morning. Maybe. Man, I slept great last night. You know, this place is all right when there's nothing to worry about. Oh, so how far have you gone with, with sushi? That's wrong. Huh? No, that's wrong. What are you talking about? I'm right clicking. Maybe it's because it's, it's not. Yeah, there you go. That's wrong. No, that's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. That's wrong. What were you imagining just now? I just wanted to know how far you've gone exploring this place together. That's all. Because that's none of your business, Kochiki. Huh? What's with the attitude? You're so mean. I thought you said we were friends, Katie. But you were lying this whole time. Stop it. Yeah, well, you're lying Did too. I get caught? Oh, wow, Katie. You know how to stand your ground, don't you? But you're right. I was lying. After all, we're just strangers to one another. That's why I don't really care what you and Sushi do. Besides, even friends don't share everything with each other. Huh? Huh? Because? I'm more nervous around friends who share too much than strangers, really. Change the controller for next stream? Yeah, I will. Yep. Hey. Morning, Tenko. Hey. Yeah. Whoa. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm so sorry about that. Good morning. Jeez. What was all that all about? Um. Well, I haven't done much training since I got here, so I did some light exercise in the gym, but I'm still full of energy, so I'm shouting to burn it off. I see. <laughs> Anyway, exercise makes me hungry, so I'm gonna head to the dining hall. See ya. 
later skater. Only the skater boy. So see you later, boy. Sigh. What's wrong? Look at this. My nails are all messed up. It probably happened when we came here, and now I can't take good care of them. Um, Your nails? Um, I understand. You're surprised that plain old me cares about my nails, right? No. Well, not really. But when you say nails, you mean nail art, right? I've never done it before. I see. Oh, I see. Nails would just would just plain get in the way when playing piano, huh? Yeah. Yeah. I see. As a pianist, you're pretty strict about stuff like this, I guess. Um, you're exaggerating, but yeah, sometimes I gotta hold back on some uh, stuff. Well, I guess the middle of a killing game isn't the time to, to be worrying about nails. Sigh, I want to, I want to hurry and go home. Damn. Poor girl. Why are you closed? Why are you closed? I want to shop. I missed an event? How? I, I, I couldn't buy anything until now. Right? I, I, it wouldn't let me in the... I, I can't go into the shop still. You can't get it without playing the demo? Oh, okay. Alright. Despite all my worrying, everyone in the dining hall was in a good mood. Right? Man, for a moment I had no idea what was going to happen. I'm glad it turned out like this. That's right. You're getting a lot of screen time, crazy guy. I wonder if you're going to get killed. Yeah, seriously. Mm -hmm. yeah, I slept well last night. Also, I went to the bathroom and brushed my teeth by myself. All right, Hyoko. That's amazing. You did all that with magic? You're so amazing, Himoko. Thanks, B to Atua. Praise B to Atua. Surely he helped you in his own mysterious, miraculous way. I see. This Atua seems to act in secret a lot. Because Atua is because watching Atua over Because Atua smells us. of danger. Mm. But when, so but when someone coming to get us, one hundred percent. Whoever, whoever does, I assume they will come today. There's no need to worry. Hmm. Why the long face? Oh no. It's, it's nothing. I figured no one would listen to some guy who can't even remember his own talent, right? That is... What do you mean? Never mind. Really, it's nothing. This is quite the happy ending. Hmm... But is this really how this ends? Without thinking, I had blurted that out loud, and now everyone was staring at me. Um... I mean, it just seems too easy. I don't think it'll end like this. Oh? I wonder, do you wish the killing game would have continued? That's not true. No, not at all. Fucking bitch! Then don't ruin our happy moment, you fucking skank. Hmm. Hey, Katie, I don't know what you're so worried about, but Monokuma is dead now. There's no way the killing game can continue, you know? It's my turn, Kuma! Monokuma, and that's my cue to appear, Kuma. Huh? What? <laughs> Go! Oh. Monokuma? He's still alive? It's my turn, yeah. No, no, are you guys blind or something, Kuma? I ain't Monokuma, Kuma. After dying in a tragic car accident, I've been reborn as a yokai. Call me Jibakuma Kuma. What is it? Jibakuma. Headmaster! Kuma. From now on, I'm the headmaster of the Ultimate Academy, Kuma. Meh. You might feel uncomfortable at first, but eventually you'll get used to it, meh. Huh? Did I slip up, meh? On your knees! No duh, you fucking fraud. Go find another car to run you over, and this time stay dead. That's terrible! 
adorable. Ah, oh, jeez. It's such a low-level cosplay. I can't bear to look. From an anthropological I have point an important of view. I have an important question. Haven't you mistaken ghosts for yokai? Yokai are mythological creatures first created back when humanity lived closely with nature. Back then, they were the embodiment of unexplainable natural phenomena. Man, you guys are buzzkills, man. I was all set for adventure before you started yelling at me, Kuma. You're really bugging This is why I hate teenagers. I'd have cash for days if I was dealing with the under 10 crowd. Rise and shine, sign! Jeez, it's loud in here. What's all the ruckus about? Oh. Wait, what? Our father, who we thought was dead, is actually alive! Nerf. No way, Papa Kuma's too hip and modern to resort to the death is cheap trope. The yokai did it! I bet the yokai did it. Yeah! No, that bit's already over. What are you saying? It ain't over yet. I think we're still talking about spooky stuff. You should have told us you were still alive. We'd be making stew with your body. <laughs> Wait, if Papa Kuma is standing here, then whose body is in the stew pot? Wow, which Papa Kuma is the real one? What are you saying? No, they're both real. <laughs> huh? But father, you said there's only one of each of us that were unique like snowflakes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well, yeah, there's only one of each of you guys, but I've got loads of spares. <laughs> Gah, why don't we get to have spare? Why do you get to have spares and we don't? Be quiet! Of course you don't get to have spares. Do you really think anyone in this day and age would tolerate the death is cheap trope? I mean, almost every week. <gasps> huh? What does that mean? Got it. Not all weebs. Sorry, not all weebs. Not all weebs. But now we know. This school has a machine somewhere that can make a whole lot of pops. Just activate that machine and you can have as many spare pops as you want. Slurp, 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 slurp. Will this loop? Slurp, 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 slurp. Oh, well, cool. All right. Uh, Tovarsh has resubscribed with for four months. Tovarsh, I think. Hopefully, I'm saying that right. Tovarsh, thank you, thank you, thank you for the resub. Hope you're enjoying Danging Rump with V3. It's going pretty well so far, I think. I'm enjoying it. Reds have to use a bit to say you can't get the first event, which was. Tsunami talking about nails. Only way to get the first playthrough is by playing the demo first and getting it as a gift from the start again. Oh, okay. Alright. That's fine. Mr. Boom Bane Explosion Man. Short Man has the same voice actor as Gundam and Pat. And Katie has the same voice actor as Anne and Kyoko. Oh, really? It's Kyoko? Damn. Wait. On? I thought On was... No, you might be right. Okay, yeah. Never mind. Slurp, slurp, slurp. Hell no! This is an emotional reunion, so y'all gotta take your licks! <laughs> Father, your love is smothering us! Yeah! Oh, yeah. <laughs> no more, no more! Oh, she does look back. What the fuck? <laughs> My widow cubs! When I see you guys, I just get so excited until I can't take it anymore. Yeah! You guys are so cute. Gosh, I just want to see what your parents look like. kind of feel like... Sometimes I feel the games would be better if it didn't have the Monokuma bullshit. It was me! Wait, I'm your parents. Um... I, sorry, I can't react to this. I'm in too much shock. Or at least they, they cut about half of it out. Does this mean the killing game is going to continue? Uh... Continue. The killing game is gonna continue. What a pain. What a pain. <laughs> That's not the problem, donkey face. Mm. What do you mean the killing game? What do you mean the killing game is gonna continue? <laughs> I mean that sounds a lot less boring, so I guess it's okay. You gotta be kidding me! No, it's definitely not okay. Is that right? So that's how it's gonna be. If we want this, if we want to end this, I see. We have to take down Monokuma and the person behind him. I predicted there would be a spare, but I did not expect it to be built within the academy. I do not mind. Either way, I assumed this would happen. This development was not surprising. And another thing. Is that so? Then did you also assume this next exciting development? Ahem! Ahem. Now, then. now then, I'm pleased I'm to announce. I'm pleased to announce an additional motive. An additional motive? A time limit is now in effect. 
if a murder does not occur by night time, two days from now. Okay, is it going to be you all die, or is it the first blood bonus gets taken away? The first blood bonus would be better. First blood perk would be better. If if you all die, then that's just like again, that's just the the bear making a murder. Then every student participating in this killing game will die. That's not cool, man. That's just making a murder. Mold to shreds by countless monokumas from the rumored monokuma making machine. So unless you want to end up as pink smears, you might. <laughs> he sounds different in these scenes. Huh? That's exactly what he wants to. Oh yeah, it it makes sense. I'm not saying it doesn't make sense. I just mean it's it's less compelling than them killing because they because they're they've been convinced. It's, I, I think it's more interesting that a bunch of strangers are locked in a place and are convinced to kill than coerced. That's 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 what I think. The time limit? What? What? Everyone will die? What is this? What? That's not fair. House. Jeez, why do you guys even come to the school if you're not going to do the killing game? Shut up! You're the one that forced us to come here. Um... Quick question, father. What do you mean by countless monokumas? I thought we were up... We were up once time right now. I thought we were up once time right now. What? Let's do it! Damn right, the XSLs do their thing this time. No, no. But I'd rather not go through that again. I'd feel bad if you guys tired yourselves out. Yeah, but But if we let the Existals get popular, we could have a real cash cow on our hands, you know? The merchandising rights alone would make us richer than Sultans. Ah, to hmm. be Sultans, again. huh? Very tempting, but That's bad. I won't let you kids ruin your futures. You need to have your own kids and ruin their futures. <laughs> Removing the first blood bonus wouldn't make sense. So, well, I mean, it's like th this is a limited time offer. If you don't kill someone in the first two days, then we you have a trial. And now it's like, oh shit, well, am I gonna. Anyone who's on the fence might be like, okay, I was gonna kill someone and I know that I'm gonna get. A I that I don't even need to get away with it. I just need to kill someone and I get to leave. And they're like, okay, but I'll decide later and see what happens. But now it's like, oh, now there's a time limit. It's going to go away. It's a limited time offer. Eh, okay, I'm going to do it. I think it could push someone over the edge. I don't know. I just, like I said, I just think convincing is better than coercion. It's more interesting. It still makes sense, though. Like, the bear's fucking nuts. Daddy! Daddy, you love us so much. Oh, That's enough. Oh? oh, you're still here? Of course, we never left. Why? Whoop, that was not Monokuma. Why are you doing this? How much suffering do you want to put us through? Hmm? I see. Well, if you're suffering, you all better hurry up and start the killing game. <laughs> Hoo -hoo -hoo. Then you can say bye-bye to the suffering. You, you bastard. To tell you the truth. Don't you realize that working together is pointless? So just knock it off already. You know what you gotta do, don't you? <laughs> You're surrounded by strangers, neither allies nor friends. No need to worry about them. Well... Plus, you got the first blood perk. That means the first kill is free. Oh damn, they're bringing it up again. How gory! But the killing game is gory, huh? I'm starting to feel a little queasy. Hell yeah! Hell yeah. And if they don't play, then they're dead anyway. And that's way more gore, eh? Hmm. I see. If it's gratuitous, over-the-top gore, I might be able to stomach that. Forget the killing game, then. It'd be better for you all just to die together. Shut up! Shut up and get the fuck back. <laughs> Ooh, hoo, hoo. Well, what you guys decide next is all up to you. Do whatever you want. You can all die working together, or you can survive on your own. It's your call. <laughs> <laughs> Man, father is in the zone. I was getting irritated till he said all that. Hell yeah, let's toss back some honey to celebrate Papa Kuma's return. Yo, Monadam, go get some pure organic honey. Pour some honey on me, in the name of killing. So long, farewell. Eight? Seven? Eight? After Monokuma left, all that remained was utter fear and despair. Um, 
Um, what are we going to do nighttime in two days? We'll be here in an instant. Really? There's got to be something we can do. I can't die. The world needs my genius. I don't like that. I don't want to. I don't want to die yet. Die. Everyone's going to die? Is dying the only choice? Atua says so. You don't need to worry. Atua will welcome you with open arms. Mm. That's, af that's after we die, right? Jeez. We can't panic about something like this. I'll do something about well, it. Well then. Did you have a course of action in mind? Shut up! I'm going to start thinking of one right now. I don't understand. So yeah, this cast is growing on me a bit. Their, their interactions are pretty good. The cast is growing on me. Individually, I think some of them are weak, but um, together in these scenes, yep, it's growing on me. Figures, I didn't expect anything from me in the first place. I can't, I can't even decide if I like the, the cast of the first game better than the second game, though. Probably the first game, a little bit. I think there might have been some better characters in the second game, but they die too quickly. So I think the first, the first game has the better cast overall. Figures, I didn't expect anything from you in the first place. No can forgive. We've got to fight back then. Um. Yeah. If we strike them with some sneak attacks, we might have a chance at winning. No. What kind of Aikido moves even involve sneak attacks? Going to want to help everyone. Come everyone, gone to use body, keep everyone Not safe. Not cool. You're gonna go against those machines barehanded? Isn't that too reckless? Mm -hmm. But but, we have to do it. If we don't, we'll die. But wait, we still have plenty of time to calculate all possible options. How terrifying. We've no time to be indecisive. We are being urged to make a decision. To die fighting or die from the time limit. Stop it! Why do both choices involve us dying? How? In no way. Are we really gonna die? I don't wanna die yet. Shit. I'm gonna survive. I'm gonna make it no matter what. Uh, no matter what? That's wrong! Wait, you can't do that though. Even if you make a mistake, you can't. Oh. Then you'll accept the blame? Huh? Huh? Because... Will you accept the blame if I die? I have people who'll be sad if I die, you know. Um. Uh, well... <laughs> I'm lying. No one will be sad if I die. But if... Uh, but I don't know if the same can be said for everyone else. So that means... Anyway, I'm gonna take off uh. now. Yeah, see you later. Take off. Where are you going, Kochi? Co 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 Where are you going, Pikachu? Um. I don't know. Maybe I'll just go back... I'll go back to my room and just think things over. Alone. Damn. Alone in your room? What do you mean by that? Are you inviting me to come kill you? Um, you? I, Enough I, that I try to claim that perk for myself. I'm way too classy to kill someone. <laughs> Talking to you idiots is exhausting. I'm gonna go to my room and rest. Damn, I'm gonna go and spend some fucking mono coins. Got it? Miu, you better not do anything shady, okay? I'm worried. There's no need to worry, is there? No one is going to kill anyone, right? Mm. If someone is going to kill, they should go for the robot. No way! That's even worse. Hmm. Hmm. So everyone feels that killing is wrong. But why is that? Huh? What? How mysterious. Of course, I know it to be against the law, but laws are simply rules people decided upon. This is a space removed from those rules, therefore we've no need to follow them. That's enough! Don't say stupid shit like that. Even kids know killing is bad. It's common sense. However... Even if it is to survive, we are as guinea pigs upon the upon a lab table. We cannot be picky about our means of survival. What? what? Says Carl Sagan. Hehehe. <laughs> <laughs> I only wish to observe the beauty of humanity and witness the depths of its sins. So you've no need to fear me. Uh, are they all gonna leave one by one? Kyo. Mm -hmm. Males in the. And the soft sciences are pretty soft themselves, so I don't think he'll do anything. Jeez. He's not wrong, though. If we want to stay alive, standing around grumbling's not gonna change anything. Well. All things are. As things are. Sorry, I was distracted by his look. As things are, we're not, we're not all going to escape together. We're all going to die together. Are you guys okay with that? Damn, one by one they're leaving. Stop it. Hold on, everyone. We haven't decided on our plan yet. I'm right already. You can decide that on your own. Huh? Huh? You don't know? Your half assed speeches won't work on us anymore. You know that, right? Then Damn, what if I sing a song? So just come up with a plan for yourself. Uh. Damn. Ten minutes left of the scene. Wait, Mackie, wait. Well then. I'm just gonna pray to Atua. 
like? Yeah, can I just go and think to my, by myself for a little? It's a shame I won't be able to hide all my special art commissions before I die. Or that special pillowcase I bought. What should I do? Oh, damn. Damn. What a catch. But, but wait, you guys. That's wrong! You guys, you can't listen to Monokuma. <laughs> Everyone, what's wrong? Why everyone scatter? <laughs> Fine then. All of you, just do whatever you want. Mm. This is exactly what Monokuma wants us to do. So what else is part of his plan? Is my memory part of it too? If it is, then... That's a shame. Can I even trust myself? Huh? Rantaro, what's wrong? Mm. What's wrong, he says. How should I put this? Hey, I have a question. This might sound a little weird, but... Does the term ultimate hunt ring a bell for anyone? Ultimate hunt? Um... What is that? I've never heard of it. What's the matter? What about it? Never mind. Nothing. Forget it. Huh? Did the memory wipe not work on him from the first time? Does he remember going into the gymnasium the first time? Hmm. Huh? Excuse me. What do you mean, Rantar Rantaro? Oh, no. It's nothing, really. I'm just a bit confused is all. Hmm. Actually... Everyone's a little anxious about not being able to remember how they got here, right? Well, in my case, not only am I dealing with that, I also can't remember my talent. I'm sorry. So I guess I'm asking you to bear with me if I say some things that don't make sense sometimes. Damn. Bear with him. He made a bear pun. He's the bear. He's on their side. That was a clue. Rantaro? Without looking back, Rantaro just waved his hand and left. In the end, I couldn't stop everyone from leaving the dining hall. Why won't anything, why won't anything go right? I just want to escape with everyone. So why is everything going wrong? I know the answer. It's Monokuma's fault. The one who's controlling him and planning the entire killing game, it's all their fault. Oh, okay, we're done. Alright. Well, let's talk to everybody. Maybe... Fight, Monokuma. That only choice we have. Gone to work hard for everyone. Sneak attack! Exactly. I will harness the power of Neo Akito for the sake of all girls. It's no use. I understand how you feel, but it's no use. There's no way for us to win in a fight. But... But, but, Gonta no can do anything else. Is troubling. However, is it wise to charge into a battle without a strategy? That's right. That's true. I get where Gonta's coming from, but we should calm down and th think this through. <laughs> okay. Hmm. That ultimate, that ultimate hunt that Rantaro mentioned, what do you suppose it is? Any theories, Katie? No. I don't know. It's the first time I've heard of it. I... It sounds so violent. It sounds like it involves us somehow. Well. No, disregard that. For now. Nobody has any clue what it could mean, so it is illogical to continue thinking about it. Our more pressing concern is the current predicament we find ourselves in. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Um. Hey, Sushi, what should we do right I'm... now? We need to move. Huh? Huh? Move? Like rooms, Sushi slowly approached me as if wary of his surroundings and said in a hushed voice, Well, that's... This morning, before I came to the dining hall, I noticed dust from the card reader on the floor. Huh? You mean, in the library? Uh, okay. Yes. So when he said we needed to move, he was probably hinting at something. If that's the case, then... Shuichi. Suichi, can I help you in any way? Uh, okay. Of course, Katie. But we should go. We shouldn't be talking in the open like What's this. What's the matter? What's up with you guys? What are you whispering about? Uh, We're not whispering. We're just gonna check on something. Hmm. And that thing you want to check is a secret? Um, so sorry, all I can say is yeah. he has a really huge... I haven't... Oh shit, I hit the button. So sorry, all I can say is I haven't given up. I'll show you guys that we can escape from this place. You can count on it. I see. Well, if that's how it is, then I'll believe you. Thanks. It's not like me to give up anyway. I've always believed that my wishes can come true if I just work hard enough. It's impossible. The mana in the air is thin today, so my magic isn't working well. I'll leave things to you. Damn. Ugh, How dare you stand male. so close to a girl? I will crush this degenerate male. Huh? huh? What's wrong with sushi standing so close That's to right. me? Everything. It starts with him just standing close to you, but I know the games these degenerates play. He'll try to get even closer to um, you. Uh, um, no, that won't happen. You're overthinking this a lot. No. No, men are vile, degenerate creatures. You must be careful around them. Mm. Sure. Well, let's 
coins, 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 coins. But... Sushi may have a plan. His title of Ultimate Detective is not just for show, it seems. If there's anything I can do to help, please let me know. I will support you both. I believe in you. If that's how it is, then I'll believe in you. I believe in that heart of yours that never gives up, all right? Yeah. Thanks, I guess. Okay, let's go down to the library, and if nothing big happens, then we'll probably call the stream there and, re and, and restart tomorrow. Quite over time. Are we heading to the library? I suppose so. Yes, I'll tell you everything there. Is that all right? Katie, we should go to the library. I'll tell you everything there. I want to buy some coins so I can give you a present. Soundtrack reminds me of Chrono Trigger a little bit. Kochiki says, hey, why is Kibo so shy, Katie? What? Kochiki says, because he has software and hardware, but no underwear. Oh. Uh, Action Cater uses 50 bits to say, sushi, put the dust in your mouth and identify the taste. Then go around and lick everyone's monopads and see which one tastes like it. Katie, dot, 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 sushi. Hey, you wanted to help. Yeah, I don't really understand what they think is going to happen in this room right now. I guess we're going to find out. Hey. All right. I'll explain everything. First, take a look at the card reader. As sushi said that, he moved the bookcase to reveal the hidden door. I wonder if his hat's supposed to be kind of like a Sherlock Holmesy hat. Looks nothing like it, but I, w I wonder if that's what it's meant to be. I peeked into the gap of the card reader. The dust is I... gone. That's right. I checked it right after nighttime started yesterday, and the dust was there. But this morning, it was gone. So that means someone entered this door during nighttime. Could it be? That got me thinking. This may sound far-fetched, but perhaps Monokuma's revival is related to this door somehow. Huh? How so? If I remember correctly. Remember what the Monocub said. This school has a machine somewhere that can make a whole lot of pops. Just activate that machine and you can have as many spare pops as you want. Hmm. Um, so there's a machine that can build spare Monokumas? Because. That would explain why we saw Monokuma alive and well in the morning. At nighttime, someone went through this door and activated the machine. And then there's what Monokuma just told us. Well, we can, you know, exclude the, the tennis ultimate tennis player because he can't reach the key card swiper. A time limit is now in effect. If a murder does not occur by nighttime two days from now, then every student forced to participate in this killing game will die. I knew it. The way he phrased it seemed peculiar. Why not just say everyone will die? He went out of his way to specify that students forced to participate will die. Um, huh? But why? That's true. My deduction is that one of us volunteered to participate and wasn't forced. That would mean they would have. That would mean that they would avoid execution without breaking any rules. I mean, why would he have to say that? Uh, perhaps that's why Monokuma said it that huh? way. Uh, it's just. It's kind of implied, isn't? I don't know. And, th and that person is the one in our group who's cooperating with Monokuma. That's I don't know if Monokuma is that strict with rules, but if he is trying to protect someone, that would imply that they're doing more than just cooperating with Monokuma. Huh? What? Because... I believe that if one of us can create spare Monokumas, they are the mastermind of this killing game. So then why would they want to imply... Why would they... Why would they say... In, include themselves in the hint? I don't understand. I don't know. So the person who's responsible for all of our suffering is one uh, of us. Okay. 
Of course, this is just what I've deduced, but it is, an entire, it is entirely possible. That's why I didn't want to talk about this in front of everyone. If we told them now, they might all try to find the mastermind and be led to murder. I'm... That's why I can only tell you, Katie. The mastermind, the one controlling Monokuma. It's me. I can't believe the person responsible for our suffering could be among us. It's hard to accept, but if it's true, I can't forgive them. Hey. Hey, hey. So what do you plan to do now, Sushi? We're gonna find this mastermind, right? I'm... I'm thinking of taking the risk, just before time expires. I believe the mastermind will come here just before time is up, and I can expose them. Huh? Wait, how do you know they'll come here right before the time's That's... up? I'm extrapolating from something Monokuma told us earlier. What if someone's deed? Mauled to shreds by countless Monokumas from the rumored Monokuma making machine. Hmm... To produce a large number of Monokumas, the Mastermind would have to come here. They would have to get into the hidden room to activate the machine. Well. Of course, none of this is certain. There's a chance the Mastermind won't show. Like I said, it's a risk. But, but I'm willing to take it. It's better than just, just sitting around waiting I to see. die. Yeah. All right. I'll take that risk with you. But... Ah, but Katie, this is just my deduction. It's possible that I'm wrong. Of course. Yeah, I know, but I've made up my mind. You told me about this, so that must mean you trust me, right, Sushi? Yeah. Then I'll trust you too. You know? I mean, I don't have a good idea of my own, obvious, so obviously I'll help you with yours. Mm-hmm. Okay then, let's expose the mastermind together, Sushi. Thank you. Thank you, Katie. You have a way of encouraging me. Mm. I never expected this to happen, though. I can't believe our enemy is within our group, hiding in plain sight. Okay. Yeah. Aww. Now that we know this, I should stop saying everyone needs to work together. But whoever the mastermind is, will expose them and help everyone else escape. And when this is all behind us, we're gonna stay good friends. That's a promise, okay? Uh, okay. Right. Good friends. Keep saying good friends. After re after we reapplied the dust to the card reader, I left sushi, and returned to my room. Free time. Two days from now, at the stroke of night time, that's when the timeline expires. Until then, I guess I'll check on the others. I'm a little worried about them. Free time! While at the academy, you will have free time every now and then. During free time, you can sp spend time with other students to strengthen your bond with them. You can also give them a present to strengthen those bonds further. You can buy presents at the school store or win them at the Mono Mono machine. If your bond gets strong enough, an intimate event might occur. Nice. Nice. But if you don't have free time, you don't have free time forever. Spending time with someone passes time. It's not free. So you can end free time. You can also end free time by going straight to bed. By yourself, that is. Ooh, I mean, I wouldn't skip it, but if you'd rather be alone, that's cool too. Alright. So that is the end of today's stream. Uh, is there any fan art anywhere we'd like to put, put on the screen? I, I haven't been reading chat much today, so I don't know if there is or not. Thank you, Rusherhead, for the new sub. Welcome to the rub dub Sub Club, Rusherhead. Thank you so much. Do I want a video of someone being the escape in the game? No, I'd like to try myself and see how far I can get another time. So what's going to be scheduled for this game going forward? Um, probably... We're going to stick with two two to seven for now. We're going to stick with five hour streams for now. Um, but uh, if I need more time, I might push it earlier and start, uh, start at uh, noon Eastern instead of 1 p.m. Eastern. And I, I wouldn't be adverse to going a little later to get to get the game done sooner either. But we'll see. For now, at least for the next stream, we're going to stick from, from uh, 1 p.m. Eastern to, to 6 p.m. Eastern. Or two to seven my time. Yeah, thank you again, uh, Rush Your Head, for the new sub. Thank you, Nadud, you know, you know, Nadudni, you know, Nadudno. Sorry, I'm saying your name completely wrong. Welcome, to Prime Time. Thank you so much. Action Cater, you supposed to have fun with it tomorrow. Hopefully, I'll have, I'll have. Sorry, hopefully, I'll make it to catch the trial at the very least. And have fun, Shakira. Shakira. Melivis has resubscribed for six months. Oh boy, half a month. 
Can't wait to watch the VOD later. I want to note that the, the graphic design in this one is a huge step up from last. Yeah, it is, it is pretty good. It still feels like the, the, the first two, though, so that's pretty good. Yeah, I like that. Am I streaming tomorrow? Yes. Yep. Yep, stream tomorrow. I think you meant half a year, right? Six months was half a year? Melodies? Thank you so much. Oh, damn. This is this this is just Joe, Joe Bait right here. This is Joe Bait. I put this one up on the screen already, Lucid. Okay, so first we have this one. 20 minutes into Netflix and chill and she gives you this look. <laughs> that is quite, quite possibly the best face in the entire series so far. It's just such a fucked up expression. <laughs> And here's uh and here's Joe Bate from Merrick. The ultimate. But let me tell you, this this one this one deserves big treatment. The ultimate. To be. Pretty good. Mama. Thank you, Merrick. Okay, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Uh, we'll continue tomorrow, 2 p.m. Eastern. Um, hopefully we get we get to uh, a murder and maybe a trial. We'll see. I, I, again, I don't know anything, so I don't know how many trials there are in this game. I don't know if there's... I'm assuming that there's going to be a murder and the bear's going to be like, yeah, fuck your first blood perk. We're, we're just going to do it. I don't know. Maybe two people will die and he'll be like, sorry, but it only counted for the first one or something like that. I don't know. Not sure. Yeah. Anyway, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Have a good one. Hope you guys like the, the YouTube video as well. I haven't seen much feedback on it yet. Have a good night and happy Halloween.